Hey everybody, a couple weeks later, we're playing some more Pokemon. So, um, yeah, so we're in the Kalos Power Plant. I just assumed it was like the Kanto Power Place where there was like a bunch of Voltorb and, uh, um, whatever the other one. Knock knock, who's there? Who, knock knock, who you? Knock knock, not you, me? Seriously though, who are you? Only author has prison all allowed in here. Alright, bud. By Team Flare Grunt Scraggy. That shouldn't be too hard to beat. And I, again, I haven't played in a little hot minute. What? What level are we at? 32? Okay, oh, we're still good. I just hit him with a Brian. Oh, also neglected to switch over to my silent keyboard, the one that I use for recording. Let's go ahead and do that. Like I said, it's been a little while. Oh, it's not plugged in. Okay. Um, oh, we'll keep battling here. Ah, there you are, bud. Okay. Alright, we are plugged and ready to go here. Let's go ahead and hit him with a surf. Bing bong. Why am I on Google Maps? Oh, I went to Panda Express, Charlie. That's why I'm on Google Maps. Alright. I'll ask you again, just who are you? I am David? Thank you. Who do you think you are? Team player is busy redirecting the power that's supposed to go to the Limoway City. Don't get in our way. Don't tell me what to do, bud. I'll do whatever I want. Alright, so there's another Liddy Flare person there. What if I go in here? What's in here? What do you mean you're here to rescue us? You're just a kit. Bro. Uh, they blast that blast team flare. They've come for the sole purpose of stealing the electricity. Um. Um, sure. Alright. We got some fresh water. I'll hide here. And he got stuck. A zap plate. Okay, if we ever get a strong electric Pokemon, I can put that on that. Um, okay, you guys all suck. Like, don't you have your Pokemon of your own? Like, what's what's the deal here, man? Are you trying to play us for a full kid? You don't seriously think you can burn Junior or take us on all by yourself, do you? I sure do, bud. I mean, you guys just have a bunch of scrag scraggies and stuff on you. Like, I I don't I don't really see where where the problem is here. All right, let's go ahead with another surf. Oh yeah, okay. Once again, it's um, finally got a little bit of time off school, so that's, that's why I'm here. But that also means it's a little late at night, so I'm a little tired. So you'll see me yawning a bit, but we, we be here to game, so here we go. Try to squeeze in a few hours, or one hour, or maybe I'll pass out in the middle of this and call it 20 minutes, we'll see. I can't believe I lost to some little kid. I must look like such a fool. Well, maybe if you sucked a little less. Alright, let's keep going. Also, your hair is stupid. Hey, stop right there, intruder. I'll warn you. I can be persistent. Ah, the, the power of persistence. The strongest power of all. Alright, see, so you've got like a cooler Pokemon. You got a Mighty Enna. I mean, even that Pokemon's not really that cool, but it's better than, like, a Scraggy, dude. And you're gonna get Surf either way. By a shiny psychic starfish. Human-sized shiny starfish. Alright, starting with level 46. Oh, I lost on purpose. Yeah, sure you did. We all say that when we lose. Now I'm mad. I told you I was persistent. I refuse to budge from the spot. Not an inch. Really? Alright. I'll go around, I guess. Oh, I sure do love me some good happenings. I love the feeling of accomplishment that comes with overcoming a challenge. Well. Eh. Bad place to try to overcome a challenge there, bud. Okay, once again. Shiny Starfish. I'm gonna use a Swift. 
I don't think Swift will kill the Scraggy. Why don't we give it a try, huh? Yeah. I assumed it wouldn't. I need a, I really need to get a better move in that slot. But I don't have any TMs that are any good right now. Yeah. Oh, um, no, we'll keep starting me out. Okay, um... Oh, I tried to hit Surf there. That's alright. Wing attack. Well, we might as well just use another Swift, because it's going to kill either way, right? Oh, he didn't die? Did I get left with, like, 2%? Oh, wowzers. Okay, well... That's alright, I just made it a little longer than it should have been, but... Alright. Gimme that shmoney. Also, I like the sound of that floor, it's a real, like... You know what I'm saying? Like, you can tell some, like, high-quality metal, dude. Just boom, 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 boom. I quite enjoy buildings with strong st structural foundations and strong metals. Alright, I'm going to surf on it. Ugh, man, oh man. No, we'll keep the same one open. Alright, bing bong. Another flare down. Oh, the future doesn't look bright for me. I wonder something about his glasses? Bro, you need to get your eyes checked. Also, this is like a pretty cool facility, but where's all the energy being made? You You've got like this gigantic area of like metal, but like where's the energy, dude? Where's the machinery? <laughs> A lot. Alright, we'll go surf. That's pretty cool, though. Whoa, I didn't die! What in the world? Now I'm poisoned? That wasn't very nice. Alright, well, we'll finish you off with the Swift, and then we gotta unpoison us. Alright. Level 47, here we go. Go, Team Flare. Alright, we got 1360. Um, oh, I should unpoison. You know what, that's fine. Stormy will actually survive with low health. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Alright, Team Rocket Grunt, you got another swallow out for me? What do you got for me? Ooh, yeah! Well, that's a cool Pokemon. Another one we haven't really seen. Oh, it's another Swalot. Okay. Let's go to Switch to Greninja here. Ooh, a little voice crack. Alright, Greninja will be able to take care of this a little bit more easily. Um, uh, yeah, just going to do a surf. Alright, there we go. I only succeeded in hurting my Pokemon. Well, then maybe you should stop. That would be kind of cash money. There's a lot of grunts in here, ain't, ain't there? You'll not get past me. My pride this is enough to keep you at bay. Alright. <sighs> let's, let's give it a try here. Um, we could probably go and do a rock gym on this. Why not? 
not very effective. Well, that was my bad. Ooh, that also probably hurt a little bit. All right, let's throw on a swift here. Hard. All right, let's go and throw out a swift here. Scraggy. Okay, we can we can we can be the strip Scraggy. But now, do I keep using my surfs? Well, I'm gonna use another rock gem here. I know it's not effective against a Koga. Is it not effective against Scraggy? Well, that sucks. Oh! That hurt. Thank you, Ninja. I did not realize. Ooh, and I'm just like scrolling through my Twitter, and there's a new Pokemon reveal. Let me see a Wiglet. Oh. So it's like a skinnier white Diglet. Losing to you doesn't mean anything. My pride remains unscathed. Well, that's good. That's good. I mean... Fair enough, I guess. Alright, so is this... Okay. Alright, where are we at? What are we, what are we doing in all of this? What's going on here? How much longer? If you're just interested in the facts, I'd say we already have enough energy to power the device. Good, let's finish up here and move out. There's still more work to be done. What other work do you mean? Perhaps you mean taking out that annoying little Pokemon trainer over there? What's this? I don't think anyone remained here after we dealt with the workers. Alright. You're challenged by Team Flare Admin. Alright. Seems like if you're an admin, you need to be bald. Is that like part of the contract? And you only have a single Pokemon that I'm definitely gonna surf upon? Sounds like a bad idea to me, bud. Easy. He's beating on his bald head. My, if my analysis is correct, and it always is, this battle is 100% a failure on my part. Ah, well, I'm glad he recognizes it. That's the most important part, right? Scientist, take care of this pesky intruder. Ha ha, it would be my pleasure. M and allow me to introduce myself. My name is Aliana. As you can see, I'm one of the Team Flare scientists. I'm researching a certain something that you wouldn't understand anyway. Unfortunately for you, been charged with the simple task of your elimination. I, Team Flare Aliana. Dude, again, just with a single Pokemon? Like, I mean, like, hey, more than happy, actually. I love single Pokemon. It means I can get the, the battle done quicker, but how are you an admin and you only have a single Pokemon? Alright, I'm gonna surf upon you. There we go. You're quite strong. Oh, very strong indeed. And we received a easy 5k for it. Ah, well, I certainly didn't expect you to be so interesting. I do hope we can meet again. So what was that whole task of getting rid of me? That just, like, didn't happen. So that was wonderful. Oh, my. Cool masks. We chased off that mysterious bunt before we could even get here? Well, I guess there's always room for more defenders of Kalos. Let me heal your Pokemon as a thanks. You and your Pokemon are the ultimate team, no doubt about it. But don't push yourself too hard. Here, take these. Alright. Hey, actually, I need those. Thank you. So I'm not buying them. Thanks to you, the power is back on in Limoe, Limoe City. Now people can pass through the gate connecting Route 13. Well, I think us mysterious people will be off now. I leave before being left, I decide. Uh, au revoir. 
Oh, I said us mysterious people. Uh, like, yes, that's your name. You, you mysterious people. All right. Well, anyway. So we turn the power back on, and apparently now we can use Route 13 to get back to where we need to go. What is this area? I did. What is this? Hold on. Where did the guy go? Oh, he just disappeared. Okay, I'm like, sorry, I was... I, with the guy being gone, I like didn't recognize that area for me. I'm like, where is... Everyone? What's going on? I think we're chilling, though. Okay, um... Now, question. I caught everything on Route 13, right? I'm trying to, like, double check. I think... Yes, I did. I don't, I don't remember what I did and didn't do last episode. I think I, yeah, because I caught the Graveler and the Slugma, so we're good. Okay, so we just need to go down here. Well, the folks at the Kalos Power Plant on vacation or something? Mysterious person. Indeed, the Pokemon, the flower Pokemon. The Pokemon that was given eternal life. Stop talking to yourself, weirdo. What what is wrong with you? Um yes, I would like to use sm rock smash. If you're gonna talk to someone, just talk to someone. If you're not gonna talk to someone, then don't talk out loud. That's weird. Alright, Graveler. We could have used your last episode, bud, but you're a little late to the party. Let's go ahead and give up. Do the dash real quick. I'm just trying to get to that item, you feel? Alright. Rock smash. Another encounter. Because, of course. I mean, I would take a Graveler if he was, uh. Maybe. Shiny. But sadly, you are not a big gold rock. You are just a normal, dusty old rock. So I don't need you. Alright, hey, rare candies, we take those. I learned my lesson, and in Pokemon Leaf Green, I always, like, said, like, I don't need these rare candies, like, I'll just level up, whatever, like, it's not a big deal. But actually, once I got to, like, level, like, 92, 93, dude, I needed those rare candies bad, because leveling up from, like, 96 to 97 is just brutal. It just doesn't feel like Limoway City when the tower isn't lit up. I heard that Clement was um okay. So what does this do? Oh, it takes us to the city. Yo, Big D. I ran after you like crazy when I spotted you up ahead. You know what? I heard the power is back here on, uh, in Limoway Limoway Limoway. Some really bad people were stealing electricity from the Cowboys power plant, and then somebody came and stopped them. No one knows who, but they must be pretty awesome. Who do you think it was? Eh. I guess there's someone else out there as strong as you, Big D. And get this. They're gonna light the tower. Let's go see it, Big D. It's the Luma Oasis City's most famous site. This way, straight ahead, you'll run smack into the prison tower. Question, can I go anywhere else? I'm guessing she's gonna stop me, right? Hey, let's go see. Okay, yeah, so I can't do anything. I need to go straight forward here. Okay. I'm rolling, I'm rolling. The Flaming Red Cafe is perfect for hot young stars like us. We're ready to bloom when we're having lively debates on how to make better tomorrow. So bitter, so dark. They're doing it right. Espresso is the oil that keeps our gears running smoothly. Okay, bud. Good timing, they're just about to turn on the lights. Look, it's Clement. He's Limoase's city gym leader. He's also good at inventing things and he makes all kinds of devices. Those two are my friends. Aren't you done yet? Not quite. I just have to check on the light lighting circuit here. Oh, Shauna! And you are a challenger? Sorry, but could you wait a moment? 
Come on, Clement. All right, everything's ready. The future is now, thanks to science. Prism Tower Lighting System Activate. Ah. Bink, 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 bink. Isn't this just like off-brand tower with tower pairs? The Eiffel Tower? Tower Paris. The Eiffel Tower. Jeez. I think you call this feeling being entranced, right? Now, I have another great memory with you, Big D. Excellent. My prism tower lighting system worked brilliantly, just like all my inventions. Yeah, right. Whatever. There are challenges waiting for you, you know. Prism Tower itself is Limoasis City's Pokemon gem. Clement's invention is sure amazing, right? He gave me one that solves puzzles, but I always feel like a shame to use it, so I haven't yet. Go, oh, good luck at the gym. Okay, so I'm guessing it's an electric type gym, right? That would make sense. Okay, so is there anything I can actually like do over here? Okay, well I guess let's just go in and we could just let's just do the we'll, we'll, we'll find the rest of the town first. Let's just get rid of the gym. Okay. What's cooking? Good looking, my future champ back for more. The Pokemon gym here in Limoe City is just full of electric tech trainers. You can feel the buzz, am I right? It's also known as a quiz gym. You're looking at um my quizzical friend. You know why that's called that? How you'll find in okay. You're boring. Stop talking. So, what's the deal here? Ooh, that's the way out. I don't wanna I don't wanna go out. Electric type Pokemon don't have many weaknesses. Okay, this oh those are all the ways out. To actually go down, we need to go down here. Okay. I'm like, huh? What is going on? Oh, you're the trainer from before. Come straight into battle, have you? Well good, you can call me Bonnie. I'm this gym leader's younger sister. Go ahead and step on that small square a few steps to ahead uh, ahead of you, would ya? You'll have to answer my questions if you want to get farther ahead. Quiz time. Who's... Okay. It's obviously Pikachu. Oh, okay. Pikachu. I chose Pikachu. Oh, I still have to fight him. What is this? It's a quiz, Jim, but I still have to fight... I still get punished? Don't punish me. I picked the right answer. Alright, that's fine. Did Dene. You're about to get Brian, bud. Brian is enough, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, and it was a crit, too. Good, good. Alright, level 48 on the Starmie. You and your Pokemon have what it takes to get to the top. Then step into the elevator. Can I not fight the other guys? Very nice. Yeah, of course that was Pikachu. Come on. Ding, ding, ding. You're correct. Well, aren't you a clever one? Yeah, that one was a little too easy. Come on, bud. I, I would actually like if they made it, like, actually hard. Because I don't want to, you know. Quiz time. Oh, that's Fletchling. Yeah, that's Fletchling. Okay. It's not very hard, are you? Bird Pokemon. Their silhouettes are sure to come in different shapes. But if... You think it's Fletchling, don't you? Yeah, because it is Fletchling. Okay, but this is still a Pokemon gym. It wouldn't be right if we didn't fight. Alright. Challenged by Rising Star Estelle. With a Raichu. That's pretty cool. Taking me back to the Lieutenant Surge days, huh? Alright, well, I'm gonna be surfing upon you. Ooh. Maybe with a little quick attack, huh? Not very strong, though. Yeah, there goes Raichu. Oh boy, that was easy. Alright. I hope this experience will help you grow even stronger. I mean, it did, technically. Then step into the elevator. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm gonna look real dumb if I got that wrong. 
Yes, of course it's Fletchling. Ding, 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 you're correct, aren't you a clever one? Alright, next one. This is fun, I like this. I, li I like these quiz ones. Um, ooh. That's Pan Poor. Right? Oh. It's not Pan Seer. It's either Pan Sage or Pan Poor. It might be Pan Sage. I want to Google it so bad. I want to Google it so bad. I'm pretty sure it's actually Pan Sage. Yeah, I'm going to take it. I, I think it's Pan Sage, actually. Yes. It's got to be Pan Sage. All right, Mathis. And I'm guessing if we get it wrong, we just have to fight another guy, which is completely fine with me, to be honest. I'm pretty sure it's Pan Sage. But my first initial thought was Pan Poor. So, oh, that's not very good. So I don't know. Not gonna lie, usually when I think of something, the first thing I think is usually right. That's usually how it is on exams too. If I get one answer with a gut feeling, it's usually that one. If I change it, I usually actually get it wrong. So I have a feeling that it might have actually been pan poor. And I might have just switched my answer for no reason. Um, but we're gonna see right now, actually. Alright, what a strange trainer you are. Alright, let's take a look. Did I get it right? Is it is it Pan Sage, not Pan Poor? I knew it! I should always go with my first gut feeling. I always should go with my gut feeling. Wait, which one is... Yes, that's, of course it's Pan Poor. Okay, yes, I, I'm so mad at myself too. Because I remember thinking the little thing on top of his head looks like a, like a fountain. Pan Poor. Why do I second guess myself? I, I literally said over and over, it's Pan Poor, and then I fixed Pan Sage. All right, that's fine. If anything, hey, we get a little bit more of that sh money, so I ain't worried about it. But hey, that's a lesson to everyone. Usually, your first gut feeling is probably correct. Oh no! Ah, I hit myself. Oh, this is gonna hurt. All right, come on. Star me, please. You butt cheek. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, there goes Star me. Um, all right, Greninja. Let's see what you can do there. Let's actually do a quick attack just so we don't have to deal with it. Alright, Rico. 7k. I feel like I should almost be fighting every single one of them, but I don't want to. I know this one's right. Yeah, yeah, it's Pan. It was Pan. Pan 4. Ding, ding, ding. Yeah, because the stupid thing looks like a, like a well on its head, so I knew that one. Let's go ahead and revive Starmie here. Alright. Well, I asked for a harder one. That was a harder one. Quiz time. Okay. Oh, that's Butterfree. Okay, that one's not hard. Butterfree and Vivillion. Butterfree, Vivillion, Mothim. Oh, it's number two. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna pick number two. Let's see if you were right. I, again, I feel like I should almost fight the other ones. Because they're like easy money, but like I just also don't feel like doing it, so. Alright, plus one. And I actually have a, I have a pretty good 
stack of Pokeballs on me. I don't really need, I don't need the money that bad. Let's go ahead, go ahead and hit plus a little, little bit of brine. A little bit of that pickle juice. Oh, I didn't die. That was my mistake. Oh, uh, let's hit it with a swift. Oh, yeah. Oof. Oh, that hurt a little bit. I gotta be careful when I'm yawning, man. I like random pains in my head and lungs. Why did- Oh, you heal? That's annoying. Um... Yeah, I should probably get that checked out. Um... Okay. Defeated Liddy. Oh, aren't you and your Pokemon just the best of partners? You sure are. Then step into the elevator. Me and uh, Starmie looked for each other for like 12 hours, so. Ding, ding, ding. Yup. Yup. Ding, ding, ding. You're correct, aren't you? A clever one. Alright. What? How's Starmie doing? Let's go ahead and give Starmie a hyper potion here. And we're actually gonna let's see. I didn't get any new TMs, have I? Is there anything that I can give to Starmie that is better than Swift? Protect? No. Rest? No. Thunder Wave? No. Flash? No. Gyro Ball is not really any good. I guess there's literally nothing. Really, not even Charge Beam? Okay. Well, guys, we're actually going to call it an episode here. It's a little bit of a short one, but um, we'll fight this next time. Hey, everybody. We're playing some Pokemon again. We're here at um, the gym. going to fight Clement, so let's go ahead and do that. I've, well, I wonder if we'll have to fight the little sister first, or... Oh, thank you again for coming. Allow me to introduce myself. This is the gym leader of Livingway City, Clement. You better watch out, my brother's strong as you strong as you'd expect a Limoway City gym leader to be, got it? Bonnie, how many times do I have to remind you? It's my own strength that it's not my own strength that matters, nor any other trainers. None of us would be here if it weren't for our Pokemon. I know. Anyway, I hope you two have an awesome battle. She's right about that, at least. Let's both do our best in battle. Alright. Clement. What you got? Give me something good, huh? Alright, Pachirisu. Um... Well, I guess it's the final battle. Let's go ahead and surf him out. We'll just surf every single Pokemon here. Shouldn't be that bad. Alright, level 49. Alright, and... Ooh, Magneton. That's a cool one. That's kind of what I was expecting the power plant to be full of, but apparently not. Ooh, it has 30. Okay. Okay, well that was a little useless, because now I'm going to... Oh, you butt cheek. I probably could have killed it with a Surf if I would have just used Surf, but Swift is definitely not going to kill it. Dang it, you... Alright, you escaped this time from instant death, but... We're sorry. Alright, what's your last Pokemon, Clement? Ooh, Heliolisk. That is a cool one. Indeed it is. But not cool enough. Oh no. I can't use water against it. Oh, okay. How about rock gem? That's not good. Sheesh. All right. Not gonna lie. Starmie got Shrek. Probably because I didn't have any other Pokemon moves that aren't water that are good. But yeah, Starmie got a little Shrek there, to be honest. Alright, let's give it extra sensory here. And we'll be fine. Your passion for battle inspires me. 
Easy 11k. My brother, you lost? Oh, Bonnie, when will you learn there's no shame in losing? I'm glad whenever I get to learn something new thanks to strong challengers like this boy here. Now, to the victor go the spoils. This voltage badge belongs to you. Alright, if you have a voltage badge, you will be seen as a friend and equal by any Pokemon up to level 70. And here, take this as well. It's TM Thunderbolt. It's a power of 90 and an accuracy of 100%. It'll never miss. It's a really popular electric move because of that. I wonder if I can put that on Starmie. Now that would be epic. Oh, Bonnie. The future is now thanks to science. Behold the machines that gives technical machines. I just wanted to be able to say it, okay? At least once. Look, I'm not... It's not like I'm trying to make myself stronger. I'm trying to... All I'm trying to do is enjoy every day to the fullest of my Pokemon while doing the science that I that I love with my inventing. Alright, can Thunder be put? It can. Alright, well, it's going straight on Starmie. Yes. Alright, we're getting rid of Swift. Swift is 60, Power Gym is 80. Okay. Well, Thunder is also supposed to never miss, so. Alright, we got Thunderbolt. Wait, can I teach you multiple times? What? Why did I assume that it can only be learned once? Well, I don't know why I assumed that. Did they change that in this game? Why did I assume things could only be learned once? Okay, I mean, fair enough, I guess. What floor would you like to go to? Can I, like, beat the rest of the trainers? For, like, money? I don't know. Actually, no, I can't. Alright, well, now it's time to explore the rest of the city. Hello there. <laughs> Hello there. I wanted to talk to you for a little bit. Could you come to Lissandre Cafe? Do you know where it is? You can see it from outside the Pokemon Center, right by Prism Tower. It's the Red Cafe. Just hop in a taxi if you can't find it. Be there soon. Okay. So can I go to like all parts of the city now? Yeah, like can I go to like all parts of it? Cafe Kazoon. See, now I feel like I need to go inside of every single place and explore it. Um, okay. Any of, you, any of you give me items? That's kind of what I'm looking for here. Um, okay, I can't buy anything from the cafe. Yeah, that's a really boring cafe. I don't know what you do, but I should probably check what's in here, too. While I'm at it. Um, okay, we can only dine in here if we're a champion. That's gotta be sexist somehow okay mm. okay now here's my question there's ooh, ooh. wait what's in here is this a museum mm. yes yeah, sure, I'd like to enter. Sure, why not? Let's go see what's up. Oh, where's my phone at? So, is this just art? Do we... Bench. Alright, take this. Hey, Dragon Tail. Okay. Look, it's something. Okay. Excuse me, sir. You need to return the audio guide. Sure. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, let's keep moving on. This is just the Pokemon Center, right? Yeah. 
Okay, let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon. Uh, I should probably text this back. Max repels. I should probably get... Oh, I already have 10. Okay. Okay. What about you? Can I buy anything from you? Heat ball. Oh, heal ball. I don't really need that. Uh, how many of these do I have? Buy another 10 of these. Okay, that's fine. Net balls are useful because they can be used for like fish and birds and other stuff, but uh, you know, that's the only reason I really bought it. Alright, uh, can I, hey, okay, wow, this camera is extremely confusing. Oh, um, yeah, let's go to, let's go, yeah, let's go there, just so I don't have to find it myself. an expensive fare, by the way. Over here. Ooh, best theme in the game, or ever. I was just having a conversation with Lissandra. Lissandre? About Mega Evolution. I would like to congratulate you as well. Mega Evolution is something I, too, would like to be able to use. Actually, Lissandre himself is, a, is of royal ancestry. He truly is a chosen one. True, I'm a descendant of the king's younger brother. That being said, the story is 3,000 years old, so it might not be entirely reliable. By the way, David, do you know where the hollow caster is made? That's right, they made it in Lissandre's lab. Lissandre is a good man. He supports trainers and Pokemon research, but some of the profit from the hollow caster. People can be divided into two groups. Those who give, and those who take. It just as how the Kalos's region 2 legendary Pokemon give life and took life. I want to be the kind of person who gives. But in this world, some foolish humans exist who would, would show their strength by taking what isn't theirs. Their filth. Long, long ago, the King of Kalos sought to take everything for his own, and he created a terrible weapon. Then, the fire of destruction was unleashed. That is the legend that has been passed down. Kalos is beautiful right now. There will be no foolish actions if the number... There will be no foolish actions if the number of people in Pokemon do not increase. That being said, the future isn't decided. You can't be sure each day will be like the one before. What the King of Kalos did was re reprehensible, but the ultimate weapon did manage to wash the world of that era's filth. Ooh, King's Rock. Okay, we can evolve Slowbro with that. Or the Toad. Thank you for listening. Take that as an apology for my taking up your time. Alright, he's got the Team Flare haircut, so... What a passionate person, he's just like a blazing flame. Perhaps his pride in his lineage is what makes him burn so intensely. That being said, what Lissandre said is only one way of looking at things. It's not necessarily the truth. David, what's truly important is that the time you spend together with others, treasure those moments spent traveling the Kalos region with your Pokemon. So you wanted me to come here just for that? All right, dude, you're nuts. Um, can you give me something? What about you two? Okay, that was a waste of time. Hello, how have you been? I just wanted to let you know we're going to meet on Route 14. Please come and join us. Okay, so. We're looking for Route 14, you say? Alright. I don't know which... Okay, oh, there's literally a big number. So, that's 13. Skiddo. I think the one coming up next is 5. Pass it. I literally just straight up passed it. I'm an absolute genius. Um, kind of wanted to talk to that man right there. Hello, Big D. You arrived very quickly. I sure did. 
Why, Big D? We we're just comparing how to how complete our Pokedexes are. I won, of course. I'll leave filling up the Pokedex to you guys, Trevor. I don't like it when everyone does the same thing anyway. Big D, let's compare how many Pokemon we've seen, just like we always do. This time, let's compare how many Pokemon we've seen in the Mountain Kalos decks. To put it another way, I'm challenging you to my own kind of Pokemon battle. So you've seen 11? I lost, how frustrating. Also, you've seen Gibble too, Big D? You know, you knowing about the same Pokemon as someone else can sure make you happy. There sure are many different kinds of Pokemon in Kalos. Now it's my turn. Let's have a Pokemon battle. I. All right, Serena, you trying to have a battle, my boy? All right, let's see what you got. Ooh, a meow stick. Oh, we try our new. Ooh, that's not very nice of you. Let's try our Thunderbolt. We haven't did this yet. Oh, we didn't kill it. That's a shame. Okay. Increase special defense. I'm gonna hit it with a Surf here. Wow, that's... A that's a very strong uh, a special defense. Alright. It actually took two hits from me to kill it, which is actually pretty nuts. So I know th the game really wanted us to use like a fighting type there, but... Psst, chestnut. Okay, grass type. It's gonna be a little harder. Um, so Surf is not gonna be effective. So let's go use a Thunderbolt again. That didn't... Okay, this is going to be a little hard, actually. Let's try to surf and see what we can do here. Okay, literally nothing. Alright, we might have some... We might have some issues. This is actually... Well, I know they had a light screen on, too, which lowered stuff, but that is very, very high. Alright, let's use extra sensory and it should be good. Yeah, there we go. Alright, Greninja to 56. Wants to learn Haze? Um, oh, no, I don't want to learn that. No, we're gonna keep the old moves. Alright, Absol. We'll keep Greninja in because Greninja's absolutely goaded. I really wish I had... Oh. I need Psychic. I need to put Psychic on Starmie. That's when Starmie gets really, really good, when you give it Psychic. But I don't have the TM for it yet. I don't know when I'm getting it either, so I'm not gonna... I'm too lazy to Google it. But hopefully I get it pretty soon here. I really enjoy battling with you, but I'm getting tired of losing every time. Well, then maybe you should stop sucking. Wow, that was a really intense battle. Oh, hi, Shauna. When did you start watching? So, where is Tierney? Except the fighting dojo. Really? Sorry I'm late, everyone. I was having so much fun with the sparring dance that I totally lost track of time. So, have you found any good Pokemon for your dance team? Yep, I sure did. I'm super close to my ideal dance team. That's great. Good for you. Let's go to the scary house. Go in by Lever Le Lever's city? That's just a rumor, isn't it? Come on, let's go find out if the rumor's true together. I don't think I'll pass. I'm sure it's just a rumor. I want to spend my time with my Pokemon before heading to Lever city. Uh, okay, bye. So, is it really that scary? Let's go see for ourselves. There's always some reason rumors like that get started very facts that's big true sigh why are you traveling David everyone is working really hard at what they want to do but I'm just all about the memories I'm just kind of goofing around just kidding okay yeah that didn't sound like you were kidding so all right well I'm here for the Pokemon so that's my answer all right what are okay that's just a play escape Alright, Route 14. Do we got trainers here? 
We got a lot of trainers. Holy. Okay. Well, there's a couple of Pokemon that I need to catch. So, we'll catch them while we're here. Alright, we got Shelmet, which is actually one of the 10%, which is pretty good. Oh, I totally forgot that I had Ducklet, or that my Starmie was dead. Well, that's actually fine. We can... Oh, you butt cheek. I was like, we actually need to get Shelmet down low anyway, so you know what? Let's keep Ducklet out. Dude! Okay. You miss and then you protect. Just stop, dude. Yeah. Dude. Wait. Okay, I was like, just stop. Oh. Wow, shall my like one of the most annoying Pokemon I've ever seen. It, it it avoids an attack, then it protects itself twice, then it used Giga Drain, and now it protected itself a third time, dude. Just, just stop, dude. Why are you being so difficult? Now you're gonna put me to sleep, huh? Alright, well I'm throwing a nest ball. Yes. You're a water type. Oh, it's a bug. Oh, but nest balls work for bugs too, actually. I think. Double check that for me. Alright, well, we got Shelmet. As you can tell, I'm going lower and lower in my chair as we go through that episode. When it and Kara Blast are together and, and both receive electrical stimulation, they both evolve. Okay. That's pretty cool. Alright, what else can we find? A Quagsire? Okay. Do I, yeah, okay, I'm like, I have I don't have a Quagsire, right? I'm not I'm not like tripping. Let's go into air slash it here. Is it oh okay, well it flinched. We just need to get it to yellow to be honest. I don't really care if it doesn't do a lot. Alright, there we go. Now it's at yellow. TBH? That's all I needed. Let's go ahead and use another netball. We bought them, so like, might as well use them, right? That's like the point of buying them. One. There you go. Two critical catches in a row. And we got Quagsire. It has a sluggish nature. It lies at the river's bottom waiting for prey to stray into its mouth. Okay. Bro, we're gonna run out of box space. Look what I found. It's a trainer. Yeah, like I'm gonna run out of box space. We're already at box five. And we're like... I think we're like halfway through the game, right? Like, just like the normal game, we're about halfway, I would think. Oh, wait a minute. I totally forgot. I... Ducklet is not a, is not a battling Pokemon, so... Let's go ahead and grab Greninja back out. Alright, uh, Surf. Let's Surf it up! Oh, yeah. Well, no, 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 no. And then we do need to s revive our Starmie a little bit. Ooh, Pyroar. It's actually a perfect one because I've got Surf on me. your eyes peeling you'll never know what you'll find okay I'm guessing she's telling me to look in the swamp real good but okay. and ooh. okay oh okay there's gonna be Pokemon in the water too Okay, I have to keep that in mind. 
Um. Will I kill the Stunfisk with a Power Gem? I didn't think I would. I also thought I would maybe do slightly more than that. Um. Alright, let's just throw one Ultra Ball and just see if we can actually hit it. And then, um, if not, we're that's fine. You butt cheek, dude. Why? Ugh. I hate it when they do that with the three balls. Just the three shakes. Just stay, dude. All right, there we go. All right. At least it stayed in that second. I was about to actually kind of have a fit. Cause that's happened like abnormally. Its skin is very hard, so it is unhurt even if stepped on by sumo wrestlers. It smiles when transmitting electricity. Well, that's good. At least it's happy. I guess that's the important part, right? Ooh, a big mushroom. I'm sure the one mushroom guy will love that. Alright, let's see what can we get. Gloomy? Ooh, a quagsire. We already got one of those. We don't need that. Yeah, let's go ahead and just uh, dip ski because that's not something we need. Oops. Okay, I can even get here? Alright. We don't need you. Ooh. Okay. Um, see, I almost feel like I should go back to the grass. But why are the past four Pokemon ones I've already caught, dude? They're, they're still Haunter and Gumi and Carablast and Skorupi and Carnivine and Weepin' Bell. There's all of those Pokemon, but we keep getting the four that we've already gotten. Come on, man. Alright, there's the Skorupi, the Poison Bug Pokemon. Um, we're gonna follow the same, we're just gonna throw a net ball and hopefully just crit catch it and call it a day. Por favor. That's pretty epic. Skorupi was caught. It grips prey with its tail claws and injects poison. It tenaciously hangs on until the poison takes. Alright. Straight to box five you go. Alright, let's see if we can catch a few more Pokemon before we end the episode. We'll probably have to um, catch the last one or two next episode. Really, the one that I really want to try to get to is Degumi. I want to make sure to try to catch Gumi and maybe Carnivine this episode. Alright, there's the Haunter, which is actually the 5%, which is the rare spawn, so that's actually really good. We got the rare spawn. Um. Yeah. Okay. Ultra Balls are a go. One. Okay. Well, we're just going to keep throwing them, to be honest. Wub, 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 wub. Yeah. The Starmie will probably end up dying. That's okay. Let's go, dude. Alright, Haunter was caught. Alright, we got the 5% out of the way. Pretty, pretty cool. You get the feeling of being watched in darkness when nobody's around. Hunter is there. Alright. Hyper Potion time. Skirt. Okay. Try to find one or two more. 
Let's see, hordes. We can find. Oh, that was a. That was funny. I literally just said hordes, and then I got a horde. Well, luckily I don't need Skaroopy, so we're gonna. Oh, why didn't I just surf him? I should have surfed for the XP there, but that's fine. And of course, now we gotta remember that we have the good rod and the old rod. So we definitely need to make like use of those. Hey, Quagsire, go away, you butt. I already have you. I need something else. Let's see. Do I, can I get anything? Hey, Gumi, that's actually what I was looking for. Very nice. All right, Goober. I'm gonna throw Ultra Balls at you. Keep throwing balls until it works, because I just don't feel like hitting you, to be honest. Hey! There we go. I usually say hey, and then it escapes out of the third, but luckily we don't have to deal with that. The weakest Dragon-type Pokemon... The weakest? It lives in damn shitty places, so its body doesn't dry out. What? Yo, that's some shade. The weakest Dragon-type Pokemon. Wow, okay. That was, like, mean. Why would you say something like that? Alright, Bellsprout. Do I have... Or... Do I have just a normal bell sprout? Did I already get it? I think for some reason in my head we already got it. But I don't know why I'm thinking that. Well, either way, it doesn't matter. Let's just go ahead and try to catch this one. We're just gonna keep throwing ultra balls like we usually do. There we go. Alright, we're catching them. We're catching them quick. So we got this. The leafy part acts as cutters for slashing foes and spits a fluid that dissolves everything. I don't have anything with... I don't have... Okay, I don't have anything with the horde capabilities, so... Um, real quick, let me check the Pokedex. Oh, poop. Um, I don't know where Bellsprout is. That's the problem here. That's the only thing I don't like about this Dex, is I don't know where Bell... Just give me one Dex, bro. How am I supposed to find Bellsprout? Alright, whatever. I'll check at a later date. Alright, so we're still looking for Carnivine and Carablast. Um... Yeah... Carvine and Carablast. So that's, that's what we're looking for here. Alright, hey, there is Carablast. Okay. Let's go ahead and. This will probably be the last one we catch for today. Next episode, we will be looking for the Carnivine. The. Carnivine, basically. And then Ekans is in Hordes, and Bellsprout is in Hordes. And then we need the Poliwag from the good ro old rod, and then Barboach and Poliwhirl from the good rod. These mysterious Pokemon evolve when they receive electrical stimulation while they are in the same place as a Shelmet. Okay. Um... Alright, well, let's get this item. 
Okay, I was like, yeah, we already got it. Could we maybe get a new Pokemon? But no, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. And do, do the dash on him. Ooh, cleanse tag. Well, I'm glad I came over to the side then, because that's actually pretty useful. Dude, I take a millistep and I... Wow, okay. It was quite literally a millistep, dude. Alright, let's try to get out of here. Um... Okay. I'm trapped. Okay, maybe we can get Carnivine out of the little last lucky one, maybe? Another Gumi. I almost feel like I should catch it, considering... I don't know. I don't need to catch it. Why, why would I need another Gumi? But I, let's indeed go back over here. So we can kind of... Next episode, we can, we can kind of walk forward and be where we should be. Do the dash. I gotta remember that Starmie's ability is to literally encounter more things. I wish I could take that ability off somehow. I, there's probably a way that I don't know about. But that is something that I should probably invest in. Okay. Now we gotta fight. Alright, well, let's fight this guy. I was gonna end, the up, end off the episode, but he only has one Pokemon, so that's fine. And he literally only has a Gumi, so... Little Goober Gumi. Alright, I'm about to surf upon you for real. Bing bong. I didn't die, okay. Why would you do such a thing, Gumi? Why would you do such a thing? Boop, boop, boop. Okay. What incredible power! I feel like something's awakened inside me. Alright. Um, can I roller skate to the right spot? We're gonna go ahead and end the episode off here. I actually gotta go to my, uh... Now fiancé, but my wife soon. I gotta go to her house, so I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hey everybody, we're playing some more Pokemon, so we're here in Route 14. Um, last episode we did most of the things here, we just got a lot of battles to go through, and we also still need Carnivine, Ekans, and Bellsprout. So, um, let's just continue right where we left off, and uh, yeah. I've known forever since my previous life that we would meet here today and face off. Alright. Uh, Anina? Pretty creepy. I'm here for it, though. As long as you don't like, mind losing. Oh, it's a terrible matchup for her. I've got a water starfish. She's got, like, a literal candle. Probably not the best idea. To be honest... If I started this battle and I saw me, I'd be like, mm, eh, just take the money. Why would you put your Pokemon through such torture? You know you're gonna lose. Just give up. It might be easier. Alright, we'll hit the Hunter with a Surf. The Hunter might be a little, might have a little better special defense, so. Well, probably not actually. Well, it is a second evolution. I lost. I lost. What wizardry is this? Did you somehow rewrite the laws of casualty? Um, yeah. Right before the battle, actually. That's exactly what I did. Uh, alright. Nothing in that tree. At least I don't think so. Oh, no, no. Hey, Skorupi. I don't need you. Um, but... Skorupi is like one of the coolest shinies because it's like very bright red so it's a shiny that i will welcome heavily it is a really cool shiny all right shellnet also i should probably take starmie out of first slot um 
Actually, no, I guess there's no reason to. I'm still looking for Pokemon, so I might as well have these encounters as I'm running around. Um, let's fight this guy. Become one with nature to understand how Pokemon truly feel. Alright, Ranger Reed. Oh, I need one of those. I'll need to find the water. Oh, oh yeah, and I totally forgot. Actually, add a couple more Pokemon to the list that we need. Um, we also need Poliwag, Barbroach, and Poliwhirl. Totally forgot about those. Those are the water Pokemon we also need to get that we didn't get last episode, so... We make sure to get those two. Alright, Loudred. Alright, we'll go ahead and, um... Probably... Let's hit it with a Brine. I, I don't think it... Might have better defense than a normal Pokemon, but... For special defense. Well, see, no, it wouldn't. It would have just high defense. Ooh, a Fracture. Now that is... A cool Pokemon. Alright. One that is worthy of a Surf. That's definitely a pretty cool Pokemon, though. Alright. What amazing power. Do you understand how Pokemon feel? Uh, barely. I'm just chilling, my guy. Right, what's over here? Is there anything in that corner? Hey! Carnivine! The, just the thing I was looking for. Wonderful. And actually, that's a pretty rare spawn. Usually in the grass, it's 15%. In the water, it's 5%. So we actually got, like, the rarer spawn on it, too. Ah, you butt cheek. Why? See, that's, like, the third Pokemon in this area to do that. Where it, like, shakes three times and then escapes. I wonder if, like, those odds are increased. I don't know. But this is not very nice. Especially because it's technically going to be super effective against me. No, we're just gonna keep throwing them though. I don't feel like hurting it. Um, I will hurt it soon though if it doesn't want to comply. There we go. Okay. See, took my threat. I was going to hurt you, and then I decided not to. It attracts prey with its sweet-smelling saliva, then chomps down. It takes a whole day to eat prey. Okay. Alright, um, oop, I gotta make sure. Can I walk all the way over here? Oh, okay, I was wondering where I can fish and stuff. Apparently, that is where. Okay, real quick, surfing. Okay, I don't actually get anything nice from surfing. So, oop, I don't actually didn't want to do that. I will do. I will, like, just jump over here, though. Alright. Hyper Potion. Um, let's, I guess, fish. Wait, no, I have a button for this. What's my button? I literally have... I had a button. Oh, yes, it's left. Okay. Let's see what we can find here. Oh, oh you butt. thought it was something. So I need... Barbro... Okay, seriously, still... Okay. What do we got? Oh, okay. Actually, there's nothing actually new anymore. The only Pokemon we need are Water Pokemon and Horde Pokemon. So, actually, I really should, like, almost just straight up use, like, a... Although, I don't know if I'll be able to get the Horde Pokemon because I don't have anything with Sweet Scent. And I don't have any Honey either. Um, but real quick, let's go ahead and just catch... Okay, hey, that's good. That's the rare one, the 30%. So, um, I won't have to spend a lot of time looking for it, which is good. Um, let's go ahead and throw a netball at it. Just because it's a little bit more effective at catching these. Bing. Bing. Bong. Perfect. Yeah, these netballs are... These netballs work really, really well, actually. Um, I don't think, like, I haven't caught a Pokemon with the netball yet. And even majority have been crits, I think, so... It can live in or out of water. When it is out of water, it constantly sweats to keep its body slimy. 
Very cool, Poliwhirl. Very cool. Alright, now we've got to look for Bar Broach, which should, really should be the next encounter because it's a 70%. But we'll see. Okay, nothing seems to be biting. Well, something will bite in a minute. There you go. Okay. So we got Barbro. Hey, here we go. All right, water ground. Very cool typing. I love water ground typing. But it's not really like a super cool Pokemon, I guess. All right, throw another netball. Once again, the netball's been doing me pretty good. They don't actually tend to escape very, very often. Yeah. Which is nice. I definitely, I'm gonna buy more of these, um, like, effective balls, because they just seem to work so well. The coat's this entire body with slimy fluid, so it can squirm and slip if grabbed. Oh, no, I don't, I didn't want to do that. Alright, let's see him, box five. Already, all, all the way to box five already. Okay, now we just need the good rod, and actually, or the old rod, sorry. And this will be the last water Pokemon, because we don't have anything from the Surf. And luckily, the Old Rod only has a single encounter. So, we can't really miss on what we need, which is also very, very nice. Okay. Why does that Poliwag look gigantic? Are they that big, usually? They're supposed to be like tadpoles. Why do they look so big? Anyway, if you would please... Yeah, man, these netballs are amazing. They they don't tend to run away. So the only thing we're missing is the super rod for a Whiskash, but we don't obviously have that super rod. Okay, so all we need, it's slick black skin, is thin and damp, part of its internal organs can be seen through the skin as a spiral pattern. We only need Bellsprout and Ekans, which are the horde Pokemon. Um, obviously their horde, so it's a little harder to do. Come on, this way. Oh, I wasn't done yet. So this is the house. It is a scary house, isn't it? Well, I guess we should go inside. Yeah, we should, after I'm done catching my Pokemon. Are y'all serious? Serena is off spending time with her Pokemon, so I guess we'll just have to go on without and see if the rumor is true by ourselves. I guess so. Let's go inside by ourselves, then. Alright, but first I want to check... The Pokemon, man, why? I wasn't done yet. I don't like you when games do that, where they just like, pull you out of things. Like, man, tell me, do you want to go to the house yet? Yes or no? Don't just, like, grab me. I'm in the middle of something. Let's get started, then. Very spook. It was dark and stormy night many years ago. Lost, I arrived at this house and went inside. The lights would not turn on, so I fearfully looked around the house. Eventually, I made my way into the kitchen. There was no sign of anyone being there. I found the fridge, and when I opened it, a faint light leaked out. I could finally make out my surroundings, and I saw the faint outline of a man huddling in the corner of the room. I tried to tell him that I was lost, and I was hoping he'd let me stay until morning. But when I approached him, the man suddenly screamed, Stay back. I apologized and continued to plead my case. Please, can you help me? Can't you help me? I'm not talking to you, he shouted. I looked at the man in surprise. When I did this, the man asked me, Can't you see them? Behind you? A horde of faceless men. Spook. Now then, since I told a wonderful story that will always haunt you, would you be so kind to tip me? If you don't, you might see something real scary. Even haunted houses are free, you know? Would you like to give a tip? No. Whatever... Sheesh, let's get out of here. Whatever it is that's scary... I want to see it. Huh? Is it over already? I wasn't really listening. Is that the story you told really tr really true? I don't really care. Again, whatever he says will come after me. I want it to, because if it's a Pokemon, I want to catch it. Sai, I guess it really was a scary house in a way. Well, I know you wanted to go camping, and that was kind of like camping, I guess. People usually tell scary stories by the campfire, right? I've had enough of dark places and scary things. I'd rather rehearse my dances. I'll see you all later. What should I do next? I guess I'll go to Lavar City. See you later, Big D. Please compare Pokédexes with me again soon. And I will definitely beat you on that, considering I'm catching every Pokémon that I come across. And I'm not leaving areas without catching all of them that are possible. 
Some things are left best unknown. The truth is best carried to the grave. And he said if I don't tip him, something will come and get me. Can that please happen? Alright, well that was probably one of the most drawn out and weird like little cutscene side things. Like what was the... Oopsies. Accidentally clicked my fast button. What was like the uh, point of any of that? Usually we get an item or a Pokemon or something, but I don't understand what any of that was actually for. Um, okay. I don't know what to do. I don't have a Pokemon with Sweet Scent currently. Uh, and I should probably go grab one, shouldn't I? Um, yeah. Okay, we found ourselves a spell tag. Um, let's see. I don't have Sweet Scent on me, right? Launcher, no. Okay, I don't know why I even checked. Of course none of these people have sweets. They don't have... Okay, well that's fine. Here's what we're gonna do. We're going to put on... Um, where the poo-poo is my... Is it here? Ooh, I do have a honey though. Hey, alright, let's use one of them. Maybe we can get one of, at least one of the ones. No! Wait. Why? Oh, was I not in a patch of grass? Oh, I might have... Why did... Why did that attract... What? Um, okay, whatever. That's fine. That was dumb. I'll buy some more honey later or something. I don't know. Um, okay. We need max repels, yes. Okay. So now, let's go ahead and basically... Let's make sure we didn't miss anything. That's really the important part. And then we can basically kind of skedaddle. And do you like fairy tales or reality more? And then we'll go to the town. We'll grab a sweet scent. We'll just kind of mosey on back. Grab Ekans and Bellsprout. And then, um, yeah. Alright, we got ourselves... What is it? A uh, Floet? Oh, wait, this is not going to be effective. That was probably a mistake. Probably should have used... Yeah, I probably should have used Surf there. That was not the smartest thing I've ever done, but it's alright. Oh, it heals both of us? That's an interesting move. Alright, well, it's low enough to where we can brine it, so... Might as well do it. Okay. Oh, 51. And it and I get healed too. Thank you, Floet. This um this battle is actually profit. Um I needed a little healing and it's healing me now, so not bad. Thank you, I guess, Floet. Okay. Cool. I wish I could live inside of a fairy tale. Well, we all do, don't we? Alright, a Roselli Berry. Very cool. Can I... Can I cut this? Oh, do I not have a Pokemon with cut? Are you serious? Seems to be something that happens a lot. Okay. Um, Tentacool. You are going to be learning cut. Yes. Let's get rid of wrap here. You don't need wrap. We need you to have cut. Yep. Yes, let's go ahead and use cut. Hmm, will o wisp I'm pretty sure that move is not any good, actually. But, hey, we'll take it. Now we got him. Let's double check. Okay. I look at the swamp. I can't help but think of poison. I'm sorry. That really wasn't a very interesting to say. Here. Take this as an apology. Hey, I'll take toxic. Hey, not a bad move. We take those. Any day of the week. Damp rock. I don't actually know what that does. But I'm sure whatever it is, it's very nice. Alright, let's 
let's see. So there, over here is just the house, right? We already went over there. I I think that is everything. Yeah. Boing boing. Here you can have this TM I found. Format. Okay. Right, again, when we go to the Pokestop, we'll end up trading a Pokemon out. Pokemon hit by the Torment can't use the same move twice in a row. Um, after Arbok, use... Uh, okay. Would you like to hear my story? Sure, why not? Lying back in the green... Okay, that's not helpful at all. Okay. Next house. Ooh, fashion. Okay. Don't need any of that. I'm not spending my money on clothing. I need the footballs. The ability called Pixelate somehow turns normal moves into fairy type moves. Okay. No. Alright, tiny Pokemon of Munch. Um. Ye. Oh, okay, I don't. I'm like. Does it like automatically check? Like, Clauncher might be pretty small. If you guys want to read that, just pause the video. Ooh. Hey, stop right there. You can't go behind this point. Okay, so the game will not let me go there, which is fine. Alright, well then before we continue with the rest of the town, let's go ahead and do what we originally needed to do. Let's grab our Ekans and Bellsprout using the Hordes, but I just need to grab something with Sweet Scent. Also grab some more Ultra Balls. Oh, and then what about you? Do you sell any moves or balls? Oh, okay. Though he sells up items. All right. Well, those are expensive for me currently, so I don't need those. Okay. So we should deposit. Who's like? Oh, um, that ball did not work. Okay. Very cool. Okay. I am very much poisoned here. Let's throw another ball that maybe is a little bit more effective, like the Ultra Ball here. Okay, let me turn my forward volume down so you guys don't hear it whenever I go on it, huh? Alright. There's our Bell Sprout. So we don't have to breed a Weepin Bell later. Even though its body is extremely skinny, it is blindingly fast when catching its prey. Alright, one more. We just need our Ekans now. So, let's go ahead and bing bong. Give me Ekans, por favor. Do not give me the other ones. You butt cheeks, I don't need any of you. Also, why is Ducklet out? Ducklet, get, get away. I'm like, is Ducklet not going to be able to get away? Also, I should probably revive Starmie. That's probably something that I should be doing right now. There you go, Starmie. Because, actually, if I find any more Bellsprout or Skorupi, I will be surfing them. Might as well take the XP. Why did I walk around? Unless, I mean, hey, I could get a horde out of walking, but, yeah, likely not. Shiny. Okay. Let's do the normal thing. Bing bong, bong, bing bong. Alright, Ekans, let's go. Give me Ekans. Oh, no, 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 no. Score Ruby. I don't need y'all. Okay. But I will be surfing all of you because the XP. Cool. Alright, here we go. Finally found the Ekans. It actually took extremely long time for like no apparent reason. I have to do like over 25 encounters, which that's pretty crazy considering. 
Um, but whatever, I'll get over it. And let's just go ahead and catch it and call it a day. Yeah, this Ekans has been has caused me a, a little bit of time, surprisingly. Um, so definitely don't particularly appreciate it. That's okay. Alright, let's go ahead and throw an Ultra Ball here, and, um, should be good to go. Yeah, there you go. Alright, we caught ourselves the Ekans, and we can finally get away from this stupid swamp. The older it gets, the stronger it grows. At night, it wraps its long body around tree branches to rest. Very cool, Ekans. Very cool. Not really, but anyway, very cool. Let's just get out of here. Um, you know what? We'll even keep Combi on us because I feel like... So we're going to Laver City next. And we're just going straight to Route 15 and we might need something. Um, let's see, wild Pokemon. Okay, we can catch a Basculin. Okay, so we can catch one new Pokemon here. Um... Okay. Real quick, let me check. Okay, there is a gym here too. Okay. Very cool. We have to head this way. We. Oh, I guess I could probably surf on this water, right? Hmm? No. Oh, it's literally a sign. It says no surfing. Okay, also, let me get off my thingies here. The building. Um. It's actually... Okay, so they've got a gym here. Okay. Um, okay. Can you run into... What is Water Pledge? Why was the... Oh, interesting. 80... That is not any better, though. So, you know what? I won't learn it right now. There's no need. Partly because I'm not going to be using Greninja. I'm not going to be using Greninja, so... Yes. Okay. Thank you, anyway, though. Alright, thank you for the information. Why did it give me a weird little animation before I... This is a gem? Okay. That little house is a whole gem. See... Okay. Gengarite. Hey. We... Yes. Okay. That's cool. Okay. I will take a haunt. Uh, the Gengarite, actually. Greetings, greetings. You can see I'm the head of the local chapter of the Pokemon fan club here in the Kalos region. It's part of my duty to grant effort urban city Pokemon that are clearly making an effort. Mmm, it's definitely making an effort. However, we'll have to work a little harder. Okay, so nothing. It's amazingly friendly towards you. Must be happy spinning. Okay, so my Starmie likes me, which is pretty cool. Um, at least I would hope. Every gym tells a story. Um, no. Pokeballs from the Pokeball Factory are sent to the Pokemons all over the Kalos region. It sure seems like my Pokemon are getting stronger really fast. Could it be because we play together every day? You know what? I like really big things. My favorite Pokemon are big ones. What I mean by big, you know, is being taller than 910. Come on, if you have a big Pokemon, show it to me. Okay, I don't. I All my Pokemon are like just medium sized. Came here to spend some time, didn't ya? Where do you want to sit? Mmm... Sit at the counter for now. I don't... Again, I don't really know the particular purpose of these cafes. I don't know if they get me anything, but... Cafe's known for the special juice. Enjoy. No. Okay. Alright, cool, I guess. No. 
Yeah, I, I still don't understand what the what purpose of these cafes are. They don't... They didn't do much. What is this? Okay, so, Pokeball Factory. Well, we're gonna go there after I beat the gym. Okay, so I guess we could start on our way to the gym. Okay, well, if we're going to the gym, we're gonna be getting a lot of XP. We really should be trading out for Pokemon that I can give XP to. Um... Also, what type of gym is it? It's a... Oh, it's a fairy gym. Okay. So let's go and deposit. We're gonna go and deposit Greninja in the battle box. Also, Combi in the battle box. Okay. Withdraw. Let's go ahead and we gotta withdraw a couple of Pokemon to evolve here. Um. Who should we grab to evolve? Grab Ekans, I guess? Ah, my home is broken on my other screen. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab Remoraid, and let's go ahead and grab Ekans. And I'm pretty sure that both the Ducklet and the Remoraid will basically evolve instantly. Um, so, we'll probably get a couple fights in, evolve both of those, and then actually we might head out of the gym and come back. Because, again, I don't want to be giving a lot of XP to Pokemon that don't particularly need it. And also... How long has that been off? That's probably been off for quite a while, hasn't it? Oh, that's fairly annoying, actually. I guess I should have wondered why nothing else was getting levels. Ugh, okay, that's fine. Um, now they'll get levels, so a little embarrassing, but that's okay. Well, howdy, Mr. Potty. What's new, future champ? This here's the Laverse City Pokemon Gym. It has some truly confounding conundrums. The first shocker is that this here is a fairy-type gem. Bet you've never seen one of these before. Second shocker is how you get around. Hop on one of those warp panels and off you go. But where you'll land, nobody knows. Uh, it's pulling your leg, champ. The warp panels all have fixed destinations, of course. Let's go on. Step on the flashing yellow panel. I... Oh, so this is like Sabrina's gem, basically. It's literally just Sab Sabrina's gem, but it's fairy. Okay. This furrow-sewed girl had her clothing designed by this the one and only Valerie. How do I look? I must live up to Valerie's beautiful design by displaying an equally beautiful battle technique. Aye, Callie. Oh, oh. Alright, let's level up some Pokemon. And this time we have our PokeShare on, so that's cool. The XP share, I mean. But that's also okay because we funneled a lot of the XP over to Starmie, so it makes the actual fighting easier, I guess, right? There you go, Ducklet's finally level 32. Um, yeah, we'll keep, we'll keep battling here. Um, because we also got Thunder, so... In this case, we'll go ahead and do a Thunderbolt on the Azumarill, and that should do exactly what we needed to do. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay. Launcher to 26. Ekans to 18. So strong, so beautiful. And does Ducklet level up here? Thought it did. Okay, well, maybe it doesn't. Alright, we'll come over here. Hello. I looked up to Valerie so much that I came here to learn from her. Alright, you're challenged by Feroz. Feroso, girl. Le 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 what is with English, man? What's with all these weird words? Oh, that was a very weird sound slash cry. I don't like that. I'm gonna surf you. Aroma tissue. I know it's aroma tease, aroma taste, whatever, but it looks like aroma tissue. Alright, that 
didn't help you in the slightest. Now I'm gonna power gem you. I'm gonna throw some gems at your head. There you go, bud. Alright. The rest of your team gains some loot Leo to 30. From a rate to 26. Um, people moves. I should give a water pulse, but I don't care. I'm not using it anyway. Oh, Lady Valerie, I need your help. Okay, and, and Ekans should be evolving. Okay. Okay, we got two evolving. Wait, no. No, Remoraid's evolved, not Ekans. My bad. I get myself confused. So, okay, cool. We got a Remoraid going here. Bink, bonk, bink, bonk. Get ourselves an artillery. Congrats, your Remoraid evolved into an artillery. Thank you, thank you. Um, so I really should go back to Gret to switch out artillery, but we'll keep battling for now. Um, if Ducklet evolves, I will go back. Don't we just look like a bunch of dolls in the dollhouse? A oh, tiny bit. Oh, you got a lot of Pokemon. Oh, but you got a Klefki. Yo, I want a pair of Klefki. Klefki's kind of sick. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and just keep throwing some uh, over you. All right, I don't know what that means. Does it still get? Oh, I. It, I love how when it faints, it breaks open, like, and it drops all its keys. We'll keep going surfing upon it. Alright, one more. Let's go. Ekans to 20. Um, no. Ekans does not need that. Ramble. Nope. We'll, we'll stick with our Pokemon here. And go ahead and just do another surf. Duck with 33. Launcher to 27. Cutlery to 27. You're no doll. You're a true Pokemon trainer. Alright, real quick. Ducklet evolution level. When does Ducklet evolve? 35! Okay, so we're not there yet. A little, little more time. Okay. Did you know that a certain type of Pokemon is no effect? Has no effect against our beloved fairy type Pokemon? I didn't actually, and I don't even know what type it is. Catherine. I should probably figure that out. But I'm not going to. Alright, Slurp Puff, level 40. I'm gonna serve. For that, you get brined. Alright. Star me to 55. Against the 21. There are some there are some types of moves that are very strong against fairy types though. I All right, straight to the leader? Okay. Cool. Oh, if it isn't a young trainer, so you've flown all the way through my gym, fluttering down to me on a fortunate wind. Then I suppose you've earned yourself the right to battle as a reward for your efforts. I am Valerie, who leads this fairy-type gym. I hope your visit will prove entertaining to you. The elusive fairy types may appear frail as a breeze and delicate as a bloom, but they are strong. All right, we got Valerie up in here. You're challenged by leader Valerie. All right, we got Mawile. That shouldn't be a very hard Pokemon to beat, so I think we'll be fine here. 
Whoa, I didn't mean to. I totally meant the to thunder. Or I totally meant the surf. But that's okay. We're, we're still good. So no problem. But I totally used the wrong move there. But Leo, 31. Mr. Mime. My absolute favorite psychic Pokemon, clearly. Let's go ahead and uh, surf upon it. Alabunga dude. Woo, it survived. Okay. Well, good thing it rose that... Oh, now it's going to be hard to kill, actually, because, yeah, now it's going to be a little harder. It's not, not going to probably even do half. Yeah. Okay, well, let's see if maybe a Thunderbolt does anything better. I don't have any physical moves, so... Dazzling Gleam. Okay, that didn't hurt too bad. Okay, we should be able to kill it with this here. And... Oh, crit. I wish I could have done that earlier. All right, last Pokemon, Sylveon, the classic fairy Pokemon. Let's go ahead and surf upon it. The light screen is still up, so it's not going to hurt too... Yeah, I, I kind of just have to outweigh the light screen. But there we go. The light screen wore off. We're good to go. Still not going to kill it. I don't think it'll kill me, though. Close, but it didn't. Ah, uh, hyper potion. Yeah. Um, it might actually kill me now. That's the problem. Maybe not. I I think I'll leave it with the sliver of red. Actually. Okay. No, we didn't. Good. Good job, Starmie. That works. I right, launched her to twenty-eight. Artillery to twenty-eight. No, I don't need artillery to learn anything. Just stay, stay, just stay in your Pokeball. Don't, don't do anything. I hope the sun, sun is shining tomorrow. That would be a reason enough to smile. All right, and there's our Ekans. Okay, so we can go to our um, Poke Center. We can switch out both the Remoraid and the Ekans, which is pretty cool. Got two evolutions out of the way. Would have got some more if I had my XP turned on earlier, but. Pretty sure I've had that off since maybe Star training up Starmie. So, ooh. congrats, your Ekans evolved into an Arbok. So I think it's only been like two gems, which is fine. Wants to learn Crunch? No, I'm not going to be using Arbok. So oh, don't, don't really need. Yeah, that was a fine battle. I reward you for this great victory. This is the fairy badge. It is yours now. Its beauty is captivating, is it not? Do forgive me, I was so captivated, I forgot that a moment that it is yours. Cool. The cat uh, will endear any Pokemon to level 80. Cool. And we get ourselves Dazzling Gleam. I wonder if I can put that on Starmie. Oh my, what a curious feeling. I can't seem to recall any longer which move is contained in that TM. I hope you might forgive me. My designs are said to be rather mystifying. Do you agree with that? I always wanted to be a Pokemon, you see. The desire is my inspiration and what I can achieve by designing. And yet the only time I feel I am truly one with Pokemon is when we are embroiled in a desperate battle. I wonder why that is. Hmm, could it be? Never mind, it is nothing, kind trainer. Dude, this gym leader is annoying. She has, like, short-term memory loss. And probably a mix of ADHD and OCD. Alright, let's get out of here. Um... Hi, big... Ugh. Why does everyone keep talking to me, dude? Hey, that's the fairy badge. It's so cute and sparkly. Now what? We're gonna go tour the Pokeball factory. Come join us. I'm interested in Pokeballs, but they're you. Uh, okay, that's fine. Yes, I will join you. But first, please let me go to the Poke Center. And actually, uh, we're gonna this po this episode's gone on way longer than it should. I will see you guys in the next episode. All right, hey everybody, how's it going? We're playing some Pokemon. Um, we're, we just got done with the gym, so now we're heading over to the Pokeball Factory, so, um, ooh, what do you, you gotta say? Hey, it won't let us inside. What? He'll let us in, you'll see. I'll go talk to him again. Shauna, wait. Okay. Did Ch uh, and Travis go off running just now? What's the deal? We were supposed to meet here too. I wonder what the matter is. Eek! Oh, 
stop. Oh, what are you guys doing? What's going on? Well, I guess I'll go help them. Team Flare, there might be something happening inside. Let's go check it out while the guard is down. Alright. Can that idiot outside even handle guard duty? So sorry, but we're not offering tours right now. The red suit like that, you must be a member of Team Flare, right? Did you have to take a part-time job at the Pokeball Factory to pay for that ugly suit? What? How dare you mock Team Flare? Mighty Anna, get them. I'll take care of this. Go on ahead. Alright. Okay, so... Let's fight this guy first. I'm a nameless Team Flare grunt. I've yet to make a name for myself. Alright, Team Flare Grunt. What do you got? Ooh, a Toxic Croak. That is a pretty cool Pokemon you got there, bud. Too bad it's gonna go away very, very quickly. Ooh, it's faster than me, huh? Interesting. But it's not stronger than me. Alright. Ducklet to 34. Does Ducklet need to learn Rain Dance? No, definitely not. Asper to 25. Yeah, let's see. Size Shock. Um. What is Covet? No. Just get rid of Scratch. I really don't need Scratch. But I do want a Size Shock. I'm a nameless girl who lost. I've yet to take a name for myself. Okay, do we... Yes, I'm pretty sure, like, yeah, Asper just evolves, like, right away. We picked it up at 24 and evolves at 25, so... Um... Yeah. How many more people do we fight? There's actually quite a few fights in here. Wait. Um... Hold on. Actually, there isn't that many fights, so I'm not gonna run back all the way. Alright, we got Meowstic. Usually I'd run all the way back to the levels, but in this case, I don't think I need to. Okay, hello? Bro, for real? When I beat you, tears will fall from your eyes like Pokeballs rolling down the conveyor. Alright. If you say so, bud. I mean, what do you got? Mighty Yenna and a Golbat? Shouldn't be that tough to me. Go ahead and surf upon you. Alright, Starmie, 56. Little Leo, 32. Oh, bat. No, we'll, we'll keep staying in. We'll, we'll be chilling. We can go ahead and just do another surf here. Alright, Combi 28. I really should have grabbed a female Combi, but it's alright. Please take me away on the conveyor to a world without pain. I do want that item over there. I want to get over there though. Don't worry, be happy. Ah, well, fair enough, I guess, sure. Just don't be sad. Obviously. Alright, go ahead and put up a surf. Scraggy. We don't like Scraggy around these parts. Mighty Yenna. Sure. Just gonna keep spamming the surfs upon it. Until it learns it lesson. Until it learns lesson. Alright. Launcher 29. 
hard to be happy when you lose. Where did I go wrong? Um, your hairdo? Probably just start there, TBH. Ooh, okay, I'm like, I know there's gotta be an... That's the one I was looking for. There's one really good item in here, and that's the metal coat. <sighs> Definitely gonna use that to evolve a couple of things, so... Alright, we're chilling on the conveyor belt. There's an item over here we should grab. A timer ball? Okay, those are really only only gonna be useful for legendaries when we're like in the battle for like a million days. Also, if I'm in a Pokeball factory, why can't they just pocket like 20 of them? You feel me? Um, can I just turn off the conveyor belt? Is that what this does? Oh, okay, I reversed them. Interesting. We automated, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Oh, hey, thank you. I get more surf PP. Okay, so he just told us to change the direction. Okay, all right. Cool, I guess. Um, fight you. Ball, 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 pokeball, ball, ball, ultra ball. Bro, what kind of dialogue do you have? Are you like... Are you? Oh, so, I don't even know. I don't know what any of that was, but hey, fair enough, I guess. Alright, Swalot, you're about to get thunderbolted. Probably not gonna kill you, but that's alright. Special. Ooh, that's not good. It means it likely won't die from this. All right, but it did, so that's good. Ball, ball, no ball. Oh no, I don't have any balls to throw. Dude, they need to get this team grunt back to kindergarten stat. All right, so now... Wait. Did they unreverse? Why did they unreverse? Now, okay, I understand. Come now, work for Team Flare. If you'd just help out, we wouldn't have to carry all these Pokeballs by ourselves. Or with the contribution of just 5 million, you could become a member of Team Flare. It's a no-brainer. What in the world are you Team Flare fools thinking? I'm, I'll never forgive any group that tries to take all the Pokeballs for itself. Forget it, quit wasting your time with this person. There's no one we can use here. Let's blow this place to smithereens. What, what do we have here, an intruder? You don't want to talk. You, please help me. My oh my, getting a little desperate, are we, Mr. Company President? Well, I guess I'll just have to extinguish your little glimmer of hope. Hi. Team Flare Admin. Let's do it. Of course, all you've got is a stupid little scraggly. Cool, I guess. What do you got next? Duck at 35. Hound Doom. Okay, another Pokemon that's pretty good for Starmie. So sure. Let's go and surf up. Alright. Let Leo to 33. Does Let Leo want to learn that good voice? No. Okay, Combi 29. Bug Buzz. Meowstic 27. 
What? Thanks for the shmoney. We also gonna get to evolve Ducklet, which is pretty litty. We've been trying to evolve Ducklet for a little while here. Um, kind of my fault for leaving the XP share off for a while, but yeah. Okay, here we go. We got ourselves um, a big goose thing. What's his name again? Swana. Not a goose. It's a swan. Come on, you didn't have to go all out for a pitiful president like him. So lame, that's just embarrassing from an admin. Still, no worries, we're on it. The spare of scientists will clean up after you. Let's take them on two versus one. We must improve our chances of winning. We'll see about that. Sorry I'm late. There's another one. One kid or two, it doesn't make a difference. We're the ones fighting together. Our odds of victory increase exponentially. I want to check your numbers. Are you even really scientists? Can you help me fight with them then, neighbor? Obviously. Uh, no, I'm good. I'm just gonna go that way. Good luck. Alright, Celiosia and Bryony. Y'all have some cool little glasses, though. The spectacles are pretty sick. Um, your suits are stuck on a dumb one. Alright. Um, honestly, we might not even need Meow Stick. We could just probably kill them both. Or just kill everybody, I guess. Alright, Meowsta, can you take care of the rest? Alright, that's good. You thunderfang me. Meowsta, go ahead and take care of him. No. Why would you like to scream, dude? Just kill him. Not very epic, Meowsta. Not very epic at all. It's very easy to just hit him. Can I star me to 57? No way, we are we are lame. Probability is just probability after all. Absolutes do not exist. Alright, we got 11k for it. Easy peasy. Oh my, oh my. So lame, what a shame. We got beat. Enough already. We've already stolen the Pokeballs, Great Balls, and Ultra Balls. Let's call it good and leave. You've saved us. Thank you so much. You're astounding Pokemon trainers for being so young. Very well then. I want to show my appreciation. I'll give you a Master Ball or a Big Nugget. Pick whichever one you'd like. Bro, oh, the Master Ball? Obviously? Why would we ever choose the Big Nugget? As a bonus, you can have the one you didn't pick as well. Oh, sick. <laughs> Thank you. And for you too, of course. Thank you, this seems like a lot. I just have a feeling you two will put them to great use. You're different from those Team Flare people. Oh, and I even, I don't know the proper way to use a big nugget. Still, that blasted Team Flare. What were they planning to accomplish by taking all the Pokeballs for themselves? All right, we got ourselves the Master Ball, which is pretty litty though. Um, so if we have, so now we can use it, I guess. Um, on what? Not really 100% sure, but um, Sure, we'll do something with it. My problem is how do I go home now? I think I have to go all the way around, don't I? Go beep, bonk, 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 bonk. Um, okay, so... Yeah, this needs to be reverse... Reverse, right? And then I go here. Hey, do you think it's okay to have a look around now? Well, I don't know. I'm sorry, Team Flare messed everything up. It's not a good time right now. Team Flare, have I heard of that name somewhere? Would they be the people in the red suits from a minute ago? That's right, Trevor, Team Flare. They took all the Pokeballs by force, but they're for everybody to use. It seems like it would be best not to get involved with those guys. You're right, Trevs. Team Flare sure is terrible. What should we do now? According to the town map, Dendamil Town is next. Big D, you and Serena are really awesome. You're way stronger than those bad guys. Still, try not to do anything crazy, okay? See ya. Thank you. Everyone's okay thanks to you. But if I keep relying on you like this, going on this journey will lose its meaning. 
Okay. That was lame. Hollow clip received. We're bringing you this special bulletin. The Pokeball factory in the area around Lavar City has been attacked. The identities of those involved are unknown. However, this is, n this is not expected to have any effect on the sales of Pokeballs. Alright. Now here's my question. What's over here? Is there things over here? Okay. A max ether? Hey, a max ether is a max ether, I guess. What about on the other side? Wait, what about this entrance here? Yes, the dead end. Um, probably have to go up here, right? Yep. Max revive. What is that? Oh, I think it's just the edge of a bush. Never mind. Yes, yeah, that edge of a bush. Okay. Well, I think we're done with this area, unless I can go in here. No, I didn't think I'd be able to. Okay, well, as far as we're concerned, we're kind of done. Um, we can now go through Route 15. Um, very quickly, though. We gotta go switch Pokemon out. Let's go over here. And let's go ahead and do a couple of switcheroos here. So we can deposit the Meow Stick. Alright, we should definitely grab Mareep here. And then what's another one? Um, let's see. Dwebble. Evolution level. When does Bubble evolve? 34? Alright, we can grab Dwebble. Um, and actually, I'm going to need... Also, it's really bright. I'm gonna need something with Rock Smash. In the f okay. Oh, Litley already has Rock Smash. Okay. What about Cut? Doesn't particularly matter anymore. All right, and now we're on Route 15. Okay, so yeah, we got a bunch of new Pokemon. Um, let's see what we can find. First one, a Mighty Yena. Do we have a Poochiena? That's my thing. I don't know if we've already caught a Poochiena or not. The other question, will I kill it with a power gem? Woo! It didn't. Ouch. But this will make it, uh, hopefully an easy catch. So, sure, thank you. And Mightyena is the most common spawn in this area, so... We're just gonna keep spamming all the Pokeballs here. Just because we gotta get rid of them at some point anyway, right? Alright, Mighty Anna. You're at, like, absolutely no HP. Stop being a butthead. Just stay in the ball. It doesn't matter if I'm confused. I'm just throwing vocal balls anyway. Very cool, my Diana. Thank you for staying in the ball. Launcher to 30. Crab Hammer. What is Crab Hammer? Yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of Swords Dance here. For Crab Hammer. That is a pretty good water move. Mareep to 14. It will always obey the commands of a skilled trainer. Its behavior arises from its living in packs in ancient times. Alright, cool. We got our own Mighty Anna now. Where does this take us? Oh, it's a leaf pile. Can I jump in it? Oh. Oh, a revive. I'm like, I was wondering what I needed to do with that leaf pile. Very cool. Let's see if we can get another 
spawn here. Okay, ironically, we just got the only Pokemon that we already have in this entire area. Skorupi is the only one we have caught before, so we don't need you, bud. The other thing, though, is this Skorupi is much higher leveled, I think. Alright, we already have a Lydiana, dude. Real quick, let me go back to Route 14. Actually, it's not that much higher. The ones that we found earlier are 30-31. These are 34 to 35, so it's five more levels, but um, not drastically higher. Hey, Klefki, the one of the rare spawns of this area. Very nice. All right. Well, I'm definitely not going to hit this with a move just to be fun. Let's try to get this in a luxury ball. I think that would be really cool to have a Klefki in a luxury ball. So maybe we can just kind of snag it. Maybe? Okay, definitely not. Okay. That's fine. Then let's go ahead and throw out a, an Ultra Ball. How about that? What do you think about that, Klefki? Would you, would you take just chilling out? Oh, no? Okay. Well, that's fine. We're just going to keep throwing stuff either way, so... Just keep throwing, just keep throwing, just keep throwing, throwing, throwing. Here we go! Every time. Every time. Every time. Every time. Alright, we keep throwing. I swear. Alright. Took a few balls. We got there, though. Call me to 30. The key collector... The key collectors threaten any attackers by fiercely jiggling their keys at them. Ah, that's a... That's real scary. Just to be honest, it's me. I, I'd be very spooked, so... Um, alright, let's try to catch one of the... One of the Horde Pokemon. If anything, let's maybe try to get the Horde ones out of the way, because I don't feel like doing it later, because the Horde ones really suck. So we just need Fungus and Murkrow. Alright, there is Murkrow. Actually, Murkrow's the only one we need. We can find Fungus in a live encounter. Murkrow's the only one that we're not able to, so... We actually got the only one that we really needed. Um... Alright, we got just the Murkrow left. Let's see if it'll just be a good little Murkrow and stay. Alright, Murkrow. I see we're going to be playing that game. Oh, boy. One of these days. One. Two. No! Come on, Murkrow. There we go. Jesus Christ, Murkrow. You're level 16, dude. You should not be able to escape that many Pokeballs. I'm a reap to 16. It hides any shiny object it finds in a secret location. Murkrow and Meowth loot one another's stashes. That's actually really funny. I didn't know that. Um, that's like kind of cute too. All right, we got our Mareep evolving. You just see like you know the Meowth and the Murkrow just. I just think it's kind of funny, but anyway, our Mareep is evolving into what is it? A fluffy dude? A fluffle? Something? What are you? 
You are a Flaffy. There we go. I knew it was something with FL. Fluffy, Flaffy, Floof, Floof. No, I don't want to learn Charge. Very cool. That is the last Horde Pokemon I need. So, um, yeah. Hey, a, a Ponyard. Hit Ponyard. So, fun fact, one of my personal favorite Pokemon. Um, I don't really know why. Maybe I just, I played chess when I was little. Like, you know, I knew how to play chess. It wasn't like my favorite game of all time, but it was a fun game. All right, and Starmie is very much dead. So I don't know, I always really, really like, um, appreciate it much, Ponyard. Ponyard. Stupid butt. There we go. Okay, so we got actually a good amount of the Pokemon here. Um, we'll click though. Blades compromises this Pokemon's entire body. If battle, it's if battling dulls the blades, it sharpens them on stones by the river. Okay, so we're still looking for Mighty Yenas. No, no, no. Okay, no, we're not looking for you, Mighty Yenna. I didn't mean that. Um, we're still looking for Fungus and Watch Hog, or Watch Hog. And we have everything else. Oh, am I not able to escape or something? Okay, I didn't want to fight you anyway, TBH. So, that's fine. Let's get Combi first. I think Combi might be a little faster because it's a bug. Alright, here we go. We got ourselves a Fungus. The Fungus is among us. Let's throw a ball at it. Water or bug? This is not a bug, so that will not work. Let's throw a great ball at it. Nope, let's throw an ultra ball at it, actually. Again, I'm just kind of hoping it just wants to chill, you know what I'm saying? One, two, three. Fungus, please! Why, dude? Another ball, here we go! Thank you, Fungus! Alright, so now we're just looking for a Watchog. Alright, but what's your Pokedex? It lures people in with its Pokeball pattern that it releases poison spores. Why it resembles a Pokeball is unknown. Interesting. All right, last Pokemon. All right, here we go. We got ourselves a Watch Hog. Very crazy looking Pokemon. I was actually never really a big fan of it. I, I just, it's a really weird design. Like, it's not a very. I would credit though, so honestly, I like it just a little more now because it was easy to catch. Anything that's easy to catch, I automatically just like a little more. I still think its design is stupid and no kid would ever use it. But. No, we do not need rock polish. Using luminescent matter, it makes its eyes and body glow and stuns attacking opponents. Alright, watch all. Get out of here. I don't. Gross Pokemon. Alright, Mighty Anna, Scorpy, Furum, Fungus, Watch all, Ponyard. We got. Ooh, we got all of them. Yep. So now we just need the surfing. And Baskin with a good rod. Let's go ahead and get out of the grass. What's in these. Piles of leaves. How do I? Do I like? Okay. What about now? I need to go a little higher. 
Oh, there we go. Alright, a netball. Very cool. Do I want to go up there yet? Pokeballs are round. The world is also round. Debatable. <laughs> just, just kidding. Alright, Luna. Chimeco. Very cool. I like Chimeco. Alright, let's go ahead and surf upon you. There's a lot of battlers in this area. Wow. Okay. Let's see what can we get. We got it. We got a stone plate somewhere up in here. We got a PP up. Got a macho brace. Very cool. Alright, we actually don't need any of the Pokemon here, so... Unless you're shiny, you're not welcome. Go away. Started to rain. Alright, go away, I don't need you. Take down... No, Flappy does not need take down, that's fine. Alright, Dwebel to 21. Ha, I guess you were the one who got surprised here. Okay, bud. Um, Alright, we need to break every single one of these piles. I think there's some good items in these, actually. Oh! If it weren't for a certain benefactor of mine, I wouldn't be a Pokemon Ranger today. Alright, Lit Leo to 35. I'm thankful every single day for trainers like you and my Pokemon. Oh, hey, Litleo's evolving. That's pretty cool. We've been actually waiting quite a while for also Litleo to evolve, so that's a, that's a nice little sight right there, bud. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, is it a male or female? I totally didn't check. It is a female, okay. Alright, our Litleo turned into a Pyroar. Very cool. Okay, so we just need to break this pile up real quick. There's nothing in there. I also made the mistake of probably check what's over here. Alright, we got ourselves a Lepa Berry. Very cool. Okay. We're actually gonna I think, end off the episode here. Um, we'll catch the stuff in the water next episode and finish up. So, so See you guys in the next episode. Hey everybody, we're playing some more Pokemon. So, we are on Route 15. Really, really quickly, we have to catch a Basculin. And then we gotta catch some things from surfing. And then we're actually done with the route here. Obviously, we gotta go through it and like fight everyone and all that stuff. But, um, as far as the Pokemon, we caught most of them last episode. So, we're pretty much good to go. Once I can just... Reel something in for the life of me. Come on. I just need one Basculin. Dude, this is actually nuts. Come on, man. I, sh I probably should just restart the episode at this point. Oh, wowzers. Okay. Well, we're gonna admit it in and haven't really done much, have we? Alright, come on. There we go. Alright, give me a Basculin. If you give me a Poliwhirl, I'm gonna scream. Alright, there we go. Got ourselves a Basculin. Um, okay, it's level 25, so I'm definitely not going to hit it. I'm just going to hit it with a netball and call it a day. These netballs have never really failed me in the past. Um, so, why not? There you go. Yep. They don't, they don't tend to fail. Which is good, I guess. That's what they're meant to do, right? We got Flaffy to 21. All right, and then let me go up to the red and blue striped basket are very violent and always fighting. They're also remarkably tasty. Oh boy. All right, so let's go ahead and jump in the water. I'll see these. Woo! Bless me. Um, so we got Lombre and Floatzel. Hey, there's the rare spawn. Good to see, good to see. Um, let's see, Float Soul. Uh, let's just go ahead and throw a netball at it. 
I could probably surf it, but I'm probably still gonna kill it, even with it being not effective. Ooh, the netball didn't work! That was crazy! First time that's ever happened. I don't think the netball's ever not worked. But, it'll work the second time for sure. Not too worried about it. Yeah, like I said, not worried about it. The netballs always do their job. I dwebble. 22. It floats using its well-developed flotation sack. It assists in the rescuing of drowning people. What a good, what a good Pokemon. Um, where am I? Did I already come here? Oh, oopsies! I've already been here. Oh no! I say, don't get in the grass. I'm gonna, gonna have an encounter. Okay. Let's make sure I don't. Oh! Oh, hi. Are you here to interview me? Um, I mean, I wasn't going to. All right, Pedro. Your butt. Why would you jump out of me like that? <clears throat> All right. Let's go ahead and um. Ooh. Why don't we give you a thunderbolt? No reason to surf it because it won't. Oh, this won't be effective either. All right. Um. What about a dazzling gleam? Will this at least not be super effective, or just not? That's also not effective. Okay, nothing is effective. All right, and I'm paralyzed. What about power gem? Oh, that's gross. Don't do that. Might be one of those battles, huh? Alright, enough of that. How, will, how much will Power Gem do? Not enough to kill us, sadly. Oh, stop with the Mega Drain, man. Please hit, don't be paralyzed. There we go, okay. Alright. Yeah, because if I kept getting paralyzed, it would have just kept healing off of me again and again. Alright, fly feet to 22. You're not here from TV then? Why in the world would I be from TV? How does that even, like, make any sort of sense? Alright, dire hit. Take that. Or favor. Hey, there's the guy we're looking for. Alright, Lombre. You're about to be caught. Also, I just noticed Lombre is a grass water type. That's really interesting typing. Hmm. I wonder if he's any good as far as battling is concerned. Interesting. Alright, Netball failed again, but it never fails a second time. Never had one fail a second time. Wah! Alright. Well, technically, I'm not lying when I say I haven't seen it fail a third time. It always hits the third time. One. Two. Alright, Lombre wants to be a little, a little butthead. Okay. Noted. It's also with some light going on. <coughs> Alright, come on. Dude, okay. Wow. Nothing is giving me trouble yet, and all of a sudden, the Pokemon that gets me trouble is this one? Really? Okay. Dude, Annie full swipes too. Ooh, I'm gonna stick this guy in the, in the computer so hard. I think I'm gonna have a heart attack. Alright, one more. 
I've already wasted over $6,000 on this one single loan break because it won't stay. There we go. All right. Disgusting Pokemon. I don't even want to... Your water grass typing intrigued me, but I'm no longer intrigued in, intrigued in the slightest. You will be sent to the box and you will stay there. It lives at the water's edge where it is sunny, sleeps at the bed of grass by day and becomes active at night. Well, now it's about to be active on my PC. Because it ain't leaving it. Um, okay, we should probably break this right here. Ooh, a PP up. Very cool. Alright, we are all done with all of the Pokemon in this area, so... Let's go ahead and use a little one of those, um... Where are they at? Um, one of those repels, huh? There's our ball... There we go. Alright. <clears throat> right, let's jump back on the water here. Make our, make our way down and, uh... Probably just, uh, kind of dipski here. I don't really need... I'm kind of done with this route. Um, ooh, I forgot there's a fight here. Oh, you! If it's a battle you want, we won't refuse. E who are you? Why are you talking to me? Is it a... Okay, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with those two. They're challenged by mysterious sisters, Rune and Rhyme. Drifloom and Floette, okay. Is that a shiny Floette? Hey, two shiny Pokemon, let's get it. Why does that look like a shiny Floette? Oh, it's one with blue hair. Alright, well, Clauncher is about to get sent to the stratosphere, but it's alright. Alright. Yeah, Clauncher is gonna be some collateral damage, but it's alright. I'm not too worried about it. The only thing that survived was the Floette. And that's alright. I wish I would have died, but eh, it's a flower Pokemon, so that makes sense. No, we don't need Bug Bite. Grassy Terrain. Oh, well, it's not gonna help you much. It will heal me a little bit, though. And I will take that healing. Oh, um. Let's bring in Sandile, why not? And I won't use Surf this time, because so, I don't want to take out Sandile. Um. Uh, I'm gonna Power Gem it. There we go. Easy peasy. Then I will need to revive someone, but it's alright. Alright, Starmie to 59. Sandile to 19. Does you need to know Mud Slap? No, you do not. Eep! Hey, that was fun! I'm glad it was fun for you. Those are the red flowers? Okay, the red flowers don't actually have anything new. So we can ignore those. I'm pretty sure I do not have the move Waterfall yet, so I cannot go up that waterfall. What is over here? Why don't we use our no your dowsing machine? That's the one. Oh, okay. I don't know what that pretty wing does. I was like, I was gonna say, there has to be an item here. Like, why in the world would they create that little, like, out patch of land if there wasn't gonna be an item there, you know? Okay. Ooh, hollow clip. According to Professor Sycamore's research, Mega Evolution releases all the Pokemon's hidden energy at once. The Pokemon that ex exhibits a level of power cannot attain through ordinary evolution. What meaning can we draw from this? Do all people and Pokemon have such potential, or is it hidden within a chosen few? I don't know. How am I supposed to know? Alright, little girl, you wanna fight? Wanna see the scary side of the fairy type? 
Not particularly, bud. Fairy girl tail Mahalo. Alright. I thought she was gonna have like a scary fairy Pokemon. It's just for Dedene. It's really just a mouse. Surf it, I guess. I don't know if it's like meant to be scary or something, but. Sure, fair enough, I guess. Do level 24? No, you do not need Stealth Rock. Sandile to 20. Undor to 22. Aroma Tissue. It's such a weird cry. I'm gonna Thunderbolt you. Probably should surf it, but I'm gonna Thunderbolt it. Oh, gross. Why would you do such a thing? You're gonna get thunderbolted again. Nice, right, Sandow 21. Oh, the battle ended before I got a chance to show you. Well, you should have maybe should have done it quicker then, bud. All right, so there's the exit. All right. Let's go ahead and use strength to get this out of the way. Ironically, we'll we'll have a little bug push this big rock. It's a sky battle. No, I don't need a sky battle. Yo, what is going on in this little area? What? I like blood. Oh, I thought that was blood. Okay. Yes, go ahead and use another. Um. Okay, is this the Lost Hotel? Is that what this is? Oh. Drift and dash, spin, then boom, right into battle. Alright. Roller skater, jet. What's with the screaming? Alright. I'm just gonna go ahead and surf the Del Kitty. Wait, are we on Route 16? Oh, we're now on Route 16. Oops. I didn't even realize that we switched um routes. That's interesting. Right, let's give it a thunderbolt here. But there's actually nothing new except a phantom. Literally the only thing that's new. Alright, interesting. Alright, what about... Mm, yeah, there's literally not a single thing new except the phantom is here. What is Electro Ball? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> no. Do not need Electro Ball. Double to 25. Sandel to 22. <clears throat> um, no, we don't need Embargo. Alright. Town door to 23. I think it blew it on the barrel roll. Now, okay, here's my question. Where am I going here? Like, where am I going? I feel like this is like a whole nother... Don't you under mystery? We're, we're as strong as ace trainers, you know. We might go back here. I don't know wh where I'm heading. Um... Oh, craw dog. That's pretty cool. Um... One Thunderbolt hit. I don't know. Let me see if I should. Hmm. It connects me to Limoui's Hotel, which is kind of cool. I guess we can check. We should probably clear Route 16. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. We should. Yeah, I was going to say, I didn't mean to do that, Thunder. We can clear Route 16 and then head on to the next city. 
But again, there's not too much to clear, actually. It's just the Phantom to get. But I do want to fight all of the trainers so I can get the money, you know? Alright, Flaffy to 26, Sandal to 23. How could I lose to you? You're not even a nice trainer, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, like, I don't actually know where I'm at. I know there's a guy right there, isn't there? Speaking of battle, through it I will learn all there is about you. Ooh, Osana, what are you just doing hiding in the grass, you little, little weirdo? Okay. We got Pumpkaboo. Alright, we're about to get served upon. There's a lot of people on this. Oh! Wait, we get the super rod from here. Yo, say less. All right, we do definitely have to check it out then. I didn't realize this is where we get the super rod. And Houndomite. Okay, and we actually get two. Okay. All right, we definitely have to stay on the shout. I learned everything about you, all right. <clears throat> oh, hey, our Houndor is evolving. Okay, I didn't realize it'd be. I did realize it's level 24, and it, I, we got it at level 21, so. Alright, what else can we get? We can get the fist plate. We got two rare candies. A Houndoomite, and we have a Houndoom, so. Um. That's pretty cool. Where is it, though? Oh, a new berry. Alright, I'll take the lumberry. Very cool. Okay, randomly clicked and found a mushroom. <laughs> hey, we'll take it. That's why I always just like spam the. Ah! Yeah, that's right, I'm a red Pokemon Ranger. Alright, Bjorn. Slagoo. Hey, we need to get ourselves one of those. We have a Gumi, but we haven't like, taken the time to evolve it yet. There's a lot of like the pseudo legendaries that we need to evolve, but it's oh okay. I didn't realize it was ineffective. But it's gonna take a little while. It's specifically um, the Gibble. Um, what else did we get? We got the Gibble. There's a few other ones that are really cool that I like totally forgot about. Am I dumb? Oh, the Trap Inch, I guess. Um. There's a few others. Wow, this thing is like not okay. Glad dazzling gleam. I don't know, man. But it was something that's effective. I don't know what Slagoo is, so there you go. Oh, okay. I should just hit. It's a dragon. Oh, it's dazzling gleam. Okay, that was like the smallest brain thing I've ever done, but that's all right. Oh no, the Pokemon Red Rain the Red Ranger's in trouble. Um, ooh. We should unparalyze our thingy. Alright, where's the paralyzed heal? Bang, bang, bang. Also, we should probably just quickly revive the, the plancher. So we I need it to get level so I can evolve it so I can get it out of here. But let's also put something stronger up front. Um, I'll probably end up killing anything anyway, but allow me to honor you and your Pokemon with a battle. Don't you think Pokemon are just gorgeous when they're showing off their moves? All right, you're challenged by mysterious sisters. Achille, Achille, huh? Oh, those are some cool Pokemon though. Gardevoir and Alakazam. Cool. Well, let's go ahead and just kill everything on the screen, I guess. I wonder, will it kill both of them? Of course it doesn't kill the other one, man. It never does. Why? I just wasted a revive on the Clauncher. That's not gonna hurt me too badly. 
Um, let's bring it into the sand dial. Come on. Um, we can hit it with a power gem. I think that'll be enough. Because we got too much health left, so. Sandel to 25. No. Sandel does not need swagger, and I might even evolve actually. <clears throat> 100 to 25, double to 27. What a beautiful combination you and your Pokemon make. Give me that shmoney. Do we got an evolution? No, apparently not. Okay. No, we're still on the same route, so I don't need to use strength again. Um. Let's waste another revive in the launcher. I really need it to be alive so we can get XP. Where does this take us? Okay, this takes us to <clears throat> a waterfall, and I can't actually go up the waterfall, so I'm gonna leave it alone. Oh, did my repel wear off? All right, well, Phantom. I guess we can look for a phantom while we're here. There's no reason not to. Um, yeah. So, I'm not gonna put another repel on. I'm, I'm, I need some. I need another Pokemon. There's no reason to. You know, I can look now, or I can look later. But I'm gonna have to look at some point anyway, right? So, there's no new hordes right now. Okay, there's not. So just a Murkrow, Fungus, and the Clef Key. Guess what? Guess what? My mommy made this dress for me. It, it couldn't be as good as mommy. Why did I say that like that? Alright, we're at the Lost Hotel, I'm guessing? Where are we? Are these people we can fight? They're probably people we can fight. Is there a town here? Oh, this is probably just the entrance to Limoese, whatever, right? Alright, cool. Well then, hey, if we're in town, we might as well get ourselves healed very quickly. Evolve. 39. Okay, that's actually perfect. Because that way, you know, we don't have to keep it too long on us, but it is something we can just kind of get out of the way here. Also, did I neglect to heal? The whole reason we came. Let's go ahead and heal really quickly. Okay. Right, I'm guessing those people are not going to give me anything. So, Route 16. I guess let's check out what's in here. You look... Ooh! Hey! Give me the super rod? Look at that. Alright. Funny enough, the super rod will not get me anything new in these waters, but it will help me get stuff in later waters. Okay, yeah, this is the guy that... It just so happens that I'm a consecutive fishing pro. They call me the general. If this guy can tell me my highest score... Because I was fishing for Starmie, remember? My current best is seven times in a row. Pretty impressive, huh? I tell you what. If you somehow manage to beat my record, I'll give you some dive balls. Let's see, your best record for consecutive fishing is 211. I was wondering, like, what my record was, because, I again, I hunted for Starmie, like, 12 hours. There it is. My record is 211, which is also nuts that I only got something after 211. What incredible skill. They call me the general, but I've got nothing on you. Don't let it be... Don't, don't let it be said that I'm not true to my word. Here are some dive balls as promised. 20? Hey, yo. This is just a rumor, but word is that you catch some rare Pokemon through consecutive fishing. Okay. He's not going to give me any more. But 20 dive balls? Hey, yo. Now, my question is, what are those good for? Dive ball. Catching Pokemon that live underwater. Okay. Interesting. Alright, well, there's 
once again, not actually anything new I can catch in these waters, but we could battle these people very quickly. Just when I thought I had lost the biggest catch of my life, you show up, and an even bigger catch, I say. Um, alright, let's fight this guy. I was thinking, should I end off the episode here? But nah, we'll, we'll fight a few people before. Um, oh, there's actually only three battles. So maybe a couple of them aren't actually real battles. Let's use Dazzling Gleam. I don't think it'll be effective, but I don't think the Lightning or Water will be either. Okay, Aqua Tail, that's fine. Okay. That works. Bonk. Starmie to 61. Alright, everyone else grew. I may keep losing the big catches, but I won't let it get to me. Persistence is key. And that's some big facts, because I had to be pretty persistent. Whoa, that's some strong pull on the fishing line. Looks like you're a tough catch. No, we don't need to confuse Ray and Flaffy. Ah, that was some rootin' tootin' Pokemon battle. My whirly, my whirly thing is all tuckered out. Alright, one more. You can't make friends with a Pokemon under the water unless you take up fishing. Alright, is it Finn? Lots of things that won't make sense until you try them. All right. What is over here? All right, just an item. Hey, another dive ball. Hey, it's one of those. All right, cool. Real quick, how do we get to the guy in the middle? Oh, he's not in the middle. He's on the little island. Okay. All right, well, I think we're good to go here, really. Um, you just need Phantom? Okay, I was like hoping, I'm like, Phantom? That would be like a pretty neat entrance way, but sadly not. Um, uh, let's go ahead and push this. Wait, is this how we got here or is this a different thing? Oh, okay, it's a different thing. And we got ourselves the fist plate. Cool. Is there anything in this rock? Hey, there's a... I'm glad I checked it. I'm glad I checked it. I usually don't check things like that. All right, Phantom, where you at? I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna keep looking for you on our way to the Lost Hotel. Left key. You're close. It's a psychic Pokemon, but I'm looking for a ghost Pokemon instead, actually. We can kind of make our way back up here. Actually, I don't need to go up there. We already battled those two. A lot of grass. Holy. Okay. Pumpkaboo. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't realize Pumpkaboo would be in here. My eyes are getting bad, apparently. I don't know why I just neglected to see that Pumpkaboo is also something new. Alright, so it's Phantump and Pumpkaboo. That's it, though. There's nothing else, actually. Four from Ward? Hey, look at that. Ooh, apparently... So, the Pumpkaboos come in different sizes. The big Pumpkaboo is 1%. Which is interesting. Um... What about Withdraw? I can get rid of Withdraw. So, we could potentially hunt the pump, big pump kaboo, but I don't... How would I know whether it's a big pump kaboo or a small pump kaboo? The pumpkin body is inhabited by a spirit trapped in this world. As the sun sets, it becomes restless and active. I'm guessing this is one of the small ones, because it looks 
on the smaller side. Okay, but... Okay, the tall grass isn't particularly better at finding the phantom, but it's they're really the same percentage. Um... Alright. Um... I just want to make sure I don't miss anything here. Okay, okay, we already got all of this, right? Yep. Alright, cool. Let me kind of make our way back here. We got our pump kaboo. Not really looking for a bigger pump kaboo, that's fine. So wait. I think there might be an item here. Using a dowsing machine. Is there an item here? Maybe? No, apparently there's no item here. Okay, fair enough, I guess. Down there is the Lost Hotel. So I guess, let's try to find Phantom real quick. Or, yeah, Phantom. And then once we find Phantom, we can go down to the Lost Hotel. Okay, here we go. We got ourselves the Phantom. Um, yeah. Time to catch it. And then we can go ahead and head into the Lost Hotel, where there is... Oh, that's a creepy sound. There is a couple new Pokemon. We got Magneton, we got Electrode, we got Litwick. Oh. Don't do that. Okay. That was weird. But we also got Rotom, Trubbish, and Garbodor, which is cool. And a few trainers. And... Bop, there we go, we got ourselves the Phantom. Ba -ba 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 Alright. These Pokemon are created when spirits possess rotten tree stumps. They prefer to live in abandoned forests. Sad. Okay, well, if we go down here. Oh, wait, I just saw like an item. How do I. Okay, well, I want to get to that. Okay, let's actually head down into the hotel here um, and meet our first Pokemon. Maybe it's something brand new? Sure is. We got ourselves an Electrode. I don't know where we can get one of the Voltorbs. Maybe I'll have to breed to get the Voltorb. I don't think there's any special ball to catch Electrode Pokemon, right? So, we'll just have to throw some Ultra Balls at it. And it looks like it wants to be well behaved, so perfect. Alright guys, but with that catch, we're actually going to end off the episode here. Um, yeah, we'll finish off the rest of the hotel next episode, including getting Litwick, Magneton, Rotom, Trubbish, and Garbodor. It explodes in response to even minor stimuli. It is feared with the nickname of the Bomb Ball. Well, see you guys later. Hey everybody, we're playing some more Pokemon. We just got to the Lost Hotel. We got ourselves an Electrode. We're still looking for a couple other Pokemon. You're trying to get in my way of having a bit of fun, aren't you? I ain't gonna let that happen. Okie dokie, bud. Alright, Slater? What do you got? You got Dunsparce? It's a weird Pokemon. Imagine having a single Pokemon and you're like, yeah, Dunsparce. That's the one. Only one. All of these Pokemon everywhere. Dunsparce. Alright, Slater is a man of uh, integrity and style. Alright, Slater. I was just trying to find peace is all honest. Okay, well, oh, hey, we got our Flaffy evolving. That's pretty cool. And I do think we have the Ampharo site, so we can't Mega Evolve Ampharos if we wanted. Probably not going to, but we can. Alright, we got ourselves an Ampharos. With a little smile. I like Ampharos. Ampharos is a, 
He's a real homie. Yeah, I want Thunder Punch. Probably get rid of Thunder Wave. I don't need Thunder Wave. There we go. Okay. Uh, wait, can I break these? Did I get rid of the Pokemon with Rock Smash? Yes, okay, cool. That's what I thought. I'm like, I don't know how else I'd punch through the wall. Okay, there's nothing in here. What about inside of this one, maybe? Maybe, maybe, maybe there's something inside of here? Hey, yo. Got ourselves a Dread Plate. It's probably enhances ghost types, right? I would assume. Right, let's see, me new Pokemon, maybe? Hey, yo. Litwig. Pretty cool one. Definitely one of the cooler... Coolest Pokemon, actually. I would say cooler, but no, it's the coolest. A Fire Ghost is, like, one of the best typings, and, like, I really like Litwick's design, too, especially Chandelure. So. Definitely in contention to one of those maybe final Pokemon on my team, for sure. I, I really like Litwick and Chandelure, so... Oh, hey, crit catch. Okay, cool. You absolutely love to see it. Alright, Litwick's data was added. While shining a light and pretending to be a guide, it leeches off the light force of the of who it follows. Spook. Alright, let's see. Anything inside of here? Boom. Nothing. It's not for skating, but I've got a trick to teach you. Try using this move, would ya? Okay, fling. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, let's keep moving. Hey, yo, Ponyard. Pon... Okay, I don't need you, though. I've actually already caught one of you. Very cool Pokemon. Another very, very cool Pokemon, but... I have caught it, so I don't need it. Mm. Trash can. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to fight this guy inevitably. Hey, Magneton. And hey, actually, that is all of the Pokemon, actually. We have caught Magneton, we caught Electrode last episode, we got Litwick, we already have Ponyard, and we have Klefki. So, we just have Rotom, Trubbish, and Gardevoir from the Shaking Areas. After we catch this, so that's pretty cool. Where is my phone? Oh, my phone's in my pocket. Let's go ahead and give it another ball here. Come on, purchase. Why does why does Ashley furniture? It keeps sending me that it's charging me again and again and again. Why are you doing that? I just throw another Pokeball here. I guess I'll just check my banking. I don't know why it keeps telling me. Alright, just stay in the ball, por favor. Magneton. Stay in the box. All right. Um, I probably wasted a good like twenty thousand dollars on this single Magneton, which is very wonderful, and I actually got most of my Pokemon killed. Um, so not very cool. I don't particularly appreciate it. A linked cluster forming of several Magnemite discharges powerful magnetic waves at high voltage. Well, you're gonna go ahead and go on my PC and be there. For very long time. And our sand dial is evolving, which is also pretty epic. Boom, boom. But I probably will have to get out of here and actually go back and heal, because I'm not using like five revives. Like that's also expensive. I'd rather just run back. Alright, we got ourselves uh 
Crocorock, Gorok. Crocorock. Yeah, Crocorock, okay. Crocorock, Crocorock, Crocorock. I'm like, I'm, I don't know how many rocks there are. Do I have an escape rope? Is that like a thing? Is that a thing that we got? Let's go and use the escape rope. Let's get out of here. I need to go and heal. Um, let's also use a repel. Alright. We're back. Um, I went ahead and put away Ampharos. I went ahead and grabbed Staravia. Let's go and do it. My buddy was putting on the whole bad guy act, so I copied him and ended, copied him and ended up like this. Oh, I'm sorry, Jackass. That's not very cash money. Have yourself a stunky, huh? Interesting. Well, I'm not gonna be here for very long, huh? Alright, we got our Stormy level 62. The level to 30. Brawdaunt. Okay, we'll go ahead and uh, do a little Thunderbolt on this bad boy, huh? Thunderbolt. Zap. Right, Starting at 23. Nah, we don't need Whirlwind. Eee, please forgive me. Bro, it's alright. Like, it's, not, it's not a big deal, honest. You're good. Um. Okay. I'm like losing myself. Okay, go this way. Both my mom and my old man are veterans, and my big bro is an ace trainer. I just couldn't stand to be all goody two shoes like them. How boring can you get? See, but like, what's wrong with being a goody two shoes? I feel like the connotation of being a goody two-shoes is only given by those who are not. But if you are one, why does it matter what they say? You know what I'm Eh. I never got people like that. Is it just because they want to be different? Why do you want to be different? Like, just... Why can't you just be content to who you are? I don't understand people. Why do you have to try to be something you're not just because it's something different from everyone else? Alright. Who you got next? Another one? Alright, well, we're gonna go ahead and uh, surf it again, I guess. Alright. There we go. Pretty easy. Pretty easy. Fungus to level 37. Arabia to 24. Don't care about losing, I just love the thrill of battle. And that is wonderful. Alright, let's Okay. I was like, can I break can I break through the back? Bonk. Alright, a protector. Interesting. And if we just break through See, why would anyone go through the other one? Well I guess if you already got the item you're coming back through for some reason, but still. Trash can. Alright. Is... Is this it? Am I missing something? Hold on. Smoke ball. I think that's it. I mean... I think we can come back here when we have, like... Skate skills or something? I don't know, but... Whatever's here... You actually can't do it right now. So... Yeah, I, I guess let's get out of here. And we'll come back later when we have the skate skills. So for now... I don't want to use another one. So we're actually... We're on our way now. What's nice about windmills is they can move by a breeze and in a pinch by people or Pokemon. I hear your future is secure if you join Team Flare. All right, we are now in Dendemil Town. Okay, so we got a lot to explore. Welcome, Moo Moo Milk. This is 500. Um, I'll take one. 
I think I already- actually, I probably shouldn't- I already have a Moo Moo Milk. I just want to make sure I keep some on me because it seems like in every game there's one person that takes, um, drinks for TMs. Like, lemonades and waters and Moo Moo Milks. Um, so I want to make sure I kind of keep a couple on me so I could get those TMs when the time comes by. Okay, let's head over here. Can I help you? Yes. I need more Ultra Balls because I wasted so many. Let's buy about 41 of those. Do I need anything else? Probably a couple more Max Repels. Alright, so that's good. Let's see. Oh, I was going let's see what the other guy sells, but it's only one guy here. Um, I can change my clothes, but I still haven't really bought any. It's kind of funny. Um. Okay, so that's the exit to somewhere else. Okay, so we'll come back down here later. This is this is the way to get out of here. Why, hello, David. Hey, yo. How have you been? How's your journey going? You see, when I was younger, I visited many different regions as well. I met many kinds of Pokemon and noticed how each place has its own distinct flavors. So I really came to enjoy trying new foods as I traveled. Because, I'd, because of my adventures, I'm an expert on the cafes all over Kalos. Come on now, Dexio, I'm going somewhere with this. Do you remember the Pokem uh, Pokemon Lissandre mentioned in that cafe? Wonderful, I knew you would. Kalos' legendary Pokemon is called Xerneas. According to material I've read, those who saw it were overwhelmed by its power. They were only able to say that the Pokemon has resembled the letter X. Apparently, this Pokemon can control energy, gives life to plants and Pokemon, and it makes them full of vitality again. Whatever do you think a Pokemon that amazing could be now? When Kalos' legendary Pokemon loses all of its vitality, it goes to sleep in a secret place. I don't have a clue where it could be. The writings that mention it are also around a thousand years old, so they aren't much help. It would be absolutely astounding if you found it, David. Maybe I'll look into the legend a bit. If I find something, I'll let you know. Haha, uh, it would be a thrill if you found it indeed, but your journey is yours and yours alone. I want you to enjoy yourself and do whatever you'd like. Ooh. Um, is the professor gone already? I was hoping to have him have a look at my Pokedex in person. Oh well, I can still get my Pokedex evaluated at a Pokemon Center's PC. Anyways, I'm heading off to look for the Pokemon in the Frost Cavern. I'll fill up more of my Pokedex. Alright. Windmills rotate just like the Wheel of Destiny, so rotation battles are windmills. Ah, I mean destiny. The Mammal Swine is amazing. It lived 10,000 years frozen in ice. Alright, where is all... Whoa, this is bendy. Okay, well, let's go house by house. Let's not uh, overshoot ourselves here. Leo. So bad guys are like, we'll take over the world, but I think it would be really hard. Okay, I don't care what the guys are saying. Ah, you have Pokedex. How many Pokemon have you found on the mountain? 39. If you find 70 more, I'll give you something sure to delight. Okay, noted. This guy, come back when I have more. Um. Okay, windmill. Um, oh, facade, okay, facade, Jesus, facade, facade, alright, shorts kid, I appreciate it, one of the ways that Pokemon trainers make their strong, Pokemon strong is to use TMs, but do you have the TM for energy ball, wait, no, okay, I, what was the point of that conversation, was she gonna give me something if I did? Anyway, what's in this house? Okay. How many similarities do you think Tyanimo and Maltham share with each other? I don't know, man. You guys got anything? You got any items to give me? Alright, whatever. I don't care. I want items, brother. Not talk. Okay, um, wait a minute. If I go up here... Okay, I go up here... Where does this take me? Frost Cavern. Okay, so that takes me over to Frost Cavern. I don't want to go there yet. Let's see where this takes us. That just takes us back down. Oh, that's right. I am the move deleter. Okay. Okay, move deleter. Very cool. I don't need that now, but I might need them later. 
man. Um. Okay. All right. I don't need any Pokemon to actually remember any moves. All right, but noted this house, this town is kind of important. There's a lot of things we can come back for. Okay. When I'm working in the fields and plowing the soil, I feel like part of nature. All right, big root. All right, cool. So we kind of explored the whole town. When we're done with the Frost Cavern, we're going to go down that way to get out of here. But as far as that's concerned, we're kind of done. Okay, well, I guess that's where we're also going now. So let's go ahead and head up into the Frost Cavern. Um, let's see. I'm confused. Oh, Route 15, Dendeville. Okay, so actually, before we go there, there isn't actually anything new to catch, but there is one thing that we do need to do. Yo, where's the Poka Center for this place? Does this place not have a Poka Center? Oh, I literally was just here. We need to take an Eevee with us, because if we evolve an Eevee down, the, uh, down near a rock down there, we can get something. So, let's go ahead and just put Staravia in the box for a second. And let's go ahead and grab an Eevee. Oh, not deposit. Yeah, let's grab one of the thousands of Eevees that we caught. I think they're all like level 20, right? Um. Alright. Let's see. Okay, cool. Yep, so, like, look, if I'm here, I might as well get the Glaceon. Um, it's gonna be a pain to come back here later in the game and, you know, blah, blah, blah. So, hey, look, I'm going. I might as well get it done, right? So, anyway. Burr, it's so cold. You came here just the right time. Let's warm our bodies with vigorous Pokemon battling. That sounds weird. Um, Ross. <laughs> He's got a big Rava, though. <laughs> Alright, I will take you out of the sky with a uh, big old surf. I could probably use an electricity, but I'm gonna do that, too. Woo! That's a... I was, like, I went off pace for one second, all of a sudden a video plays. Um... No, we don't- we don't need this. No, we don't need that. Alright. Is this cold I feel coming from snow and ice around me? From the shame of my defeat? Lol, dude. Okay, so that's a waterfall. It's a mammal swine. Something wrong in the Frost Cavern, Mammal Swine. Are you headed to the Frost Cavern Trainer? This Mammal Swine here usually can't get enough of giving people rides in Route 17, but these days it seems to be worried about something in the Frost Cavern to give rides. So maybe it's tensed, okay. And you are? My name is Trevor. I'm researching the distribution of Pokemon in the Kalos region at Professor Sycamore's request. I see, so that's why you're walking clear out. To, you're walking clear out to the uh, it seems concerned about something okay all right so just hey wh what are you going to do big D I'm going to prepare for my expedition I'm just gonna head right in bud I'm kind of already ready um okay stop right there youngster I'm gonna paint your portrait let me guess you got a smear goal of course he's got a smear goal what else would a painter have all painters have smeargles. Alright, we'll give it a good old surf here. And... Um... Wait a minute, there are Pokemon here. Okay, for some reason I thought there was no Pokemon here. There are, it seems like there are different Pokemon on each... Okay. 
I told you not to budge an inch, so there are Pokemon here. Is there like anything on the sides? Apparently not, okay. So wait, outside, okay, there's nothing on the outside, but there are first floor. Okay, we've got, ooh, okay, so no, no bike, no rollers. We do have quite a few things to catch. Hey there, you look pretty strong. I'd be missing out if I let you go without battling. Ace Trainer Cordelia. Doublade. Oh, that's a cool Pokemon, actually. That is indeed a very cool Pokemon. Um, I'll just hit it with the Surf. It might not be effective. I think Thunder might have been, but it's alright either way. The levels are coming up. Level 46 already. Cool. Rock Rock to 31. Oh, that was close. Just a bit more now. What a one. Okay. Hmm. Is, it not Is there nothing here? Alright. We got ourselves a Bergmite. Very cool. Let's see, can I, can I not kill it with a power gem? Okay, that was super effective, so we very much did kill it. Fair enough, I guess. All right, we found a dire hit. Let's see, we gotta check both rocks just in case. Okay, nothing in that one. Now let's see what else we can find. Ooh, a bear tick. Oh, okay, I was like, can we find this lower evolution? But we can. Oh, and I didn't bring my... Oh, man, I didn't bring my... Um... Thingy. Um, let's hit it with a... Thunderbolt. Let's see, we'll just kill it. I didn't bring my combi with me. Alright. There we go. Got it into the yellow at least. Yeah, I'll, I think I might have to go back to my combi. Um, but what we'll probably end up doing is we can do that after. It's fine. And we could also face a couple hordes while we're here. So, oh, you, that was a weird little move thing that he just did. All right, another ultra ball, another day, huh? Bear tick. You'll love to see it. You're mine. Here we go. Level 63. The, they love the cold seas of the north. They create pathways across the ocean waters by freezing their own breath. That is weird. That is very weird. We got ourselves a battle. Rain or snow, it matters not. An ace trainer does not let anything get in his way. An ace trainer is always elegant, whatever he does. That's what it defines an ace trainer. Okay, bud. Ow. Can you go away so I can, like, go upwards? Oh, never mind. Uh. Okay. Alright, let's see if we can get anything new. There we go. A jinx that is. Something new. Here we go. Now, I think a dazzling gleam will definitely not kill it. Oh, Whew. almost did though. All right, let's go and throw a ultra ball at it here. Do as we do, what we usually do. First one. Hey, look at that. First one. You'll love to see it. Cool. Alright, another one in our Pokedex. It wiggles its hips as it walks. It can cause people to dance in unison. Alright, so skirt here. Get ourselves an ice heel. 
All right, let's go down maybe here. Okay. Hmm. What about the middle? Hmm. Do something like that. Okay, and what if we go like this? Okay. Both my father and mother were f hikers before me. It runs in the family, you see? Okay. Alright, Delman, what you got, bud? Ooh, that's a pretty good Pokemon, actually. A Rectolanth or whatever you say it? Re rel Relicanth. Um, I think a Surf would be best. I know it's a Water Pokemon, but a Thunder I don't think would be effective either. So. There we go. Alright, I need to get to that rock, because Eevee's going to get way too high. I need to get to that dumb rock. Ooh, that's a cool Pokemon, though. A Rhydon. Look at that. Alright, people are pulling out some actual cool Pokemon nowadays. All these other people are lames, man. This guy's got a Rhydon. That's cool. I've been defeated. Whatever shall I do? My identity crumbles before me. Ourselves another ice heal. Probably won't need it or ever use it, but it is with us. Ooh, walk right into battle. People say it doesn't matter if you win or lose, but of course, everyone wants to win strategy. What strategy? I have trust in our Grumpig and Hariyama. That's all we need. Alright, by Eon and Wolf. Brains and Brawn. Alright, one's got a Sumo Wrestler, the other one's got a failed Sumo Wrestler that... Yeah, alright, anyway. Um... Let's go ahead and... Man, I could surf him, but I'll definitely kill Clauncher. So let's just do a Thunderbolt on the Grumpig. Clauncher will go ahead and Crab Hammer on the Hariyama. I think that'll work, too. Is that gonna kill it? Why do you have to hit the Clauncher, dude? Hit the Starmie! Alright, you're gonna make me angry. I'm gonna pull out the fungus. Man, I should have just surfed it up. Let's go ahead and Giga Drain on the Hariyama. Alright, Grumpig, you're out of here, bud. Nice Starmie level 64. Fungus 39. Clear smog. No, he doesn't need clear smog. Crocorock to 33. Belly drum. What? Okay. Interesting. Don't know why I did that. Fair enough. Do another thunderbolt. That wasn't particularly a good idea, taking its half of its HP away, but eh, what am I to say? I swear, man, Clauncher is never gonna get, never gonna evolve because I keep, keep getting it killed. Yeah, it's over. Yep, we're done. Uh, you're done. All right, Fungus. Here we go. I need to get to that stupid rock. I want to see if there's any difference in the Pokemon that we find. It doesn't actually look like it. Okay. Got ourselves a Fungus Among Us. I put a Among Us meme right here. Thank you. Um, Alright, let's see. We gotta go fight that guy anyway. What's this? Are you trying to thwart my attempts at love? <laughs> Eat this karate chop. Oh, chill. 
Yo, who I finally realized there's someone in this freezing cave. So, here we go. Dwebble is also evolving. So, we'll get a lot of evolutions going here, which is kind of cool. I just, I need to get down to that basement so I can evolve our Glaceon. But, it'll be cool. We'll actually, like, that's like three evolutions, so we could get another three going. Alright, we got ourselves. Your Dwebble evolved into a Crustle. Very cool. Alright, let's see. Which Pokemon are dead? Alright, we need to revive Croc Rock and Clonita. Okay. Oh, uh, there we go. Alright, but we, th we do have to still catch a bunch here. Not you, Bear Tick. Not looking for you, bud. I'll go ahead and definitely run from you. Because I don't need ya. Alright, ooh, a Max Repel. That's kind of not that useful, but useful nonetheless. Just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Ooh. Okay, bang, bang, yep, there we go. Ooh, more battles. It's probably, it's probably Hyper Potion, the Starmie here. I don't want to have another situation where I die again. Hyper Potion. Oh, it doesn't look like this guy wants to fight me, though. Let's make a bull so we can rest. Oh, okay. I wasted that revive. Those two revives. Oh, no, I can't feel my toes. Lost. Sorry, man. Anything in these rocks? Hey, super potion. I knew there'd be something in there. Interesting. Doesn't look like this is getting me anywhere, but look, we we be shifting. How do I get back to dry land? Dude, how do I get back to land? Am I stuck? Oh, I think I could. Yeah, okay, I could go back like this. I'm like, cheese, man. I've I've fallen and I can't get up. Okay, there's not one, nothing there that can save me. Okay. Interesting. Okay. I'm like kind of zero braining this, but. Oh. Could you do that, I guess? When it's cold, it's best to have a battle to warm up with. Alright, Brent. Ooh, he's got a probo pass. Oh, 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 oh. Very cool, Probo Pass. Very cool. Wonder, will, will a Thunderbolt, is that like effective against Probo Pass? Probably not. Oops. Okay, Earth Power. That should hurt a little bit, but not too much. Later with another Thunderbolt. Zap. I love that juice. Alright, Starmie to 65. Crustle grew to 35. Just give you the 28. Getting a cold sweat from putting on such a terrible performance. I need to get to that stupid glacier because Eevee's going to keep evolving and it's going to be hard to get it to a high enough level later. The secret to karate is good circular movement. Alright, Kenji. 
They got Girder. That is a cool Pokemon. I do like Girder, actually. That is one of the Poke. I have a shiny Girder in Pokemon Go. But I can't find a friend who has another, sh their own shiny Girder to trade with me. Or, no, shiny, not Girder. The one right before Girder. Um, not Timber. I don't know. Point is, I have one of them, of Shiny, and I can't find a friend to trade one with me. Ooh. It's really cold in here, isn't it, Big D? Is there something going up, going on up ahead? Hey, leave that Bomba Stone alone. This Bomba Stone is a fine specimen. It's absolutely brimming with energy. The more we agitate it, the stronger its snow warning ability becomes, making the snowfall even more viciously. Furiously. Hey, you know what? We're going to continue this next episode, guys. Thanks for watching. Hey, everybody. We're playing some Pokemon X here. We, we're in the Frozen Cavern, Frosted Cavern. Yeah. And we just got to this Obama Snow with Team Flare. So let's do this. Let's catch a Swiftly and get out of here. Um, why don't I catch it? Hey. Hey, you Pokeball thieves. What are you doing here? What does it look like? We're catching Pokemon. Why else would we we have grabbed all those Pokeballs? If it was also we could catch powerful Pokemon like this Obama Stone. It's full of potent energy. You're not the brightest, are you? Whoever has the most Pokemon and the most energy will come out on top. Lazy people who just wait for things to be handed to them don't get don't get to have these resources. But why is Team Flare amassing Pokemon energy and money? To put it another way, why is Team Flare always trying to take everything for itself? Let me to spell it out for you. It's so Team Flare and only Team Flare can survive. After all, why should we care about saving people who aren't on our side? Anyway, I don't mind a healthy curiosity, but I'm afraid I just don't have time anymore. Big D, did they say only Team Flare will survive? These people have a few loose screws. You two, hurry up and send these kids packing. Alright. Um, let's do it, I guess. I mean, if you really, really want to fight, we can do it, but probably not going to end very well. Oh, what do you got? Gold bat? What's your other one? Oh, wait. Oh, we're not doing a double battle? I thought we were doing a double battle. Lame. Alright, well, I'm gonna thunderbolt you out of the sky, bud. Dead. What's your second one? Is there also something I can thunder out of the sky? Rock a rock the 35. Oh, main, main trick. Well, that one I can actually surf on. Alright, pull out a surf. Bonk. There we go. Starmie. Yep, there we go. XP share. Among Us to 41. How, how do you think it could reverse time? Okay, whatever. Shut up. Give me your money. I may have lost, but isn't this Winter Wonderland beautiful? Almost as beautiful as Team Flare Pose. Hmm, you're more powerful than you look. I wonder how much energy there is inside you. You're challenged by Team Flare Mabel. Once again, like six spectacles, man, but... I don't know what's with, like, the color scheme and the hairdo. I think it's kind of lame, not gonna lie. Alright, Hound Doom. You're gonna get surfed upon. Sucks for you, but oh well. Bonk. Alright, EB to level 29. Nope, we don't need charm here. No, just too strong. Give me your money. Hmm, I have no patience for losing. Let's get out of here. Doesn't battling with Team Flare scare you, Big D? I'll admit it scares me. I don't like battling them, but we managed to protect Obama Snow by pitching it here. I know I'm the reserve type and I'm okay with that, but it's important to be bold when necessary. Mamma Swine doesn't have to worry about Obama Snow anymore, and that's what matters. All's well that ends well. Now, question is Am I gonna be an absolute wiener and try to catch this myself? Obama Snow White? Cool. Okay, I'm guessing this is not a catchable Pokemon. All right, I won't catch you. That's fine. 
I could totally just like lob a ball at her right now, but whatever. Hey, we got a horde of Vanillites. Okay, that is one of the horde Pokemon. So yes, I will go ahead and do that. Um, I don't know. have the last vanilla let's go ahead and chuck an ultra ball at it let's see how many of these it's gonna take hopefully not too many hey first one all right vanilla being an absolute homie all right so now we just need two other horde the smoochum and the cub chew The temperature of their breath is negative 58 degrees Fahrenheit. They create snow crystals and make snowfall in the areas around them. I like Vanillite. I know when this generation came out, people like specifically targeted Vanillite as like, um, as like an example of them losing their creativity. But I'm actually not a part of that. I I definitely I like Vanillite. I think it's a it's a nice Pokemon. Now the question is, oh lord, I did it again, why did I do it again? Okay, maybe we can find one, one more new Pokemon. Hey, Bergmite, okay, that is something that we do not have. I will definitely take it. So let's instantly just start chucking balls at it here. Yeah, so I think we got the Jinx, the Bear Tick, the Bergmite, we have Haunter, so we just need the Cryagonal. And the Pilos, Piloswine, Piloswine. And then obviously the two Horde Pokemon. And then let me quickly double check. Is there anything we can fish for? Doesn't... Um, there is, but none of it's new. Thank you. Alright, there we go. Bergman was caught. You'll love to see it. It blocks opponent's attacks with the ice that shields his body. It uses cold air to repair any cracks in the ice. Very cool. Alright. Oh. Wait, no, that's the way, like, back up. Where is this? Where? Hey, we'll take a hey, of swine. There we go. I was like, I will take a new Pokemon though. That's something I will never mind. All right. Well, we can grab this while we're here. Just gonna Ultra Ball at it. Bonk, bonk. Hey, will it just be nice? Look at that. Pilo swine on its absolute best behavior. You, you love to see it. Alright, Clauncher to 37. Although its legs are short, its rugged hooves prevent it from slipping even on icy ground. Very nice. Our shiny Clauncher is finally evolving. Look at that. It's been a little minute. I accidentally kept killing the Clauncher, so it kept like not being able to get levels. And that is a fourth Pokemon that we can swap out of the box so we can get something new in. Very cool. There we go. Got ourselves whatever this thing is called. Clawitzer. Very nice. Totally not just a ripoff of Kingler, but hey, whatever. Who am I to say? Okay, where is this? Oh, I didn't realize I could surf here. Okay. Okay, that doesn't go anywhere. There's there's nothing that we actually need from surfing, right? No, I think it's just Float Soul. Yeah, it's just Polyworld and Float Soul. 
Now, I could probably grab a Poliwhirl just to have a high level Poliwhirl, but eh. Maybe I'll throw like a Netball at it and call it a day, but... Okay, what's over here? Is this? Ah, yes, okay, this is the rock. The rock that we needed. So we're gonna stay here and kill stuff until Eevee can evolve. And then we get ourselves a Glaceon, which is kind of cool. So, um, wait, what's effective again? Is Power Gym effective? Okay, here we go. Our Eevee evolved to 30, so there we go. And that's what we were looking for. So I think now we're literally just looking for that Cryagonal, and we're kind of good here. So we got, we got all of those. Got all of those. Okay, we just need the Smoochum and the Cub Chew. All right, we're still, okay, so yeah, we're still looking for the Smoochum and Cub Chew, technically, but. Yeah, well, anyway. Back to our main goal here. Hey, we got a Glaceon, which is kind of cool. I like Glaceon. Um, all right. Well, let's go ahead and Hyper Potion our Starmie. And we're, there's still a couple Pokemon we're looking for. And obviously, I'm not going to leave until I get them. So, I'm probably just going to shut up until I find them. And then we'll talk when we find them. All right. There it is. There is the Cryagonal. All right, let's go and throw some Ultra Balls. All right, so the only two we need is Cub Chew and Smoochum. Um... Ooh, is it gonna be nice too? Nah, of course it's not gonna be nice. Um... So we'll have to come back with... our... Home B, sadly. But it's all right. Got a lot of Pokemon to put away, so... All right, well, it's going to be one of those, huh? Let me go ahead and get my phone out. I'll open up Reddit. I'm just going to keep hitting the Ultra Ball button, and we'll get it eventually, right? One of these times, it'll stay in the ball. Balls at it, but we made we made it eventually. And Cryagonal stuff was added to the decks. They are born in snow clouds. They use chains made of ice crystals to capture prey. Very sad, very weird. Alright, let's get out of here. Um now we do have to actually come back though because I just need to grab my combi very, very quickly. Okay, there we go. There is the cup chew. And then now we just need the other one. You smooch him. Its nose is always running its tips to snot back up because the mucus provides a raw material for moves. And I also just realized I think we might have left the last place we were at a little prematurely, and I think I might have forgot to catch a few things. So we'll have to go back. Um, but let's go ahead and catch Smoochum first, and then we'll worry about that after. All right, there we go. The Smoochum was caught after a stupidly, stupidly long battle of sleeps and confusion. We got it. So we have officially caught all of the Pokemon in this stupid cave. Its lips are the most sensitive part of its body. It always uses its lips first to examine things. Doesn't sound like a particularly good idea, bud, but sure, fair enough. Okay. 
we actually need to quickly go back to the shaking hotel because um we missed three pokemon rotom trubbish and garbodor in the shaking areas all right actually psych um so there are a couple pokemon that we're missing the problem is they're in these trash cans and apparently these trash cans only shake on tuesdays today is not a tuesday so um actually we'll just have to come back i guess so we can really we can just kind of move on to route 17 here and there's not many pokemon on route 17 but the ones that are there are all new so that's pretty cool um so okay let's go ahead and make our way into route 17 here can you give me anything okay maybe not okay what does 17 look like Ooh, there's trainers here i think there's just one trainer okay 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 just stop talking <laughs> all right we can ride a mammal swine that's pretty cool Ooh, there's a lot of snow. Okay. There's a few Pokemon we need to get, though. Alright, first one. The most common spawn, Bellybird. Ooh, I like how Starmie looks in this light. Um, actually, let's go ahead and hit it with something. We hit it with a Thunderbolt. Will it kill it? I hope it doesn't. Yeah, I kind of assumed it would. That's all right because the deli bird's a forty percent, so that's fine. Um, yeah, th that would only be bad if we hit the bomb of snow, which is the one percent in this area. So, oh, actually, I can probably smash those rocks over there. All right, there's another deli bird. Let's go ahead, and I won't hit this one just because I will kill it. Let's start chucking Ultra Balls, huh? Probably the easiest way to do this. Hey, look at that. Billy Bird wanted to be an absolute sweetheart and uh, not take too long. Which is good. Alright, it's Theravia 27. It carries food rolled up in its tail and has a habit of sharing food with people lost in the mountains. Very cool, Deli Bird. Very cool of you. Our Deli Bird to box three. There we go. Bink. I have to smash both rocks. Bink. Um. Okay. Is there like a. Oh, I'm guessing the mammoth mine can't get through, right? Okay. Let's go on our own. Let's see. Do I have to pull out the stupid device? No? Okay, found a timer ball. Okay, not very cool, but fair enough. And an icicle plate, all right. Very cool. That's all we probably need over here, so we can jump back on the mammal swine here. Just gonna put that away. Because we're still gonna need to look for Snowverse, Sneasel, and Obama Snow. Top of our ride. No, I didn't mean to get off. My bad. Get back on. Alright, man, my swine. The absolute unit. Come on, give me something new. Other than a freaking... Oh, wait, this is new. I don't know why I assumed it was a deli bird. It's a snow bird. It is new. Alright. Very cool. So, here's what we could do. 
We could just catch the Snowbird and then evolve it. Wait, when does Snowbird evolve? Snowbird evolution level 40. Okay. Well, then there's no reason to catch the Obama Snow. Because this thing evolves in literally a single level. Okay, well then, during cold season, it migrates to the mountains, the mountains lower reaches. It returns to the snow-covered summit in spring. Okay, well, I'm not going to even bother then to catch that Obama snow, because there's really not particularly a reason to do so. Is this the exit? I think that's the exit here. Okay. Well, we just got to look for Sneasel then. Once we find Sneasel, we're kind of good to go. Okay, there is the Sneasel. Last one to catch. Let's go and start chucking Ultra Balls at it. And hopefully it won't cause me too much trouble here. Ooh, okay, this one's going to cause me a lot of trouble. Well, time to pull out Reddit. And time to chill. You, you doing bad things. Don't do that. There we go. Sneasel was caught. Pancham 18. Dodo 18. It feeds on eggs stolen from Nessa's sharply hooked claws. Okay, that's slightly disturbing. It just kills baby things. Very interesting. Okay, we dropped off from Ammo Swine. I think we can get out of here, but not for a hollow clip. David, this time I challenge you to a battle in front of Anasar City Gym. Prepare yourself. Alright, well, we're gonna prepare ourselves in the next episode, guys. We're gonna go ahead and end it here. Thanks for watching. Um, yeah, I got a few good episodes in tonight. Time for me to go to sleep. I'll see you guys later. Hey everybody, today we're playing more Pokemon and um, everything's different. My See, I keep looking there because I'm expecting my camera to be there, but my camera's over there. I am now in a new uh, location. I got married. So this is my first time recording after I moved into a new place. And I've got a wife now and all that. But um, yeah, I haven't played in a little while, but I think everything's good. I think I've got my setup all good. I think I've got my audio all good. So let's go ahead and uh, get going here. So I think we just left whatever this place was. And we're heading into... I think it's uh, Anistar Town. You know what I find interesting? Never, uh, that is also facts. I wish... Yeah, because uh, some things can't just can't be revisited. There's not enough evidence. You there. Hi, that's me. I came in place of Dexio to tell you something. There's a person here in the Anastar City who knows about the legendary Pokemon. Oh, I almost forgot. I brought you some gifts. Put them to good use. Alright, some repeat balls. 
The peatfalls make it easier to catch kinds of Pokemon you've caught before. Even though they're the same species, the strengths and natures of individual Pokemon can be really different. Alright. Um, there would be probably something buried there. So there's, a, there's a sundial thing going up in this town. There's... Okay, why do I keep looking that way? There's that way. You know what I'm actually going to do? Let me flip-flop my screens. I'm going to put my OBS here. And then I'm going to put my Pokemon here that way. And then actually look at my face. Bing. Look at that. Alright, um... Last time I left, did I have enough balls? How many Ultra Balls did I have? 24? Okay, let's go ahead and buy 21 more. So let's go ahead and do that. Alright, and what do you got, bud? You got any moves? You got ooh. Okay, these are some really good moves actually, but they're very expensive. Holy! Um, I might have to hit up the casino and come back because that's a little nuts. What Pokemon did we leave off with? Starmie, Crocorock, Staravia, Combi, Pancham, Dodoa. Okay, cool. Looks like we're still good on that. We don't have to. We don't have to put anything back into the thing. And the memory girl. Oh, I'm good. Nothing that way. I still have, is when I, I want to trade with them. You want to trade Pokemon with your kids? Right, this is a fashion shop. I don't really need that because I'm not wasting any money and anything that isn't a Pokeball. Can Pokemon, can Pokemon type change depending on the Pokemon that it loves? However, the power of move is the same regardless of which Pokemon uses it. You there, use this and awaken your Pokemon's hidden power. Alright. That is, uh... No, I'm good. Um... Yeah. Alright, well, that's cool. HM. Even if I lose something, Luxray finds it for me. Pokemon are mysterious and amazing. Luxray is pretty mysterious and amazing. I agree. Okay. I wonder if it's Team Flare up in this joint. Why, hello there. You must be the apprentice of Professor Sigmore. I've heard so much about, and it's my guess that you've come to ask about the legendary Pokemon of the Kalos region, Xerneas. Well, allow me to tell you what I know. It happened around 800 years ago. The Pokemon known as Xerneas used its shining horns to illuminate the lands of Kalos, and at and that very moment, people and Pokemon throughout the land felt great energy and vitality surge through their bodies. At the same time, a vast forest sprang up with Xerneas at its center. Legend has it, when it nears the end of its thousand-year lifespan, Xerneas releases all of its energy, sharing it with all living things nearby. There's another story I know that talks of the appearance of such a first... Back 3,000 years ago, the Kalos region was engulfed in a terrible war, so the tale goes... Pokemon came to the rescue of all of the wounded Pokemon that have been caught up in the conflict. Some people suspect that Pokemon that appeared was Xerneas, but there's no way to know. Maybe they just wished the legendary Pokemon had come to the rescue to brighten the tale of woe. Supposedly, after Xerneas released its remaining energy, it transformed into a dried up tree. It remains in hiding deep within the forest, according to old tales, as I say. Stories and tales. What happened to the strange bunch of folks in the red outfits? I wonder if they're still out there seeking legendary Pokemon. A few years back, some came. Some people came around here asking the same questions. All right, get a little bit of lore. Let's see what else we can find. My, with my wife gone, my life has become very lonely. Would you be so kind as to lend me one of your Pokemon? You know, to keep me company. I hate to be picky, but I'd love to take care of a Pokemon that's level five or under. Okay. Oh, he doesn't actually give me a Pokemon. He just keeps it. And then something happens to him later. Okay. Well, I don't think I have one on me that's under level 5. Okay, I should probably come here in a little while. Let me head up this way first. David. That's me. Let me show you how much stronger I am. I did say we were going to be rivals back in the cafe in Limeway City, after all. Alright, we're fighting already? That was quick. Oh, Serena. Still the same old Pokemon? Got yourself a Meow Stick. Alrighty. Well, I'm up. I shiny Starby, as I usually do. 
Oh, I forgot to heal, didn't I? Oops. Oh, it's alright. Cool. I was like, Stormy should have out. Okay. Stormy should have out speed me out stick unless he uses a fake out like that. Hopefully I don't get killed by the rain. Only the 34. Ooh, that's gonna... Okay, I might have to just hyper potion really quickly. Um, or we could just go ahead and... Oh, I can't switch. Okay. Because anything else will die like, instantly. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and use... Hyper potion, just so we can get uh, Starmie out of buffet range, and then we'll... Um, kill this chest off. There we go. Brick break. Okay, that should hurt, but not... Oh, okay, it actually didn't hurt at all. We're both buffeted by this stupid ring. Alright. Um... Let's go ahead and... I don't think it matters. Let's go ahead and hit it with a Thunder Bull. I don't, start to... I don't think anything is actually effective against it. Well, that thing is... Strong, but it's paralyzed, so that's good. Okay, I don't know what is strong against it. Is is very strong against it. Um, I mean, at least it's paralyzed. I'll you know take that. Yeah, let's try to use maybe. I know it's a fighting, right? So maybe it's a fighting. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Okay, so okay. Apparently, fairy is effective. All right. Well, fair enough, I guess. Jeez, I'm new with this. Alright, 28. I don't really know, like, the typings of a lot of the new Pokemon. I know all the old ones. I don't know the new ones. And I, I don't know a lot of you, like, Pokemon X came out, like, 10 years ago. Yeah, I know. I just... That's how long... I, that shows what I've played, I guess, right? No, I don't need Pursuit. I'm a dirty gen. Absol. I could probably hit this with a surf. Just make it easy. I'm gonna kill it no matter what anyway, right? Let's go. Not like it's gonna matter. Bing bong. Okay. Is that one more? One more? Can't shame the 20. Um. Yeah, why don't we forget Leer? I don't particularly need Leer here. Go. Dodo to 20. And get buffeted by the hail. Vaporeon. Cool. I like Vaporeon. Did Serena have a Vaporeon last time we fought? I don't know, but I'm gonna Thunderbolt to Poop out. Oh, gee, why would she use that? We're getting a Thunderbolt this way. Wow, we just died. Interesting. Oh, I wish that buffeted would have killed it. That would have been kind of funny. Alright, another Thunderbolt. Yeah. There we go. Alright. Alright, that's on that one, huh? Home beat a 35. Pantera 21. Dodo to 21. Am I just not good enough to bring out the best of my Pokemon? No, I'm just better. You get good. Our Pokemon are so much stronger now, but you and your Pokemon are still one step ahead of us. Anyway, I'll heal your Pokemon here. Thank you. I actually needed that. You and your Pokemon are good enough to beat the gym leader. Go for it. I probably will. Thank you. Alright. What's in this direct? Okay, there's nothing there. And up north is probably the sundial, correct? Okay. What's in this house? And then maybe we'll just go fight the gym leader. Might as well just get her out of the way. Um, no. I, I, don't, I really gotta Google what is up with these cafes, because they I just keep giving them money, and they don't really give me anything back in return. Okay, so this is the way to the sundial. Okay, well, then let's go ahead and take down the gym first here. Should be a pretty easy gym overall. It's a psychic gym, and... I don't really need something effective against it, I'll just surf from the death and call it a day, you know. So, what do you know, Daddy? Oh, here you are, future champ. Baha, this place is amazing inside of a ball. Try getting your head around that one, right? 
Even if you find your way around, you'll have to watch out for all those psychic types. You've got some crazy powers, am I right? But don't give up and you'll find your way. Alright. Woo! That's... Kinda trip. Oh. Alright. That is super sick, actually. Very cool. Okay. Why did it even give me the option of coming over here? A little weird. Bro. Back it, get back in space. Let's try this way, I guess. Don't be distracted by your surroundings. Focus on unleashing your true power. Alright, Psychic Pascal. Let's see what you got. Execute. Alright, so probably shouldn't surf upon it. Just do the Dazzling Gleam. I don't, I don't think it's super effective. Okay, that's fine. Oh. Wow, that hurt a lot, actually. Okay. Oh, we're definitely gonna have to, like, go right after it. It's kinda nuts, but fair enough, I guess that wood hammer hurt quite a bit. Staravia 29. Yes, when you remain calm and undistracted, your Pokemon can realize their true potential. I. This goes where? I'm supposed to green. Okay. Um, yeah, that goes somewhere. Okay, so that doesn't go anywhere. What is the point of all of this? Pokedex, I know, I can, I know, catch them all, I know that. Mm. Let's go ahead and give that a little quick type of potion to start right here. I'm gonna start me topped off before we go into another battle with that. Could potentially have a couple more Pokemon than just the Executor. Okay, let's just keep going here. You can go anywhere as long as you never give up. Yeah, basically, that's kind of how it works, right? Alright, Psychic Carry. Very meta Pokemon and Pokemon Go right now, as far as PvP goes. Don't like the Pokemon, but fair enough. Let's just surf on it, I guess. What, what else are we gonna do, right? Bonk. Alright, Starmie to 68. Enchantment 22, Dodo to 22. There may not be anyone who can stand in the way of you and your Pokemon. I wouldn't be considering my level. I really wouldn't think so either, to be honest. But, um, I've got hit pretty hard. Okay, so there's, um, there's a teleporty thing there. What is on this side? Nothing. Alright, I wasted all that time trying to run it back and forth. Fair enough, I guess. Shooting star in the background, that's pretty lit. Go into this bad boy, and I'm gonna go into. I don't get the point of all this, but. Yeah. Okay, so then. Okay, but I do wanna fight this guy, because. I'm trying to get that money. I had a vision that the battle we're about to have will be different from all previous battles. Alright, well, you better have a cool Pokemon, uh, Arthur. Ren. That's a pretty cool Pokemon, actually. I like it. Um, yeah. I don't know what type you are. That's kind of my problem here, so I'm just gonna Thunderbolt you. I don't know what you are. Okay. Um, that's not gonna hurt me much, because I am a psychic starfish. So, 
I'm gonna get zapped again. Ooh, Pokemon though. I like it. Crocorock to the 39. Star AV at the 30. Enchant 23. Dodo 23. Dodo wants Uproar. No, you don't. Uproar is an overrated move. You and your Pokemon look like you know how to share your burden with one another. Is that a good thing? Hey, Starmie, come over here. Let me uh, just tell you my burdens. I like that. Uh, well, I guess people in real life have like dogs and stuff, so I guess that's fair enough. Just because you can't see it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. Yeah. Alright, Hexmania Ar Arachna. Alright, Jinx. You're about to get. It. Wait, yeah, I'll start with I forgot. I, is. Definitely is a super effective, right? Okay, it's not. Yeah, that's not gonna be super effective, so it's not gonna be against me. Yeah, I can do it. Okay, let's go ahead and use the little quick power gems, because it's only got a little bit of power left. I was like, don't tell me I'm not gonna. Oh, rock, rock was super effective against it, I didn't even realize. Oops. I didn't cheer hard enough for my Pokemon. That's right, cheering is kind of an unseen power. Even know my power. Are you oh, I didn't go into that. Alright, ding bong. The gym exists only by absorbing the power of the cosmos. Alright, Melanie, what you got? Gardevoir. Pretty lit. Surf upon you. And then I'm super fighting, which should be enough to kill. Ooh, it didn't kill. Wow, okay. Hi! Surf the second time. Combi, 36. Chain, 24. I probably could have brought someone else other than Combi, considering I just need him for um, boards, but mm, what is the source of your power? Call it a brain? So, that nice little brain in there. Pretty good. Alright, I'll just go up first. I say that. Ooh, that's the gym leader. Alright, I want to go there after I do whatever's over here. Up. Okay, it's a dead end. Just flexing my brain there, and then I go into that end. Alright, gym leader. What you got? Is your name Stella? You think it's gotta be Stella, right? A, a ritual to decide your fate and future. The battle begins. Hey, cool cape. Now, what's your name? Versus Olympia. Why? You're in space. You're... Although this is an absolutely sick field. I really like this field. Um, okay, I'm gonna Thunderbolt it. I think it's a flying guy, so flying is gonna be pretty good. Get out of here, butt cheek. I don't I don't like things like you. You look weird. Yeah, I'll stick. Alright. I'm like 30 levels above you. How? I know it's a priority move, but like, come on. There you go. Oh, what else you got? Pan Chan 25. Nah, Pan Chan, you don't need to. Do You're fine. Dodo to 25. Smoking. That is a pretty cool Pokemon. You want Thunderbolt it? That right is your head. And you're done. You're done. 
Rock Rock to 40. No, we do not need that. Create your own path, let nothing get in your way, your fate, your future. Thanks. Yo, Crack a Rock is evolving. Finally get the final evolution of this, we can get in another Pokemon here. But I do really like Crack a Rock's um, evolution. I, I think it's a really cool Pokemon actually, so. Very cool to see that we're finally evolving it. Look at that. To crocodile. Croc crocodile. It's literally just named crocodile. Okay. That's hilarious. Now the psychic badge. A testament to your skill, proof of your power. That's a weird looking badge, to be honest. A symbol of trust. Level 90 or below, Pokemon obey. And we got Calm Mind, which I'm never gonna use, probably. Special attack and fence are increased. The calm this is your future. Back from whence you came, you can be transported there. Warp to the entrance? Sure. I mean, I already took care of all of the gym leaders here, so. All right, bud. See you later. I'm gonna head over. I'm sure get. I'm sure getting the psychic badge wasn't too much trouble for you, right, David? I think I'll challenge you to a daily battle when this trip is all said and done. Seems like the neighborly thing to do. Let's have a rematch. Battling tough trainers is the best way to get stronger. Okay, dude, we just fought like five seconds ago. We're still in the same episode. What could this be? Pokemon trainers, I come to you by the Holocaster to make an important announcement. Listen well, Team Flare will revive the ultimate weapon. Eliminate everyone who isn't in our group and return the world to a beautiful natural state. Unproductive fools are consuming our future. If nothing changes, the world will become ugly and conflicts will raise the land from end to end. I repeat, we will use the ultimate weapon and wipe the slate clean. I'm sorry, those of you who are not members of Team Flare, but this is audio to you all. Dude, Team Flare kind of sucks, bro. Are you sure that's the only people you want to leave there? Those weirdos? What was Lissandre saying? Wiping the slate clean, eliminating everyone but Team Flare. David, let's look for the Team Flare's headquarters. Where could Lissandre be? Perhaps he's where we first met him in Limoy's city. Probably. Okay. Okay, I don't care. Just shut up and let me go away. Alright, we need to check out whatever's over here very, very quickly. does so we'll probably end up coming here another time seeing what's up over here okay um oh there was okay we can go down here so, okay okay so i can't go this way so we need to take the never eat okay the east okay so um, so we gotta go back to Staravia, not, not no fly? Okay, well, Staravia needs to learn fly. We need to go back to Limoway City. Okay, how does... How does Staravia not know fly? And why can Doduo learn fly? You don't have any wings, bud. Okay, man. I remember Charizard can learn fly, but apparently Dodo can. Alright. Let me get a fly going. Also, I gotta put away Crocodile. So we're gonna do that very quickly, also. Also, we'll put away Combi too, because I don't really need Combi. Let's go ahead and deposit. Okay, 
Oh, we're like all the way over here. We don't got many places to explore. We got like one, two, three. Not, not too much. All right. Let's head over to. Also, I'm pretty sure like I looked through the game. We're not that far from being loved, actually. I mean, we obviously our game is gonna go a lot longer just because of the fact that um, we're gonna catch them all. Is this his cafe? This might be the cafe. I don't know. But we're gonna end the episode off here. We will fight Lissandre and all that next episode. I'll see you guys then. Hey everybody, how's it going? We're playing more Pokemon. Let's go ahead. I think... No, this is not the right cafe. Get... What? What? Okay. We are in the right cafe? I don't know anymore. I'm confused and lost. Alright, well, that's fine. Let me go ahead and turn down my audio while I surf on this... What? What's going on here, but... I thought I was supposed to find Team Flare Guts in here. You don't look like a Team Flare Gun. Also, you suck at fighting. Cause... Well, apparently, I suck at fighting because I couldn't kill you before. Power Gemmy in the face. Okay. Did, it, did he have a second Pokemon? Alright, start me to 69. Okay. Star Ravier to 32. I need my stylish red team player suit to unleash my full power, or maybe just suck. Oh no, he'll find out the password to the hidden door in this cafe is open sesame. Yeah? Today's special scramble, you don't get- Okay, dude, just fight me. Stop. Don't do this to yourself. Yeah, just don't, don't do that. It's, it's like slightly embarrassing. Well, me talking to myself is also embarrassing. I don't know. Alright, whatever. Uh, sorry. Let's go ahead and start a little... Sir, throw some water at ya. Easy. No problem. Right, Pain Champ 26. Go to a 26. Was I actually part of Team Flare or was I just a waitress? Well, you look like a waitress. So I was gonna default to waitress. At this rate, he'll figure out there's a hidden door to the sun. Alright, where's this door? Is it here? Okay. Where's, where's the door, bud? Okay, open sesame. Should have been a little more obvious than it was. Fair enough. Alright. Welcome. This world will eventually reach the point of no return. Saving the lives of all is impossible. Only the chosen ones will obtain the ticket to tomorrow. Do you want to have a ticket, or do you want to, or do you want to stop me? Show me in battle. All right, first battle with our boy. I, our team player, Lissandre. Show me what we got. Quite a strong start there, bud. Really? It's like your big starting Pokemon. Alright. I'm gonna give you a little bad thing here. Super effective. Murkrow. Alright. That's not a good type matchup for me. But I, is it a dark flying or just a dark? I don't remember. I think, okay, it is a dark flying. This is super fast. I roar. Man, I have one move that's super effective against every single one of his Pokemon. How wonderful is this? We got at least one thing for everyone. Alright, what do you got? Gyarados. Ooh, actually, I have I have the thunder. I say I don't think I have anything super effective, but actually, but I do. I have the thunder. So we're good. Get that. All right. Easy, easy. Star 
be the 33. Take down. No, you don't need to take down. Lit with the 38. Inferno. Now, that is a new one I want. Um. Yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of that. That's the one that's going to be waiting for right now. Blue me to 31. Excellent, I can feel the fire of your convictions burning deep within your heart. Oh, thanks, bud. Appreciate it. Ha, ah, your convictions and those of your Pokemon please me. You're here to stop me, but I ask you to wait. I tried to save people in the world with the profit from this lab, but my efforts had no effect. The world is just too vast and too full of fools that I couldn't save through my hard work alone. That's why I decided the only way to save the world was to take it all for myself. I don't expect that I will ever make you understand how I think and feel. Try to stop the ultimate weapon if you must, but to do so, you'll have to explore our lab and have Pokemon battles with all you meet. Alright. And as for the elevator key, one of the Team Flare scientists you've met on your journey has it. Why are you telling me all this? You could have just not done that. Saving everything. The world is suffering because of this absurd dream. You could have just not told me any of that, and it would have been a lot harder for you, for you to stop me. For me to stop you. Um, but, okay. Okay. Zoop, zoop, zoop. But I do want to fight everyone, so. You'll be captivated by the warp panel and transported away. Alright. Weirdo. Let me see what you got. You got a swallow. Also, ooh, I just flexed my cap really hard and I almost just got a cramp. That was, that's also slightly embarrassing. I don't know what you are. You can do the dead. I don't, I don't know what this thing is. Is it a normal type? Is it a fairy type? I, I don't know, man. I don't, I don't feel like finding out either, to be honest. Um, alright, let's do the surf, I guess. Why did it fall back like that? If we're relaxing, breathing exercises to battles, then why are you here? Go. I, I'll go breathe with you. I love breathing. Bre breathing is, like, sick. Ha ha ha. Why, if it isn't the fascinating little trainer from the Cal's Power Plant? We meet again, just as says, just as it says we would. Alright, Aliana. Is that Elena? Aliana? I don't know, man. English is hard. So many letters, so many words. Um. Alright, mighty, mighty Anna. I'm gonna surf upon you. What's your second Pokemon? I know I just fought you a couple episodes ago, but in real life that was about a month ago, so. Total to 28. Acupressure? You don't need Acupressure, bud. You're a bird. Just. Ooh, Dreadigon. That's a cool little Pokemon out there. Very cool, very cool. Very weird looking. I don't know why his red looks like. why his head looks like a pimple, but. I mean, hey, fair enough. But I'm pretty sure it's also a dragon, so Dazzling Gleam is gonna be really good right now. Yeah, that's what I thought. Alright. Army to level 70. Alright. You sure are an interesting trainer. You're far more capable than our useless grunts, and that is why getting rid of everyone except your grunts is a terrible idea. I don't have a key, but I'll let you pass. But war, war panel would be which one could it be? Okay, well actually, I, really quick, I wanna make sure I finished everything down here. What the frick, dude? Why do I? I didn't mean to do that. I'll, I'm trying to go see what's down here. Is that literally nothing? Okay, this is that was literally all. All of those warp panels are a joke. They don't do anything. All right, well I'm gonna go down the green. I trust in the green. Or did I make a mistake? Okay. Time for me to waylace to you and your Pokemon and finally get recognized by the admin. Alright, Team Flare Grunt. 
<laughs> you know name? You gotta, you know, what's with these guys in like, Swalots, man? You guys have some like, weird fetish with big Pokemon? What's wrong with you? That thing looks like a fish. Why do you keep this thing around? I don't understand. There's so many cool Pokemon and you choose this? And these are the people that Lissandre wants to keep alive instead of me. Absolute geniuses, man. Nah, we don't need we don't need body slime here. Alright. Another boring Pokemon. Uh, let me surf on let me surf on it. Let me surf on it. There we go. Game 29. Go go with 29. No good, no good. The admins are gonna be mad. No, they're not, because they know you guys suck just as much as I do. Alright, Staravia is going to its last form. Very cool. I think this is also another Pokemon that's actually been with us for quite a little while now. Trying to get it up to its last form. Yeah, hopefully I can't catch the later forms anywhere else later. I don't think I would be able to, but one of the best birds, one of the goodest birds, Star Raptor. Step Star Raptor. Star Raptor. Yeah, Star Raptor. Uh, yeah, I like actually. I like close combat. Uh, we always get rid of wing attack. I don't really need wing attack here. I like the little um red thing. It's pretty lit. I look like an edgy high schooler. All right, so I could I could do that, or I could go here. No sign of him here either. What's you two? Yo, have you seen anything? We're looking for a really tall guy, and I mean tall. If you stretched out a survivor and stood it up, he'd be that tall. We received some intelligence that Team Flair is also trying to find him for some reason. His relationship to Team Flair is still a mystery, but. Oh, by the way, I've got something for you. Take these with you, David. Oh, you guys are good people. Oh, lit. I like the vibes. Oh, wait, we, we met some time ago, but I didn't get your name then. I've never heard of your name before, not once. Uh, anyway, we came here at a certain professor's request to stop Team Flair. I assume your goal is the same. Don't do anything reckless. Okay. Alright, can I... How is there, like, a chair and a computer and I can't do anything with it? What in the world? Why would you do something like that? Um, yeah, I can't go that way. Okay. What is... Okay, I don't know, but first let me just beat this guy up. National people can battle, too. Well, let me... Mm, I'm, I'm, I'm just doubting that. To be honest, All of you have the same stupid Pokemon. Watch, I kill this thing, he's gonna have another Swalot. That's a Swalot, I'm actually gonna... Say bad words. Oh, let me turn down my Bluetooth. And what does he got? Mighty Anna? Oh, it's Mighty Anna. Okay, well, it's not a small lot. That's pretty good. Okay, let's go ahead and give it a surf. Boring fight, but okay. Fashionable people can be sad too. You're not that fashionable, bud. You look like everyone else. All of you have the same suits. How is that fashionable? You're the opposite of I didn't mean to do that. Oops. It's like literally the opposite of fashionable. Alright, well, while I'm here, I might as well take the yellow and kind of see what it does, right? Oh. Okay, yellow equals bad. ATM. Okay. Let's head back into the green. A little, do a little zip zop. Okay. We will, we will. Okay. There we go, pop. There we go. Alright, let's see what's over here, I guess. I'm also gonna go check that trash can over there. It seems like somewhere you put an item. Okay. Whatevs. Hello? Uh... Oh, 
how they, they don't think I'm a bad guy. Okay, the team player gave me an item, that's hilarious. Maybe they're not that bad. Maybe they're just... They don't like people without red suits. Which is slightly weird, but okay. Okay, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Okay. Well, I don't want to hit that. Okay, guess let's hit up this. I'm gonna send you spinning. Alright. Team flight got. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm gonna keep spamming the butt. Oh yeah, alright, alright, alright. Okay, okay. If I lose, I'll be in brand new world of beauty and protection soon. See, but like, you don't deserve that. You suck. Why? Why would he let you? Okay, I'm gonna take this one. Even probably wrong. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. Um. Oh wait, then I go bing bong, bing bong, bing bong. You came all this way, I suppose. Okay, just shut up and fight. Please have only one Pokemon. Uh, why do all of you have two? You're annoying. You're gonna have okay, I take it back, man. That's pretty cool. That's it. I swear, if you have a Le uh, Leapard or a Swalot or a Mightyena. But hey, you're a main trick. That's pretty cool, actually. I like it. You're slightly cooler than the other team grunts that I've faced thus far. Scrafty and uh, actually I like Scrafty, so that's fine. Not a very original Pokemon, a lot of your buddies have it too, but um, a cooler Pokemon than other people. Fair enough. Probably gonna die in the same way, but good Pokemon. Alright, 71. Just who was I cheering for? I don't know, you tell me. Dummy, why, why would I know who you're cheering for? Alright, first let's check out what's in this doorway. Um, okay, there'll probably be a fight here. Do I have, like, an ether? Um, ether. Yeah, let's go ahead and use that on surf. Here. Um, just because I think I'll need a couple more surfs coming up. Hop, 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 hop. I've seen this kid somewhere before, so who is he? I have no idea. But obviously he's not in team player, let's get him, yeah? Yep, that sounds good to me, then I'll try to get the first blow. Oh, okay, I'm gonna fight both of them. Oh, I'm gonna fight both of you, just fight me at the same time, I'll just serve both of you. No problem, I'll flood the room. You guys won't have a base anymore, so we'll be building water. Man, this song is bippity bopping. Alright. Go to our 31. Lift, 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 40. Great beyond. That is cool Pokemon. I want one of those. Let's see. Yep. The, oh, wait, I should have probably. I don't know what I should have done. I'm sure it's fine. Alrighty. Ah, you beat us good. Why? Wow, so, we're so lame. Alright, just give me your, give me your money. Hey, Dumbo's <laughs> evolving. That's pretty cool. Don't mind me. I'm just looking at someone's wedding photos. 
Not mine. Looking at someone else's wedding photos. Why would I look at my own wedding photos? Bonk, 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 bonk. Alright. Sergio! Absolute classic. You'll love to see it. One bird with two heads becomes three. Still has no wings. It can still fly. Very weird. Oh, what a brute. Look at poor... I don't, think it's, I don't know how to say half these names, man. Br Brioni? Brioni? Bri Brioni? Bro, stop making this a car name. Name it. Name, name it the person Megan. I don't know. Name something easy. Also, I have cooler Pokemon. You guys are admin. You guys are supposed to be better than this. You have the same Pokemon as your guns, and your guns suck. So what does that tell you? Okay, I take it back. Fish Sharp's pretty cool. I like Fish Sharp. Alright, it's, it's a respectable Pokemon there. I don't, I don't think Thunderbolt is that a Pokemon. No, but... Oh, cool move. I like it. Well, I'm gonna Thunderbolt you again. Because Thunderbolt and people is lit. Alright, Panchan 32. Dodrio 32. Gumi to 34. Your ability flies in the face of all probability. Just what is your source of power? It's love. It's all love. What's this? Who could have thought a child like you could beat us both? You and your Pokemon were utterly in sync in that battle, and I know why. You're here for answers, aren't you? I suppose we're at your mercy. I'll tell you what I know, at least. We've been using the electricity we stole from the power plant to get everything prepared for activating the ultimate weapon. But it's not like that, so all we'll need to use it. You follow me? We need energy absorbed from Pokemon to power the device. Yes, it's the stones on Route 10 that will steal the energy for us and power the ultimate weapon. In reality, those stones that lie in Route 10 are graves of Pokemon, and the ultimate weapon was used to end that horrible war over 3,000 years ago that stole the lives of all of those Pokemon. Their lives were, were the price of peace then. If we want to make our own wishes come true today, we and Team Flare also have to sacrifice something precious. Okay. Okay, shut up. I didn't mean to talk to you. Actually, I did, but... So, this is the rock? Okay. Um... Skirt. Get flexed on. Cool, I guess. Um... Where did I come from? That's just gonna send me there. Was... Did I mess up? Ooh, I might have messed up. Oops. Alright, my bad. I'm supposed to go to this one here. Did I mess up a second time in a row? Jeez, man. I really am a goofus, aren't I? I'm supposed to go to this one. There we go. Now I just go bonk, bonk. Wait, am I tripping? Oh, I'm not tripping. That's where I have to go. Black glass is cool. Now I can be part of Team Flare, right? Thanks. We and Team Flare burn with ambition. Well, it's just defeated your admins, so... You guys are pretty boring, to be honest. Literally, it's like a 30 minute episode. All we've done is... Fight... Mighty Ennas, and Squalots, and... Like, Lepari, and... Other dumb things. Alright, Team Flare is going to Very cool. We're gonna do the same thing. We're just gonna surf up on it. Wait, was I. What happened? What happened? Alright, I'm gonna Thunderbolt you. I don't know what happened. I wasn't listening. Kind of the same thing I do in school. Yeah. Alright. What? Okay. I'm still gonna die, dude. That frog goes bye bye. I like the frog. Though. That frog is sick. Frogs are like my favorite animal. Not really. They do like frogs though. 
flip one. Oh, you put out my fire. I'm nothing but cold ashes now. Yeah, you are, bud. But it's all right. Because my Litwick is evolving. That's why. And now I just need a Dusk Stone. I don't know if I already have one of those. I'll check my inventory, but we'll see. I do have a... What? What Pokemon evolved from Dusk Stone? Where's the dust? Moonstone, Dawnstone, Dusk Stone. Okay, so it's Murkrow. Oh, okay, I can definitely do Chandelier then. If I have it. Let me see if I even have it. If, where where would it even be? It could be here, right? Those are all the way from the bottom. Alright, do I have a Dusk Stone? Dusk Stone, Dusk Stone, Dusk, 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 Dusk. Uh, doesn't look like I got one. Dusk stone, dusk stone, dusk stone. Alright, I don't. Well, we'll just evolve it later then. Okay. Moving on. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is where we're supposed to go, right? Wait, okay, let me, let me just go back. Let me make sure this is where we're supposed to go. Okay, it's not. Okay. I love her candy. I love candy too. Just it doesn't need to be rare. I just love candy so I mean honestly just give me any candy and we're cool you know it's a, it's a good best way to make a friendship is just candy wait is that is that paper uh, man what with fools are okay so he thinks people are fools Oh, okay, why? Oh, there's three separate papers, but they're all the same thing. Okay, well, if y'all want to read it, it's over there. Okay, so... Lissandre is a sad, sad man. Okay. Got myself to a hyper potion. That's, I, I did something there. All right. Well, now we go up in here. Boop, boop, boop. All right. We got two choices here. Uh, right. Oh, I made a mistake. All right. We go there. Okay. No, really. I understand. It's only natural to be jealous of a student smiling his mind. Well, I'm. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't know what that was like. We got Gobat. Oh, good. Good Pokemon Thunder, huh? That yeah, sounds like a good idea here, bud. Wanna throw out a Thunder real quick? Get your bat out of the sky. Once again. Haha, uh -huh, I sure just feel good to let loose every once in a while. Spying on people's hollow cash conversation gets boring pretty quickly after all. Alright, right, we'll go and uh we'll, we'll give you a thunderbolt. I forgot if it goes water. God, are you the one that does that? <laughs> I don't know, but really quickly, I'm gonna check a quick grade here. Alright, starting with level 17. Alright, leap forward. Cool. Do, do, 
Mickey body slam. Mm, should be rid of tackle. Yeah, that's fine. I don't like to use tackle to be able to slam. Gumi to 35. Nice, my Pokemon like to let loose every once in a while too. See you guys next episode. Hey, what's up, everybody? We're playing some more Pokemon. We're here in the lab. Still looking for that key. Oh, 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 you're that kid from the Frost Cavern on your loans? Some this time. Yeah. Oh, that's cold. Cold is in that cavern. Your Pokemon don't even count for anything. We gathered data about all trainers in the region through the Hollow Caster, so we know all about you guys. And you know how the Mega Ring is used to awaken up Pokemon's power, right? Just like how the ultimate weapon can max out a Pokemon's power. Looks like you and me are practically after the same thing, yeah? I don't know, man. I'm just playing Pokemon, man. I just want to get some shinies. I don't want to do all of this. This game just has good shiny rates. Anyway, let's go ahead and surf on it. It's all in the bait. Surf the pond. Go. We go. Alright. Pretty cool. Although I don't think I have anything. Is Dazzling Gleam effective against Weevil? F for Gore, but we're gonna. It is! Alright, wonderful. Good to know. So... I think it's just because it's an ice... I forgot, is very good against the ice or dark? I'm pretty sure it's because of the ice. Oh, you're so strong. You and your Pokemon are most certainly not ordinary. I... Thanks, I guess. I mean, I'm just... Yeah. The victory goes to spoils here. An elevator key for you. Thank you very much. The power of the legendary Pokemon, the power to grant life to all around us, is a mysterious ability that even scientists like us haven't been able to decode. What do you think will happen to the world if we fuel the ultimate weapon with something like that? I don't know, probably nothing. Thank you. I'm gonna go now. Alright, so now I go zoop. Mm. This took us nowhere, correct? Oh yeah, this took us to the Okay, I can just go to the elevator now, right? Okay. David, which is me, use the elevator key. B2? Alright. Why do I have an elevator for there's only two places you can go? Just use the stairs. My man. Listen, one who will face Whoa, that man is tall. Holy! What are you doing in there, bud? Now, why are you so tall? Let me get some of those jeans, bro. A terribly long time ago. There was a man in a Pokemon he loved. He loved that Pokemon very much. A war began. The man's beloved Pokemon took part in the war. Several years passed. He was given a tiny box. The man wanted to bring the Pokemon back, no matter what it took. The man built a machine to give it life. He brought his beloved Pokemon back. The man had suffered too much. His rage still had not subsided.
he could not forgive the world that had hurt the Pokemon he loved. He turned the machine into the ultimate weapon. Destruction ended the war. The Pokemon that was given life must have known. That the lives of many Pokemon were taken to restore its life. The, resu the resurrected Pokemon left the man. Get the key back. It should not be used. Everything will vanish again. Do you want to know unending pain like I have? That is AZ. He has the same name as a king that lived 3,000 years ago, and for some unknown reason, he had the key to the ultimate weapon hung around his neck. It's finally time. Follow me to my chambers. Alright. Gonna talk to the big lad, though? Get the key back. It should not be used. Everything will vanish again. Where's your chambers, bud? Another floor? B3. Right. Next level we go. Um, okay, there's nothing now except the vent. Oh, it's... Okay. So the Pokeballs were received and the Pokemon we gathered are where they need to be. Add it all up, and it means all preparations are complete. The only thing left to do is put the plan in motion. I'm counting on you. One push of a button and we can activate the ultimate weapon from this room. I believe being a chosen one means you have the potential to change the future. Whether we activate the ultimate weapon or leave it safely underground will rest upon if you actually have this potential or not. Ho ho ho, you're the one I've heard so much about, I've been waiting for you. I need to do a little research on you, come on, let us go. Alright bud. Zero sick. What you got? Really? That's like, what you got for me? It's a crowbat? I mean, I guess it's better than a gold bat that all your other people had. Alright, well I'm gonna take it out of the sky. Almost a little cooler now. And channel 34. Big Jira 34. Nah, you don't need to try it back. I'm not gonna use you in battle anyway. Lamb Pent to 42. Malamar. Okay. That is a pretty cool Pokemon. I actually really like Malamar. Can we dazzling gleam it? I don't think that's effective. It is a very effective. Okay, so apparently Fairy is get it is good against Dark Pokemon, so that's pretty cool. Oh, oh you're wonderful. Your Pokemon are amazing. Well, you've only seen one of them, but thanks, bud. I appreciate it. Wonderful, amazing. You have tremendous skill and bravery. When you add that up, it means I will be telling you something very interesting. It happened 3,000 years ago. The ultimate weapon was used to put an end to the war in an instant. If we use that incredible power, we can finally free Kalos of the foolish humans that plague it. Behind me, you'll find a red button and a blue button. One of them is the button for activating the ultimate weapon. Push one now. Come on. See, I feel like this is a trick, right? I feel like the red button is for Team Flare. The blue button is not the Team Flare. 
but I feel like that would be way too smart, so I'm just gonna go ahead and click the blue button. Yeah. You pressed the oh, you pressed the blue switch. Winner, winner. Congratulations. I'm still going to activate the ultimate weapon. <laughs> the boss promised that we win if you push the correct button, but I refuse to let the potential go to waste. I'll just use my remote. Here, click, click, and the power is on. Come on, look. Look at the monitor. What a wiener, dude. I clicked the right button. Why? It's not good. Bro, what about all these houses, dude? A little, a little lag in the game. Bro, those houses, no! Houses are literally sideways. Oh no. had to destroy like an entire village to do it but pretty cool did you see the ultimate weapon is reborn poisonous flower has bloomed all shall perish except for team flare look at geosenge it has bloomed into geosenge town the boss's dream of creating a beautiful world will come true add it all up and it equals a victory for our science well it sounds like you guys just suck Well, now I'm guessing I can go down to Route 18. Is that, like, what this is, like, basically trying to tell me, right? That I can kind of just go down to Route 18? Could be one. soon that I might need a lot of balls for. And I have 148, so let's just grab 41 Ultra Balls. I think that should be more than enough. If I need more than that, then I could probably just give up. Uh, we already have enough Magic Balls. Okay, cool. Thank you, Mr. Storman. It is time to fly over, over, I said over twice. Let's go over, over to, um, use move, fly, Geosenge. Where's Geosenge? Pomerine, Shalor. Yes. Corner of the map here. Skirt. Pick me up. We going. We flying. We we'll back. Thank you, Fletchender. Appreciate you. Everything you do. Okay. Wait. What happened? Oh. Okay. Well, let's check this first. Oh, where was the entrance door? It wasn't in the boulder. No, it was to the top left, but... I just want to see if there's anything else out here that I can do. I don't think there's anything actually I can actually do. Alright, well, there's the focus stop, but I'm not, not like I'm going to need it. Poor guy in there is probably freaking out. Well, that's a big old little weapon you got there, huh, bud? Let's also give it a quick save. I didn't think about that, too. Okay. Me? You better have come prepared, both you and your Pokemon. So, actually, I've come, I've come with a couple of new Pokemon that I need to evolve. So, that works. All right, main trick. That's the worst thing that I have. Hi, main trick. Look, I'm also gonna surf on it though. This will be pretty lit. Have a snack. I'm kind of hungry. Nice. 
scrap team. No, we can keep the cook one in. Yeah, I'm kind of hungry, not gonna lie. I might go have a snack after this episode. Right, let's go ahead and surf it again. Because what else are we going to do? Let's just be starving death. Army to level 17. Here we go. to 19. I'm guessing Pachinger's gonna start going a little bit quickly here. Bullbat. 45. Bullbat. Let's go ahead and give it a, give it a quick little thunderbolt here. The zoink. Alright, Gibble to level 27. Dragon Claw. Might be a cool one move. Let's go and get rid of. Let's get rid of Sand Tomb. I don't need Sand Tomb. That's a weird move. And we learn Dragon Claw. Try Bench to 28. Fletch him to 20. Behold the moment of my defeat. Don't even think, don't even think about blinking. Right. Oops. Hey yo. Gibble is evolving already. Okay, well that was very, very quick. Um, but luckily we still need to get it to Garch Garchomp really. And Garchomp is, I mean, I know it's like, it's a very popular favorite because it is technically, I think it's a pseudo legendary, but, um, I've, I've, Garchomp has really grown on to me because of Pokemon Go, but, um, yeah. Because Gibble Tournament Bite, because I've been using Garchomp in basically every raid in battle in Pokemon Go, so it's, um, yeah, Lissandre does whatever he can to help us realize our goals. Surely he deserves respect for that. Nah, depends what your goals are there, bud. If my goal is to hit my head on every single uh, lamp post I find, and if I try really hard, does that really make me respectable? David, I'm coming. When I was in Lissandre's lab, the masked heroes told me what is going on. They also told me Team Flare plans to do with Ultimate Weapon. Come on, let's stop Team Flare. The world isn't corrupt enough to give up on it yet i agree let's go i think the world sucks but i don't want to just kill everyone because that's not very cash all right so how many floors down was that like 13 floors cool also where did serena go she kind of just like dipped hey it was uh, many pokemon lost their lives okay thanks for the genius information Attached to the stones on Route 10 are an energy source. Okay, I've already been told that. I'll leave my fate. Okay, yeah. okay. We're absorbing the energy from a serious tree, but that's it. There isn't a Pokemon anywhere near here. All systems are go. What about you? Everyone in the world must. Okay, yeah. So there isn't enough happiness. That's just dumb. I mean, there's not enough happiness to go around. Happiness isn't a chemical, or isn't like a quantifiable. I guess if you count each serotonin, I don't know, man. The ultimate weapon's flower has finally bloomed above the soil. Don't you find its beauty captivating? As we speak, it draws the energy from the legendary Pokemon. David, I apologize that the weapon was unearthed even after you chose correctly in the lab, but conflicting egos drive this world. Things don't always go the way you want. We're not going to let you use the ultimate weapon. Even though resources, space, and energy on this planet are limited, the number of people in Pokemon has increased to an unsustainable level. Whether it's money or energy, the ones who steal are the ones who win in this world. That doesn't give you the right to destroy everyone, but but the ones Team Flare chooses. So tell me, the Mega Ring, did you share it? That's different. We competed for it, but when there's only one of something, it can't be shared. When something can't be shared, it will be fought over. And when something is fought over, some must survive without it. The only way to create a world where people live in beauty, a world without conflict or theft, is to reduce the number of living things. What about Pokemon? Tears, why? Pokemon shall no longer exist. What? Pokemon are wonderful beings. Humans have worked with Pokemon. We've helped each other flourish. But precisely because of that, they will inevitably become tools for war and theft. Enough of this. You want to stop the ultimate weapon, and I refuse to do so. So I will keep you busy for just a moment. Alright, bud. You're challenged by Team Flare Lissandre. He's got four more Pokemon. Are they the same? Oh, he, he evolved his food. Okay. 
So now we get to fight its actual evolved form. Pretty cool. I'm still gonna kill it, but very cool. I'm glad he's investing in these Pokemon. Actually evolving them. Okay. Shinder, tell me what. I roll. Okay, so it'll be the same Pokemon. Go ahead and just use another Surphonic Thunder type. Like, we literally defeated you like five minutes ago. What's your deal, dude? Why you gotta make, why you gotta make me beat you again? You're just five. Ponyard to 37. Trepids to 29. Um, no, you don't need to. Actually, I kinda do want to dig. Yeah, let me get, let me get rid of, uh, five. I don't need five here. Actually, dig would be pretty cool to have. Chinder to 22. Launch Pro, okay. He evolved his Murkrow also. I'm gonna hit it with a Dazzling Gleam. I could also hit it with a Thunder. Either one works, to be honest. Okay. The Bite to 28. Chinder to 23. Last one, Gyarados. Very, very cool. He had the Gyarados last time, though. Now, is he gonna Mega Evolve it? Now, that would be something else. Are you gonna Mega Evolve the Gyarados? Oh, he's a, he's a, he's a oh. Where's your Mega Ring and Mega Stones, bro? Missing out. Even though I don't use them. Drew me to 37. The strength to protect, huh? Well, what are you really protecting? A tomorrow that will only end up being worse than today? David received. Hey, I don't know why I read that. Got easy 10k for it though. You're as strong as ever, but it's too late. There's no hope for you now. Go down to the lowest floor and see for yourself. It's not over yet. Big D, let's look for the legendary Pokemon. Trainers are protected by Pokemon, but they protect Pokemon too, right? Look, you can see the entrance to the lower floor there. Right, get out of the way, old man. I'm trying to catch myself a legendary. Skirt, let's hurry. Okay, I was until you started talking to me. Dummy. I'm afraid we're going to have, have to ask you to turn back. Legendary Pokemon is at the end of this chamber, after all. Why didn't you tell them that? Why would you even do something like that? I, I don't know either. Why would you do something like that? Our team player admin and team... Oh, okay. There's an admin and a grunt. I'm like, yeah, of course. This is very stupid. Alright, and hey, yo, it's a double battle. I'm re I really like it when I have to double battle Serena because I can surf and just wipe out everything without actually feeling bad about it, which is really, really nice. I don't care if I kill her. And I like it that her Pokemon are the one that gets killed. A little bit of everyone here. Yep. Oh, I forgot that Toxic Croak absorbs it. Oops. Okay, trap inch to 30. Chinder to 20. Okay, Corian out. Alright, let's go ahead and hit Toxic Throw with a little Thunderbolt that I'm pretty sure won't hurt me. Oh, that's gonna hurt me too. That's not very nice to Alright, Victoria, can you hit it? Hit it with anything? Except you suck. What did I expect? It's alright. We literally couldn't even do like a quarter of this. Come on, Serena. This is why you keep losing your battles. <laughs> you fools, you don't even have suits. You might be strong, but your teamwork is still a bit lag. Ooh. What, because I killed her Pokemon? It was, it was for the greater good, bud. Although now I'm starting to sound like Cassandra, which is ironic, but it's alright. Um, let's go ahead and waste the quick hyper potion here. Just because I want Stormy at full health here, I just I don't want Stormy at uh, low health. I get well, Sandra is trying Okay, you need to say it faster. Oh, another battle. Okay. Even if things are just as we heard, I can't believe they're sending smart guys like us to run off some little ratata that wandered in. We, we won't lose. We won't get. We won't get one step further. The trainers move onto the next level. Will be Team Flare. All right. Please don't have another Toxic Croak. Cause I want to surf and I want to kill everything. Okay. These I can kill with a surf. And I'm pretty sure neither has a. 
priority move, so this should be a pretty good fight here. Alright, that's fine. I'm just gonna run the circuit up, and we should be good to go. Here we go. Bonk. Good. Kill everything. Again, I, ironically what I'm here to stop, but whatever works. If it works, it works. You can't tell me otherwise. Oh, Meowstick survived. Look at that. Good job, Meowstick. Do I need metal sound? I don't think my Ponyard needs to think metal sounds. I think I'll pass on that. He's a little smarter than that. Alright, a bunch of level ups. Roost? Nah, he doesn't need roost. Yes, I lost, but no matter. Lissandre is the one who will take care of things. I may have lost, but it doesn't matter. Okay, he literally said the same thing. You guys are weird. I, let me go past you. You guys are weird. Where are we at? Big D, Serena. I don't believe it. What are you doing here? I'm sorry. I I know I'm just going I'm just going to slow you down. But but friends should Oh I thought she was like a bad guy, like, I'm here to slow you down. No, she literally said, Oh, I'm go Alright. <laughs> but friends should stick together. I'm the one who should be apologizing. You came all the way out here and I wasn't very considerate of your feelings. You are right. Friends should stick together. Big D. We should all go together, right? Yeah, of course. I knew you'd agree. Okay, Shauna, Big D, and I will go on ahead. Stay close to us, okay? Alright, thank you. Stay close, okay, day. Um... I don't know. Is it, like, literally up next? Oh, we all won the battle. Our plans haven't succeeded just yet. We cannot afford any careless mistakes. Who's got that flair? Team flair. Yeah, we've got that flair. Team flair. It's kind of suck, but that's alright. Yo, why can't we do triple battles or quadruple battles? Let's just get all the Pokemon out here. And then I can just surf like seven Pokemon at once. I think that'd be kind of cool. Alright, another two Pokemon that I can kind of surf. Okay. Well, let's bring out another. Oh. Oh, okay, he faked out. Not me. Okay, good, good. Die. Why would you do something like that? Meowth is probably gonna die here though. Crunch? No, I don't crunch me. Why would you do something like that? I didn't do anything to you, so I tried to kill you. I don't think this is fair. Okay. We're gonna end up a Porion, but it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna zap the scrap anyway. Doesn't make much particular sense, but hey, what am I to say? Go me to 38. Whoa, wait, what am I doing? I don't need muddy water. Oops. I'm just clicking buttons. I shouldn't be clicking. The bite to 30. Sandre is like the sun to us. He represents our hope. That's a little weird. Probably find a better idol than Sandre, personally, but. Okay, who am I to say? Another fight? Anyway, we gotta hurry to stop it. I'm trying, would you shut up? Okay, I'm guessing that's where we need to go, right? It's an electric lock. What should we do? This might help. It's a device that helps you when you're stuck on a puzzle. Clamont gave it to me. An electric lock and a puzzle are the same sort of thing, right? Ta-da! The lock open. That's a very odd plot device. I've got a machine to do it! Alright, man. I'm the oh, the device actually broke. Oh. Never mind. Amazing, Shauna. You and Clamont devices are both full of surprises. So, we're finally here. The Legend Pokemon inside. Let's go help it. Alright, we're gonna do that next episode. Thanks for watching. Hey everybody, we're playing more Pokemon. I think we're gonna finally go meet the legendary Pokemon. So that's kinda cool. Let's go inside. Very cool. That's a cool room. Is that a. I can't tell what that is up there. Is that like a. Oh, it's a tree. It's a literal tree. It kinda looks like a Nexus tree. It's kinda cool. That one in his forehead. We're in the deepest part of the headquarters. It's somehow hard to breathe in here. Hey, is that 
Is it that the thing that looks like a treat, the legendary Pokemon? It doesn't look like it's alive, but... Whoa, alright. Ninja jutsu in here. That's none of your business, kid. The ultimate weapon has taken 99% of the legendary Pokemon's energy. But just to make double sure nothing goes wrong, let's take out these runs too. No, I hate being chased. Okay, you didn't have to run. Oh, Shauna, this again. David, just take care of things here. I'll protect Shauna. Make sure to take care of those runs that run away. I should have expected as much from a kid who made it clear down here. It was a pretty simple tactic, but it managed to split us up. That girl's pretty good. Do you really think you can beat us? I mean, probably. I, I don't know. Do I have to face one every one of you one by one? Oh, why do I gotta face one one by one? That's so boring. Why don't we just do like an all-out battle? You send out five, I send out five. We'll call it a day. You know, we can wrap this whole thing up in five minutes. So we can all go home for lunch. Alright, well, back to battle every single one. That's good. I might be on my phone or something. This is about to get kind of boring. Sitting after to fight 20 million leopards and 20 million swallots and gold bats and my DNA's. Razor Wind. Yeah, what is Razor Wind? 80. I wouldn't go ahead and get rid of Peck. I don't, I don't really need Peck here. Okay, but don't. Razor Wind, look at that. Main trick. Oh, we can keep fight here. Alright. Use a surf to get to the next Pokemon. That'll turn out pretty good. Alright, Ponyard to 39. Ooh, someone's following me. Hold on. Alright, quick phone call. You don't even try to understand Lissandre and all that he, he, that he suffers for. Alright, sounds kind of whiny to me, bud. Alright, do I have to go really one by one? Okay, well I guess... I Look, I kind of want the money from each person, so... Um, I will be fighting. I don't, know, I don't know if the game will force me to fight all of them, but... I don't know. Let's do it, I guess. Swallop. Oh, I hit him with a Dazzling Gleam. Oh, that didn't do much at all. That was a mistake. Alright. Alright, that was a little bad. Let's go ahead and just hit it with a surf. I think it's probably just our strongest move here. Oh, stockpile. That's good. It's just stockpiling a bunch without actually hitting me, so that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and hit it with one more surf. I think we'll be fine here. Get bonked. Okay, Taking all those legendaries, Pokemon's life force is an unfortunate necessity to realize your goals. Or you could stop and stop being mean. Oh, a little lag there. Taking all of the money and stuff for ourselves will make a will make a world where team player is happy. See, but it's just the irony there is that you guys want to get rid of the world so there's no more theft, there's no more bad things, everyone can be happy. But the thing that made you happy was theft. It's almost like it doesn't make any sense. Whoa. It's almost why we're fighting you, why you're wrong. There's nothing wrong with wanting happiness, but killing people? I think that's like the way to achieve happiness. This is a very like Thanos moment here, huh? I'm just gonna kill everything so the ones left can be a little, a little happier. Even though they likely won't be happier if we just watched everyone die, but you know, and eh, who am I to say? Alright, we got our Starmie up to level 75, which is pretty lit. Alright, the bite to 31. Trap inch to 33. Alright, Mr. Baldman. Are you trying to stop Team Flip from obtaining happiness? <laughs> what a vile person you are. Oh boy. You guys think we'll let you join Team Flip after this? You've got another thing coming. I don't know why would I do that. Alright, at least have a cool Pokemon for me if you only got one, huh? Okay. Couldn't even have a Crobat, huh? Just a Golbat? No Crobat? 
What a shame. What a shame that you're lame. Alright. Yes, come on. You're just trying to benefit from our success, aren't you? Oh, you guys are weird. No way! This puts the no in no way. Contact us, Andre. Call for reinforcements. Um. Oh. oh. I just noticed that our player model has lips. <laughs> That's pretty sick. I probably should have saved before this, shouldn't I? Oops. Oh yeah, I was like, I was hoping maybe we gotta like walk up to it. Nope, we're just going straight into the battle. Ooh. I don't know if I should throw my Master Ball at this. Let me... Um... Let me look up all the legendary Pokemon in this game. Because... Oh. Yeah, I think I should save my Master Ball. So, we're just gonna go ahead and... Let's maybe bring in a weaker Pokemon. Maybe we can just... I honestly, I don't need to weaken it a bunch. I just need to weaken it a little bit. So, let's try and do that here. Gravity, please don't hurt me. I just need to weaken it. Um, I don't know what... Am I going to even have a chance to weaken it? I don't think it's going to let me weaken it, huh? Well, we can keep trying a little bit. Fuck on your Can you do maybe a little bit of damage? A little bit? Give me a bottom metal. He's absorbing power. It's fine. Can we just do a little bit of damage, please? Okay. I was hoping for a little more than that. Okay, but it's gonna keep absorbing power. Maybe, maybe it'll at least let me get it into the yellow? And then if we get into the yellow, we can start chucking Ultra Balls, and I'm not really worried from there, on, you know. Just a little more, come on. That's gonna just keep absorbing power, which is actually bad, but it's alright. We'll be fine. Let's go, it's in the yellow. Okay. Maybe we can get into the red. I mean, maybe if he just keeps using Geomancy, maybe we have a shot at just getting into the red too. You never know. Maybe it'll just be really nice to us. Now, this journey is extremely strong all of a sudden. One more, maybe? Cool. It actually let us get into the red, which is pretty nuts. Alright. Well, I know Ponyard is still out. Let's start chucking balls, huh? Ultra balls. Zoink. Maybe we can catch it. Maybe, maybe this wasn't as hard as I thought it would be. Okay, you know, I, I was like, dude, maybe first ball? Maybe, maybe, maybe it just wants to, you know, be cool about all of this. But maybe not. Ooh, I was like, really? Well, I feel like this is the time where, okay. It's weird. It keeps absorbing power and it keeps using gravity, but it hasn't actually attacked yet. It doesn't even have an attack on it. I'm... Maybe it's not trying to attack us? Why? Why hasn't it attacked you? I don't understand. 
understand why it does the things that it does. Okay, we're just gonna keep throwing Ultra Balls. And once we get to a point, maybe we can throw a Timer Ball just for giggles. One. Oh, <laughs> great catch. Look at that. Alright, we got ourselves an Ernius. That wasn't as hard as I thought it would be, to be honest. Fair enough. Legend says that you can share eternal life and live for a thousand years in the form of a tree before survival. Cool. Very cool. Add Xerneas to your party? To your party from the box? No. Do I need it? Yeah, I don't really want Xerneas here. There's no reason to. What a relief. Now they can't use the ultimate weapon. You're amazing, Big D. A legendary Pokemon wanting to be your friend. Like that, it's unbelievable. What a startling development. I never th would have thought you were the chosen one. Oh, you got bugs on your thing. Ew. So this is the mighty Xerneas. I expected more from a Pokemon called the Legend. You desire help from people? You need help from a human? What's going on with that outfit? Is that really you, Lissandre? Oh, whatever. Big D already beat you. What are you doing here? For me, victory is using the ultimate weapon. In order to do that, I need to reclaim the legendary Pokemon's power and send it to the weapon once again. I'll be taking the legendary Pokemon back now. This time, I won't lose. I, too, shall use the Mega Ring and Mega Stone that you researched during your travels. Alright. Who, who, who's he going to be uh, doing it? I'm guessing Gyarados, right? That makes sense. Alright. Sent out. It's probably going to be a fairly similar fight to last time, to be honest. Um, I'm going to hit it up with a Dazzling Gleam real quick. Also, very cool little battlefield here. It looks like we're in lava, but we're not. I don't know why this, I don't know why this is the field they chose, but um, fair enough. Because the entire building looks like blue. And all of a sudden, we're in, like, hell? <laughs> Um, fair enough. Hopefully, wa hopefully Surf can still work here. Resurrect water out of lava. Or energy. See, I would think this is some form of, like, energy, but I literally see it bubbling. So it makes me think that it's actually a liquid. Crunch. Sure, let's forget Mudslap. You can learn Crunch if you want. Trap Inch, Lark Crunch, Chindra 30, Punch Crow, okay. Basically the same Pokemon, except this time he's gonna Mega Ball for Gyarados, which is kinda cool. Get Zapped. There we go. Gabite 32. Gyarados. Alright, here's, here's his Mega. Okay, and I'm gonna hit it with a Thunderbolt. All right. See, if this was like the first time ever seeing it, I'd be like, "Whoa!" I mean, I've seen this before, but honestly, I'm not actually, I'm not actually a fan of Gyarados' Mega Evolution. I think it kind of looks cheap, to be honest. I don't think it looks that nice. All right, but it is strong. Well, let's uh, hit it with one more Thunderbolt. Should be catch here. I don't know. I, I just I don't like what they did with the design. It looks like a fat worm with like blood pockets. I I don't know. Not not a not a fan. They could have done many many cool things with it, but they didn't. It's over. Fools with no vision will continue to defoul this beautiful world. It will go on until the only thing left is to squabble over the remaining scraps of hope. Dude, the world is fine. Like, I don't know what you're on about, bro. We got cafes and stuff. They're kind of sick. Wah. Um, know what I think? Even if there is only a little bit of something, it's still best to share it. Even you managed to use Mega Evolution. That's because Gyarados shared his power with you, didn't it? And not just Gyarados, but your other Pokemon, too. The legendary Pokemon is gone, so you can't use the ultimate weapon anymore, right? You don't have to worry about the future all by yourself. I think everyone should work together to make a better, beautiful world. If that were possible, all wars would have ended long ago. I can only see one future. One where selfish, foolish humans think that, no, think 
about nothing other than themselves and steal more and more from one another. It's a tragic future. The original purpose of this device was to bring a Pokemon back to life, but the ancient king transformed it into this ultimate weapon. When the legendary Pokemon awakened, it took too much of its energy, its power, that had been sent to the ultimate weapon. There's not much power left, but there is enough to use at once. David, Sycamore's pupils, let us live forever, that's right, I shall grant you eternal life, I'll give you the pain of endlessly waiting for a beautiful world to finally be built. David, Sean, let's get out of here. Is he gonna actually use it? That's not very good. How about it just like not work? That'd be kind of cool too. Friendly fire? Did it just like fail? What? Phew, I'm so glad you're all safe. I really respect the courage and kindness all of you showed. Thank you, we're all fine. Are you guys okay, Tierno? Yep, as you can see, we're doing great. Thanks for asking. We work together to save the Pokemon connected to the stones on Route 10. I mostly left I mostly left battling with Team Flare to Cena and Dexio though. Who are these Cena and Dexio you speak of? We're the masked heroes. Don't worry about it, Tierno. We were all doing the best we could to stop Team Flare's plans. Oh, we have a little bit of news for you all. We managed to destroy the machine in Lissandre's lab that was spying on people's Holocaster transmissions. So we won't have to deal with Team Flare anymore? Now I can go back to filling up my Pokedex. So it's finally over, right? We can go back to our adventure, right? Let's go back to Anastar City and start over from where we left off. Alright. Thank you, Big D. I have so much respect for you as a friend. It's because I respect you that I want to beat you as your rival. I really mean it. Alright. So, ooh. Hey, it's the Tall Man. A long, long time ago. A very long time ago. Oh, he's gonna tell us a story. The man made an ultimate weapon. Using it required the life force of many Pokemon. The Pokemon granted eternal life learned this. The resurrected eternal Pokemon left the man's side. The man was surprised and sad. He had revived it so they could be together. Day after day passed, but they were never to meet. Eventually, he became a mere shell of a man. The man condemned to wander forever by the light of the weapon. And a Pokemon that also wanders eternally. Where is it now? What do I have to do to meet it? Sadness. Okay. So, I think we... Do we go back to Anastar? Okay, so I think we go back to... Anastar. Let's go ahead and uh, use Fly. We can head over here. Yes, to the Anastar City. And then if we try to leave the town, I think that's where Sycamore was. Gonna say something to us. Okay, but can will it now let us go to Route 18? Do you have a minute? I'd like to talk to you face to face. Let's meet in Coraway City. Okay. Well, can I just... Oh, okay, well, I actually haven't been to Carway yet, so I would need to go through Route 18, correct? That is my assumption. Okay, well, okay, I'm like terrible with skates, huh? Alright, Route 18, here we go. And we got a lot of new Pokemon to catch here. Is there Ford Pokemon? Fords? Geodude, Heatmore, Durant. Geodude... Okay, so we do need the Geodude, but honestly, oh man, I think we might have to grab Combi. Well, it's only Geodude, so maybe we can just randomly encounter it in our corner. Alright, well here's what we're going to do. Let's just try to catch a couple Pokemon. Wait, is this going to battle you? Right, let's just try to catch a few. So, my fiance, 
fiance. Jeez, my wife. <laughs> she is not my wife. Is on the on her way home. So I'm only gonna be able to catch a few Pokemon before I inevitably have to leave. So I'm gonna leave very spontaneously, um, randomly, and you guys are gonna be like, "Wow, that was quick." I'm gonna be like, "Yeah, I'm gone now." So let's just catch as many as we can with the time that I got. Oh, I totally thought we had it. Uh, okay, I don't know what I'm doing. Sorry. Just focus, David. Pokemon. Just be caught. Alright, do I have to beat you in this submission? Just stay in the ball for me. Although I will hurt it in a second because I... One... Two, three, please. All right, there we go. All right, we got ourselves a Girder. I actually really like Girder. I think it's a really cool Pokemon. So. Cool, very, very cool. Natural gift. No, you don't need that. Right, let's see what else we got. With strength and body, they skillfully wield steel beams to take down buildings. I don't want to give anything to her, actually. Okay, we're to box seven. I'm actually going to take my headphones off. Because it'd be very weird if she walked in. I'm just recording that before. Ooh, I'm going to do it, though. You would catch it right now. Um, is evolving okay there was one pokemon that died during that whole thing did i revive it i don't know i'm gonna have to re double check that way trap inch evolves into the trap inch no it's trap inch supply down what's the middle way bravo way bravo huh i said it before it came out yeah that's right big brain going all the time here all right we're bravo I probably shouldn't have done that, but it's okay. It's honestly not that big of a deal here. Is one of the Pokemon dead? No, they're all alive. Okay, wonderful. Alright, let's uh, keep walking around. Let's try to find something else here. What else we got? We got ourselves a It's really not that big of a deal, to be honest. Okay, Big Head are an incredible pace and may snap off at spikes and flies. They grow back in a day. Ooh, it seems like a very, very quick... Game is evolving. Alright, we can get evolutions one after another. It seems like a... It has like a pretty gigantic claw. How did, how did it go in one day or does it have like a spare back with a claw inside of the hand? I don't know. 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 I
stone. Now here's Boo is a new Pokemon I do not know what it's more. Is it Slugoo? Slugoo. Front of any of I don't know these Pokemon, but I know these Pokemon. I'm built different. Alright, so we got ourselves a Girder, we got ourselves a Girder. Girder, I'm gonna get Although this is only 5 of them, they're just going to spawn the so. There's also pebbles of a broccoli. Broccoli. Uh, I know it's probably a steel bean Pokemon, but I don't know if it's a broccoli. Hey! Oh, this one. This one. That chance. But this one. This one. Not very likely. Don't have Geo. When did we get when did we get Geo? Okay. Well, let's try to look for one more new thing. Again, I'm just gonna keep going with the items. So those are the they're cold Dorant and Fever. Fever is a rare one. I don't know, but four cold moves. Here we go. One, three. Eight, four, eight, four, eight, four, eight, four, eight, four, eight, Alright, here we 
go. We got ourselves. Durant. We need a single one of them instead of the whole board. Apparently, if this is the whole one, that one will be the one that we get to draw in the first place. I don't know if I can make it. Why should I do that? Which is actually heat wall, so I'm gonna wait for it. Let's do it. We finally found heat more, and my web's almost here. Let's try to catch it really quickly. All right, there we go. We caught the heat more, guys. I'll see you next episode. Hey everyone, we're playing some more Pokemon. I think I have time for an episode or two tonight. Um, these are the Pokemon that we're at. So we have, of course, our Starmie, and we have all the Pokemon we're trying to slowly evolve. Ironically, we basically have just a bunch of pseudo legendaries along with Legender because I need someone to fly. Um, let me quickly revive Ponyard just so he can get some XP while we're doing all this. But we actually caught all of the Pokemon from this area in the last episode. The only one we're really looking for is now Shuckle with Rock Smash. Um, let me go ahead and get a, a cut on somebody so I can <laughs> cut this little tree. Okay, so let's see. Very, very quickly. Let's go ahead and get rid of Scary Face. I don't know why I need scary face here, so let's go and do that. Okay. And let's go see what's behind this little tree. Zoink. And then I already gave Rock Smash to the Bravo, so that's kind of cool. Oh. Get a berry. Pretty epic. What is down here? An item. PP up. Those are actually very useful. I'll probably give that to Starmie for serve. Ooh. Okay, did I just, like, skip an area? What is up here? Okay, I gotta fight this guy. When it comes to climbing, you can ascend or descend. Which do you prefer? Um, to be honest, <laughs> descending, because ascending is a lot harder. So I'll go with the descending uh, for what is descending for 400, please. Alright, so I'm this. Um, Dazzling Gleam. That should do something. Okay, didn't do much. Okay. <laughs> Oops. 
What is you? You're a water ground, right? Alright, whatever. I'm just gonna throw water at you. It'll be fine. Everything is always fine when you throw water at it. That's usually how it works. Oh, so that's super effective. I did not realize that would be... Alrighty. Ooh, my brain's working overtime today, I guess. Yeah, Fletchinder to 34. I'm pretty sure Fletchinder's pretty close to evolving. Looks like my battling luck is going downhill. Okay, so... Oh! Jeez. Aren't Pokemon moves just the coolest? I really wish I could use them. Are you telling me you want to just, like, shoo water out of your hands? Kind of like Ooh, okay. Pokemon. Uh, Lissandre had one of these. So. I've already seen it, but it's pretty cool. Oh, I should use the Dazzling Gleam. The Dazzling Gleam would have been super effective. Hopefully I can still kill it. Okay, I can still kill it. Yeah, again, there I really should have used the Dazzling Gleam. Oh, it's alright. Not the biggest deal. Pokemon moves are just so cool. Yeah, some of them. Some of them are not so cool, though. Um, to reverse type matchups. Okay. That's weird. Um, you seem like a good trainer. Um, okay. Yeah, sure. Yeah, let's, uh, do it. Alright. He, he seems like he's like, oh, it's gonna be hard. I don't think it should be that hard, to be honest. Um, yeah, so in this case, so I would hit it with a water attack, but I'm not going to. I'm actually going to hit it with a Thunderbolt, because Thunderbolt should not be effective against Rock. Okay. In that case, it wasn't, it was just neutral. Okay, wait, so would I hit it with a... Jolteon. Okay, see, this... It's just gonna be another neutral. I don't think it's gonna be neutral. Yeah, it's just neutral. See, but here, I would not hit it with a Surf. I'm gonna hit it with a Thunderbolt. Oh! He absorbs it. That's pretty annoying. Okay, now I'm paralyzed. That's not gonna be good. Okay. Um. Full heal. I want to do like a full, full heal, full restore. Yes. Now let's just do this. Just so I don't, I don't have to do anything crazy. Okay. Thunder. Don't paralyze me again. See, this should not be that effective. Yeah, because it's it would normally be effective, but this time it's not. Okay. I can't. Yeah, Thunderbolt would be super effective, but it absorbs it. Alright, let's just do a neutral move with a Dazzling Gleam and call it a day here. Dude, he's gotta stop doing that. Cause that's very annoying. Well, hopefully I just won't get be paralyzed here. Please, Simon. Please. Don't. Just stop. Don't miss. You literally just need to get rid of this Jolteon and then we just don't have to worry about getting paralyzed anymore. There we go. I just didn't want to deal with the paralyzation. Okay, there we go. Took a bite to 35. Solid. No, we'll keep. Okay, so in this case, I would hit him with a Dazzling Gleam. But right now, I do not want to do that. I would hit him with a Power Gem here. Okay. not very good. Alright, let's just uh, bring in the bites for now, just so I can heal it. Ooh, this battle is weird. It's not a hard battle, but these Pokemon are actually pretty... They're being a little tough, actually. Um, or Starmie just keeps getting paralyzed. I guess that also kind of sucks. Dude, where is my... Yeah, I just need a... I just need a normal revive here. Hopefully, the bite doesn't get just like blasted to the moon. And Stone Edge, that's fine. Never mind, that's not fine. It was very much killed with the bite. That's alright. Alright, back to Starmie. Hopefully, 
No longer paralyzed. So that's pretty good. Let's hope we will go ahead and do a power gem and hope that please kill it. Okay, good, good, good. Again, it was just the paralyzation that really kind of threw it really off balance here. Okay. Level ups. A lot of level ups. Alrighty. Crust. Okay. So once again, um, well, I guess I don't know. I know the thunder is neutral. Let's do the power gem, and this actually should be super effective. It should be. Yeah. Oh, it's not. So it would be effective against it? Why? It's a rock Pokemon. That may have turned me out even more than my Pokemon. Okay, whatever. I don't particularly care anymore. Oh, hey! Alright, we're getting that final evolution of Flechinder, which is pretty, pretty cool. That kind of sucks, because I don't need to find another bird Pokemon to fly me around. Because I'm not going to keep it in my party. I want to level something else up, because I'm here for the Dex entries, you feel? So, um... Kind of sad, because I'm going to find another bird. But we got ourselves... What is it? Talonflame, right? Talonflame, okay. This one was definitely named by a third bear. Uh, it's a Firebird Talons and Talon Flame. Great. But I'm not sure if you really understand inverse battles. Anyway, I'll give you this. What do you mean do I not understand inverse battles? I understand inverse battles perfectly. What are you on about? Alright. I just your stupid Jolteon kept paralyzing my star meat. I couldn't do anything about it. Alright, that's fine. I'm just kinda sad he says I didn't understand it. Does that mean I did like a poor job in the battle and that's why I got such a poop item? But why am I doing this? I don't need any other Pokemon in here. I, we already caught all of these. I grab one, I don't need you. I already caught one of you. And I actually, I caught a smaller version of the Geo I don't need you. Get out of here, bud. But I do need to shuffle. But that one will need to find a rock to smash. Okay, so I just swing over here. What is... Okay, I don't know what's over here, but let's take a look. Let's see. I need to get over to that rock trainer. Oh, okay. No! Oh, no, I'm late, I'm late. Oh, no, watch out, watch out. Okay, why are we fighting? You're trying to be last, Sarah. If, we're, if you're late, wouldn't it be better to get moving? I, I don't understand. I think I might, I might be confused here. Okay, all right, now I gotta remember that I'm not an Ember's battle. I was about to use Dazzling Gleam, and I'm like, wait. I do not want to use Dazzling Gleam here. That would not be a good one. Okay, critical hit. You love to, you absolutely love to see it. Yudene. Okay. Let's rip it up. Lagoo 42. Oh, what, what, where am I anyway? I, I don't know, man. We're on route something. Alright, give me, give me a shuffle. I want a shuffle. Um, shuffle, please. Maybe a blue one? Yeah, let's go ahead and smash it. Give me a sh... Heartstone. Take it. I was more in line of wanting to shuffle though. Yeah, I'll keep the Hearthstone. Alright, question. What is over here? I want to know what's over here first. Okay. Oh, this is Caraway Town. Okay. Well, hey, while we're here, let's go ahead and heal up. And we can kind of go back and finish up that route. Come on, real quick. Okay, so the other way is Terminus Cave. Okay, real quick, let's go ahead and throw away Talonflame. Okay, I'm pretty sure Drifloom can learn fly, right? Because I think it. I'm pretty sure it carries off children, right? So. I would assume that if you can carry off children. Oh, wait, I have a Brava. Oh, I'm such a dummy. Okay, well, funny enough, it can't learn fly, which is very weird. But that's fine. The Brava can do it itself. Let's get rid of Rock Smash here. 
Wait. Oh. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I'm not gonna read it. I just need a rock smash. Wait, I need the rock smash to get the shuckle. No. Okay, hold on. Let's go back to rock smash. I need someone else to learn rock smash. Maybe someone else can. Um, buy a couple ultra balls, I guess. Um. We don't need much of this. We'll probably use some paralyzed heals. No, we don't. Probably some revives. Go back to 21 revives. Buy a couple of these. I like full restores, those are real nice. Oh, a couple of hyper potions, yeah. Okay. Alright, we should be good for now. I that was like literally the first time I've ever bought like actual items. Just because I've never really needed to before, but not like maybe I should. Okay, let's head back in. And we're still looking for Shuckle, and then I guess we'll go take a look at what goes on in the turn the turn. I would also like a shuckle, please. Let me get one of those shuckles. Shuckle? Big Pearl. Sell that for money. Oh. Is there literally nothing over here? Did I come back here for nothing? Wait, no. There's, there's people over here. Yeah, there were... Wait, yeah, there was, there was things over here. If I defeat you, I'm going to head home and break some... What was that? Break some cookies? What are you, what are you breaking, Yanis? I probably didn't read the cookies. Alright, don't oh. Alright. Uh, Dazzling Gleam. Oh. Okay. Drifloom to 16, and Drifloom's a pretty quick evolver, too, so. Um, that one's probably gonna be on our team for like. Not even two episodes, probably. Okay, come on. I'm like, not gonna just run away. Stop! I wanna keep. I wanna keep. Oh, that's a cool Pokemon you got there, bud. A Pangoro. I want myself one of those. My problem is. Actually, I can get myself one of those at basically any time. I just need to grab Panchan back, and I just need to bring a quick. quickly a, a dark Pokemon with me, and I can get a Pan. a Pan. a Pangoro. Okay, the Bravo to 39. Earth power. No, you don't need Earth power. Okay, maybe you do want Earth power. Should, should we learn Earth power? What's Earth's... Yeah, let's, actually, let's go ahead and get rid of Rock Slide. Earth power is pretty good, I think. So let's go ahead and do that. Just loom 17. From 18. Woo! We're going up quick. Sigh. Maybe you should stop sucking. Alright. Gimme. X defense. Okay. Never gonna use that because I'm just gonna be too busy surfing, but fair enough. Okay, so this has been the Terminus Cave, right? Okay, well, before we do anything there, I need to get that stupid shotgun, bro. So. I need to keep. Ooh, I need to keep breaking these rocks to get that shuffle. So let's keep breaking them. Okay, well let's I guess go ahead and go inside Terminus Cave and we can grab Shuckle inside of here. Um. Okay. Dragon Scale. So I think in this first layer, there's actually nothing that I need. Let me check if there's anything that I need. Here we go, Max calls. Jesus, that took way too long to find. Alright, now we can kind of explore the cave in private. Really, the only thing we need is... Wait. Okay. How do I... Oh, we can kind of go up here. Oh, uh, well, dummy head. All right, that makes a little more sense. I'm like, huh? Where are we going? All right, let's quickly. What is over here? Is this just a... okay? I think it's just an off point. Okay. All right, let's go in here. Quick break. All right, we like quick break. Break. No. 
these places have like an obvious... I'm not here either? Where in the world am I supposed to... No, I'm not gonna use another right now because I don't know where I'm going. Wait! Oh! I just have to go in here, don't I? I'm a little dummy head, aren't I? Okay. Alright, here we go. And there's a lot of rocks for me to smash, so hopefully one of these will be a stupid shot. Alright, no chuckle. Chuckle, please! Still no chuckle. You have to chuckle way too many times this episode, huh? Still no chuckle. What about you? Would you like to become a chuckle? Gotten more items than Pokemon, which is very interesting. Alright, um. Don't need you, Larion. I actually need. Give oh, me a horde? That'd be cool because I need a horde of Aaron. I will take that if you got it. If you have that in stock for four. Alright, one more shuffle attempt here. Nothing. Alright. Well, let's keep moving. Like I said, right now I probably use a repel, but I do need to get a Aaron Horde, so. And I could just bring on Combi, but I'm too lazy. I don't want to do that, so. Smash. Shuckle, please. Why no Shuckle? I don't want you, Graveler. You're a pretty cool Gen 1 Pokemon, but I don't need you right now, bud. I need someone else. I need like a full. Okay. Interesting. Okay, this is gonna be new Pokemon. Okay, uh, maybe a dose. Okay, hopefully we don't like that, but we'll get both of them. That's all right. All right, area dose. Yeah, disgusting little bug. We'll go and throw a net ball at you because you are a bug type. So let's go and try to catch it here. Ah, you butt cheek. All right, then. Ooh. Should I throw a Master Ball at it? No, obviously. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw some Ultra Balls. I don't know. I made that really, really, really big mistake in Leaf Green where I used my Master Ball on Mewtwo instead of waiting for the, uh, using it on the Suicune. And I paid dearly for that. So. Now I'm being, like, extra cautious with my, uh, Master Ball. I don't know what legendaries are inside this game. Once again, my first playthrough, I don't know what legendaries are here. Um, but if there is, if there is a roaming legendary like in the other games, um, I do want to keep my master ball for it. All right, come on, man, just stay in the stupid wall. You're just a bug. I don't want to spend too much money on you. And you already one, but she. Let's, I'm gonna throw like maybe two more. If it doesn't get caught in two more, I'm gonna start hurting it. One, two, three, stay. Alright. Cool. First, I was an annoy bat. An annoy bat is super sick. I love annoy bat. It spins string not only from its rear, but also from its mouth. It's hard to tell which end is which. Very nice. Love it when I can't tell the butt from the mouth. Alright. Shuckle! Please? Max Ether. I'll take the Max Ether. It's actually really useful. Battle. Oh, uh, what are you looking at? I'm gonna make you help me work if you lose. Okay. 
right? Ooh, Narek. It's gonna be pretty bad. Too. It's all rock Pokemon, therefore I'm just gonna surf on it a couple million times while I look at messages sent to me by my life. Surf. Surf the pond. Oh boy. Alright. Okay, so the tires just hit me. Okay. On year to 43. Go bite to 36. Just put in 19. Graveler. Another Graveler. Alright. Another surf. Sturdy. Cheap. Because they could end up... Like, I hate Pokemon that have Sturdy and then they also have, like, a status effect move. So they live off with the Sturdy and then just, like, paralyze me or something. And then it's like, no, that's not very cool of you. That wasn't very cash money. Okay. Ooh, a Golem! That's a good Pokemon. That's about to die very, very quickly. There we go. Alright. Well then I've got to participate in Clan Warrior voice. Yeah, Clan War, right? Is Clash Royale Clan War too? I think so. Alright, drifting to 21. Uh -huh. 21. The battle was a good sweat, even better workout than digging. Alright, next. Slash. I need you. So very cool. Oh, so I should probably kill Starmie. That might be a good idea. Okay, hold on. Let's go ahead and uh, use an extra power real quick. Um, just so I don't want to do much of a Like, what's over here? Okay. Ho ho ho, I dropped my book while I was running across. Okay, whatever, just shut up and find me. Aaron. Why does he not have a Larian or an Aaron? His name is Aaron. That was like a very dumb mistake by the developers. His name is Aaron. Why didn't you give him an Aaron? Like an absolutely pumped up Aaron. I... Such a missed opportunity game. Come on, man. His name is literally Aaron. If there was a Pokemon named David, I would definitely just use that one for the rest of my life. Right. I'm trying to figure out which one is the bad end. So I want to go down the bad end first. Okay, I'm assuming this is the way we actually have to go. So um, let's go ahead and run all the way back. I just don't want to go down the right end here. I'm still looking for a shuttle. So if you want to give me one of those, that would also be pretty McLitty. Shuckle time. What is the chance of this shuffle? Oh, pet. What? All those numbers don't make sense. This is 95 Graveler, 10% shuffle. Um, that's 105%. Okay. Well, then, shuffle is very, very rare. Then we'll just leave it at that. Hopefully, I'll get one eventually. So I don't want to go that way just yet. Gonna fight this guy first. Alright, Dimitri. Hillary? That's an interesting Pokemon I have for a miner. Like, again, the Sand Slash makes sense. A uh, Hillary, a water Pokemon, and a mine? Okay, well, fair enough. He's gonna get thundered. I'm still looking for. We just need to find that Noibat and the Shuckle, and then the Aaron, if possible. I mean, your Pokemon make quite the nice picture, too. Thanks, bud. Appreciate the words. So let's have to go lower. Okay, let's go use a Rock Smash here. 
maybe Shuckle? Shuckle! Hey, there you go. The 5%. Either it's a 5 or 10%, I don't know, but either way, very nice. Thank you, Shuckle. Um, we're gonna go ahead and uh, throw an Ultra Ball at you. I'm not gonna try to accidentally kill this thing because it's not it's pretty rare. So I'm just not gonna deal with it. Thank you, Shuckle. I love me, Shuckle. You, I literally, you can't go wrong with a Shuckle, so. Um, I will now stop saying the word Shuckle. And hopefully you guys won't be too bad. The berry store in this jar-like shell eventually become a thick, pulpy juice. Mm, delicious. I love thick, pulpy juice. Moonstone. Actually, we need quite a few of those because there's a lot of Pokemon that evolve with that. Um, if I go over here... I don't have a choice, I just did it. Okay, wonderful. Um... Yes, let's go and use another, just for now. So I can kind of get back up to where I was. Okay, so if I go... I need to go back over here. I need to go back down here. Yes, I need to go up here. Okay, wait, so on. What if I... Oh! Annoy that, please. No, I don't need you. I need the bat. I really like it, man. Want a battle bud? Did you see that hike on the top of the bridge? He's been running back and forth like that for the last couple of days. I wonder if he's alright. He's probably fine. Bergen. Bergen. Oh, that's a cool one. I like that one. Alright. Yes, the pod. Don't have oh, I was saying, don't have sturdy. He has sturdy. Of course they have sturdy. Alright, I'm gonna throw a couple rocks at the rock. I don't think it's gonna take like, some damage anyway, so that's fine. Initiates rock noises. Goodbye, 30 seconds. He looks Pokemon that we could probably serve. I don't, I don't know if Thunder, I always forget that Thunder's gonna be like electric. Oh, but it's also sturdy. It's built, oh. It's going underground. Alright, well then I'll use that opportunity to just heal really, really quickly. Yeah, while you're underground, I'll just heal. Because I'm gonna need to heal later anyway, right? So that's fine. Throw a rock at your head too. It'll hurt you much, but it'll hurt you just enough. So maybe hurt your feelings. Ponyard 44. Chicken 24. Come to think of it, I've been standing here in the same spot for the last couple days too. And don't you guys like need to eat or something? Point, point, point. I do not want to go in that direction. Hello? Oh. I do want to go in that direction. Wait. Wait. I screwed with myself. I want to go in this direction. I want to go down here. That's the one. Yeah, let's go to another. Hello? Fight me! Boom! One final gambit, little sweep right where it counts. Okay, so, while we fight her, let's get the list. So we literally just need the Eren, the Eren, or anything like that. Julia. Eren and... Is that oh I hate being paralyzed. I, that's quite literally like the worst. Because it slows you down too, so I end up getting hurt while I try to kill it. And I end up just being paralyzed anyway, so I don't think it matters. Come on. Please just let me hit. 
And attacking while being paralyzed. That's like some real like that's actually really gangster, so I'll take that any day. Oh, that was a cracking arm thrust counter if I do say so myself. I don't think that's a thing. Maybe it is a thing, it's just a really dumb thing. An arm thrust counter. But what I do know is I do need to revive. How many of these do I have? Ah, oh, we only have two. Okay. Okay. Mm, I have a feeling that I don't want to go down there just yet. Let's just break this rock really quickly. Hopefully, just get an item. Because now I now I do not need any more encounters. Now I get an encounter. Watch it be another shuffle after I got. Well, uh, whatever. I don't need anything. All of you, leave me alone. I don't, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm tired. Um, let's just keep moving here before I lose my mind. Yes, but I'm totally using so many repels. Wait, this is where I came from, didn't I? Okay, yeah, so... I'm gonna go up here. So I guess I could've just did it, but whatever. Oh, well, okay, I don't want to read the ship. Let's go see what items are over here. Okay. Oh, ball. Very nice. Oh, did I mean to do that? Oh, actually, that's fine, because I can just go zoop. Zoop, zap, zoop, zoink. Wait, oh, I don't, my stormy's not in a good shape right now. Oh, that's just one, okay, Hariyama. Ooh, well, I can't really have Starmie get hit here, so. Um, also, none of my Pokemon are, like, alive, which kind of sucks. But, to be honest, not that big of a deal. Whoever is alive will just get a lot more XP than the rest. Yeah, that's fine. Lose is not the end. Okay, I'm tempted to just straight up go back and get like a couple of like and just revive my people here. Um, okay, that's probably where actually I need to go. So I'm gonna hold off on that. I think we're actually almost done with this place, so I'm just gonna hold my breath for a little while here. Get this item, Shadow Ball. Okay. Yes, I'm gonna use another again. I just don't wanna fight any more things here. Okay, let's go quickly double check what was over here. Full heal. Let's just take this fight really, really quickly. Honestly, this this episode is running really long, but I kind of just want to get this done. Ooh, those are two really cool Pokemon, though. The problem is, I'm wondering, should I just use Surf and just like sacrifice the move? I almost think I should. Let's just do it. Um, yeah. There 
go. That works. And Slagoo even survived. Look at that. Alright, that's Slagoo up to 44. Go bike to 38. Go Bravo to 42. Drifloon to 26. I think, do we have an evolution here? Your Pokemon shine more brightly than any jewel I've ever seen. The equipment might have an evolution here. Nope, okay. I don't want to jump down there. Iron plate. I just kind of want to get to the last floor here. Wait, that goes up. Where does this go? That goes nowhere. Okay. Um, is it? Wait, I wanna... Is there not a Pokemon right there that I can battle? Okay, guys. I think we're actually gonna just continue this next episode because this episode's running a little long. I'll see you guys in the next episode. What's up guys? We're gonna continue some Pokemon. I think we finished most things last episode in here. Hey, hey, can't you see? Can't you see I'm working here? I think we finished mostly everything last episode. I think we caught all the Pokemon. We only missed a single one. And that's Noibat. And but that's like an, an encounter Pokemon. You don't like a special encounter Pokemon. So that one we'll kinda have to look for a little bit. Um it is also I think one of the rare Oh, sturdy. Oh, I gotta get sturdy on me. Alright, that's fine. You can do that. That's cool. You can take aim at me. That's cool. Not like it's gonna too much. Alright, there we go. So, yeah, I don't know. So I'm looking at like this spawn right from my back. It doesn't even tell me, so. Um, hopefully, we find it. Oh, no, no, I'd better get back to work now. Hey, you, you probably should, but tell me why you're here. Oh, okay, this guy did not want to fight me. Durian, I do not need you, Durian. Listen, we caught, I think we caught everything. The only thing I didn't catch last episode, because I did it in between, because it took so long, was Aaron. Um, and of course, I know I could just breed one, but, you know, I don't want to do that. It must be, da it must be dangerous to go further... Ahead, unless you're strong as a champion. For real? Okay. Well, I'd smash that rock. Why? We already got a shuffle. Alright, well, here's not my problem. So I'm guessing, well, I can't go any further without probably getting all the gym badges, which is chill. Are we just done here, then? That's, that's the cave, I guess, right? I mean... Nothing else in here. Um, Alright, well, let's get out of the cave. Let's go back to the town, I guess. Um, well, technically, we haven't even explored the town yet. We, The town is right below this, and we just like stopped by the healer at Pokemon. And then... Okay, I need to figure out where the little drop things are to get either Ariados or Noibat. Because I need to just like sit there and farm it for a very long time until I get the Noibat that I'm looking for. Whoa, okay, um... There's Noibat? I thought I had to get like a special like shaking area. Maybe I wasn't paying attention. Alright, well, either way, it's in front of us. Let's go ahead and um Ooh, I kinda want it in a premiere ball. I think that'd be really, really cool. Let's let's throw our last premiere ball here. Let's see if we can maybe get Noibat in it. Please, 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 please. Oh, we were so close. Oh, that's actually kind of a bummer. I really wanted that. Alright, that's fine. Well, I want to try to get into something else. No. Alright. What about, is this flying? Oh, that's not what I need. Okay, screw it. Ultra Balls, I right, whatever. We only had one cool Pokeball to really throw at this moment, so... That's fine. Please? Thank you. Alright, and actually it wasn't even that hard to catch, surprisingly. 
Now here's my problem. When does it evolve? Level 48. Okay. So, it's got a little bit to go here, but, um... Actually, not, not really. They live in pitch black caves. Your enormous ears can emit ultra so sound waves of 200,000 hertz. Pretty cool, my friend. Pretty cool. Hey! Evolution just in time because I want to put Noi Bat in my party. So, thank you, uh, Mr. Balloon Man. I'm pretty sure it carries off children, or it might be... Probably thinking of a different Pokemon, but either way creepy. So it doesn't particularly matter. Alright, we got ourselves a drift loom. Nice. I have a lot of shiny drift loom in Pokemon Go. Okay. Alright, Coraway Town. Alright, well. Let's go ahead and stop in though. Thingy. We're gonna go ahead and heal our Pokemon. Um, but first we're gonna deposit. So we can go ahead and deposit Drifloom. We're gonna I think we keep everything else. Yeah, everything else we kinda keep for now. I don't know, let's just go ahead and put Drifloom in here. Fill that box up. We're gonna withdraw. I think it went to box five, did it not? Yep, Noibird. 45. It actually evolves very, very soon. I didn't realize that they were so high here. Um, but fair enough. Unheal. Yes, I, that's why I'm talking to you. Thank you, Nurse Joy. Boom, boom, boom. All, all of them? Oh, actually, I was gonna say all of them are Ultra Balls except Starmies and a Dive Ball. Okay, do I need to buy anything? Let's quick take a look. How many Ultra Balls do I have? Oh, I have like 70. That's good. Revives, 19. That's good. Um, I have a couple of those. Max Repels. I'm gonna buy 11 more of those. Actually, let's go ahead and buy another 11 of those. Let's go ahead and buy a couple of escape ropes here. Okay, now we're good. Thank you, good sir. Alright, yeah, I think we're good to go. Um, like I said, we actually haven't been inside the town yet. So, powerful moves have fewer PP, which is short for power points. Okay. What is inside? Door number one. I want to be loved. Do you have a Pokemon that uses Nuzzle? No. Wish there. I wish that I were a Pokemon. Okay. okay. That's weird. Ooh, protein. Okay. You guys are weird. All right. Weird. Weirdos. Are you familiar with the abilities that keep Pokemon from playing battle? They don't work on ghosts. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I already talked to you, bud. Sorry for wasting your time. What is up here? Oh. Free TM. You'd love to see it. Thank you. Um, what is this place? Library candy. Those, those are pretty nice. Um, I know I could probably use a waterfall to get up that. And we'll probably end up taking this train later at some point, but... Oh, hello? Hi. Oh, cool music. I have to apologize to you about Lissandre. I'm very sorry for the trouble he caused. I'd also like to thank you. I'm sincerely grateful for what you did for all the Pokemon and people of this world. And by stopping Team Flare, you also saved Lissandre. I always knew that he desired a beautiful world. Maybe someday the population of people and Pokemon will increase to where resources become very scarce. If someone acts out of greed in such a world, Surely some will go without. If all living things keep acting that way, there will be nothing left at all in the end. Why, there won't even be anything left to steal, will there? But what I really wanted was for him to put his ego aside and lead everything to greater heights. I never had this discussion with him, though, so I'm partially responsible for this. Well, enough of that, David. I want you and your Pokemon to take everything you learned from your journey and hit me with your very best shot. We're fighting the professor. Alright, Mr. Sycamore. Let's see what you got. Venusaur. Um, bad matchup for my Starmie. But I've also probably got 30 levels on him. On the dot. Um, let's hit him with a Dazzling Gleam. He'll probably not kill him. Oh, the opposite of not kill him. It is not even effective. Oopsie Daisy. 
My bad. Alright. Let's hit him with a thunderbolt then. Not. <laughs> I suck at this game. I am apparently terrible. I keep hitting him with things that are not very effective. What about power gem? Is power gem effective? I have no idea. Okay. That's gonna be That'll be fine. That will not be fine indeed, actually. Alright. Oh. Alright, kids. This is why tight matchups are important. I have 30 levels on him and I still ended up dying somehow like a doofus. Really do be like that. So, make sure to keep your Pokemon good. That'll dance. I don't think that'll kill Pokemon here. Okay. He done com confused himself. No, 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 not Sligoo. I want Starmie. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Surf him out of here. Get him out of here. I don't like Venusaur. Venusaur is a poop head. And it just so happens that all my moves are currently not very effective against him, so. Last toy is no cool. Keep battling here. Does he have all of the just original Pokemon? Very quickly. Let's go ahead and revive. Fawn, you still want him to get the XP. Aqua Tail, but that shouldn't be much. Alright, we won't we we shouldn't have too much trouble with this. We'll go ahead and hit him with a thunderbolt. And if my thought cross is correct, his next one should be a Charizard, and we have Surf for that, so. It was just just the Venusaur that can cause me a bit of trouble here. Sligoo to 45. Go bite to 39. Charizard, yep. Alright. Bonk. Hit him with a surf. Stupid Venusaur. See, it's things like that I want to cut out of the video. Like, man, I can't believe I just hit him with, like, two attacks that weren't effective. Like, come on, David. You really are something. You and your Pokemon have developed strong bonds by spending time together. That's why your Pokemon are so strong. Thanks, bud. Also, because I grind a lot, but yeah. The strength you found is simply marvelous, and you truly love and trust your Pokemon, David. A treasure of mine is hidden in this town. If you'd like, try to find it. Well, I'll be off then. I have too many preparations to must attend. I have a little surprise planned for all of you to thank you for fighting to try saving cows. Alright. Okay, so this is the next part of the town. What is over here? Okay, there's literally nothing over here. What oh, waterfall. Okay. I could probably go up that later. Hello? I really like the story of the match card climbing the waterfall. Good for you, bud. Alright, let's see. What is up in door number two? We visited the art museum? Oh, uh, then I guess. Is Froki Height? No. No. Actually? Wait, yes. Oh. 15 pounds. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay. Oh. Haha, uh -huh. thank you. Totally guessing the both of those. I just I I'm like, no, Froki is not a foot, and then Froki seemed about 15 pounds, so. Uh oh, okay, just okay. I don't care. I'm not gonna use mimic in a single player game. Okay, I don't really care about pictures. Is it not gonna let me go past here? It will. Okay, and this is Route 19. Ooh, nope. I wanna talk to you, bud. Hello? Nothing. <laughs> Let's go see what's up the stairs. Is it a gym? Ooh. How about Cartways Town Famous Fresh Water? It's dude. Um, sure. And just in case I can give it to someone for like an item or something. Thank you. Okay. 
And I, I can't forget about the what the professor said. The professor said there was an item in this town somewhere, so I can't forget about that. Is this the art? What the heck is this? Okay, this is the hotel. Skirt. Okay. Alright, let's go see if there's anything in the rooms that I can um, not do that. That I can steal. Gimme, gimme. Right, it looks like she's in her work clothes. If you're your vacation, why are you in your work clothes? Oh, this guy will be able to give me a power, right? Yeah, hey, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, thank you. It's bonding time. Cool. Thank you, Mr. Guy. Cool. I don't know how to use those or when to use them. I am a boomer. I'm a Pokemon boomer. I have no idea. Is it, like, down here? Is this... Is this... Um... Let's go down here. I'll probably end up playing with it later at some point. We can surf there. Okay. Where does this... Oh, also, I should probably cart away... I don't have waterfall. I don't... At least I don't think so. Hey, there's the one that we need. I'm pretty sure we already have floats on. I'm like 99% sure we do. Apparently we also have lombre. Okay, apparently I don't need either of them. Apparently I have already both of them. Also, I'm just gonna double, double, double quickly check. Okay. Well then, we'll have to come back here when we can use the move Waterfall. Also, I should totally go back because my Starmie got hit. So might as well just quickly, quickly, quickly heal. Maybe while I heal, I'll just like... Okay. See, and this is where me not playing in a little while has caused me has caused me trouble. I don't remember what we have and haven't caught. Um, so we're on Route 19. I don't remember which Pokemon we have caught and not caught. So we can get a Whiskatch and Politoed from the Super Rod here. And then, what else? That Quagsire, Sligoo, Weeping Bell. I think we have most of these, honestly. Um, I don't think any of these are new. Like, like I said, the Carnivine. Ooh, that's actually the rarest one. It's the 5%. Is it, do I have this? Yeah, of course I have it. I'm like, this is actually kind of really lame. I think I have all of these. I really think I have all of them. Maybe, do I have stun things? Oh, we can get a Gl Gligar. That's pretty cool, but that's from the Horde. Okay. Big D! Hey, do you know what's about to happen? Of course. That's right, we're going to battle. We are Pokemon trainers. Alright, well, let's go and battle. I'm just trying to explore the route, man. Alright, Shauna. I don't know why you're battling me, but it's a cool battling spot. I like it. battling on the bridge is actually kind of sick, but your Pokemon are kind of weak. Yeah, I'm never gonna yeah, get it up. I'm pretty sure we haven't caught a Gligar. I'll have to look out for a Gligar board. Okay, Gudra. Don't I have one, one of those of my own? Or do I have. Oh, no, 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 I have a... Oh, no, I just dirtied my glasses like a doofus. Okay. Well, go hit him with a dazzling gleam while I clean my glasses. And I put my dirty... Wow, did they kill it? Doofus got some high defense considering that didn't kill it. Jeez. Alright. Bonk. Ponyard 46. Does, does Ponyard um, evolve now? Bell Fox. Okay. One of my sister's favorite Pokemon. Personally, I think it's weird. I don't like the bushes coming out of its ears, personally, but I who am I to say? Cool. Going back to 46. 
battles with friends are really, really exciting. Why do you look so sad? Or mad? I don't know. It reminded me of our battle in Aquacore Town. That was the first time both of us to battle with our Pokemon. Hello, Big D. Hi, Shauna. What up? What are you up to? Nothing big. How about you guys? Why? Same thing as you, Shauna. We heard about Big D from Professor and we came running as fast as we could. <laughs> Big D, can we have a Pokemon battle? Uh, uh, sorry to just throw that at you. Sure, but I mean, let's do it, I guess. We got here now. Although it is particularly not fair to have a battle and then right after be like, yo, I want to battle you now. Seems like not a very um, cash money thing to do. But it's all right. Okay, so I can hit it with a Surf or a Thunderbolt. I think I'm gonna hit it with Surf just because I like Surf better. It is a bird. Well, actually, no, I think either one would have just been just normal effect in this. Starting at 81. The bite to 40. Dig? No, he doesn't need dig. I can just teach him. I can teach him that anyway later if I really need it. Roserade. This is one that I want. That, uh, ooh, what do I do, though? I have to hit it with a power gem. Wait. Um. I forgot if. What's good against poison? Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. I'll just use another power gem. Call it a day. But I forgot what's effective against poison. Later. Okay, the Bravo to 44. Here we go. Sandstorm. Now, why in the world would you want to learn Sandstorm? Brawdon. That's like an interesting Pokemon to have considering he's, he's that dancing guy. I don't particularly think Crawdon's a very good dancer. I would expect Tierno to have like a, I don't know, like a Lucario and I guess like the Rose Raid makes sense. I don't know. It seems like a weird selection for Crawdon there. It's weird, but I don't get down when I lose to you. Maybe because I'm just better. Wow, it's here to ask you someone to battle. What's up with that? Geosench Town made me think. If Big D hadn't been there, I wouldn't be dancing now, that's for sure. It made me want to get to know Big D better, and I thought a battle would be the best way to do it. It's kind of selfish of me, I guess. But it's also a way of thanking him. Tierno, it's great when Pokemon trainers like us can understand the hearts and minds of other trainers and our Pokemon through battle. But before we do anything else, we should heal your Pokemon. Now it's your turn, Big D. I think I will follow the crowd and be your opponent as well, but this time it won't be about the Pokedex, it will be a Pokemon battle. Alright, Trevor. Let's do it. What do you got, Raichu? Alright. And anything that I'm, I can just surf on is kind of chill with me. To BH. Alright, I'm going. Also, I'm glad they healed my Pokemon. Not really, because I would have beat them anyway, but like, it's nice of them of like, hey, we're not going to just fight three, because technically it's a three on at that point. Okay. Oh, that's a nice Pokemon that I don't have anything effective for. So I might have to hit it with a... Oh, that's not good. Um, and I really need to get something effective against grass types, because... It's not a good time. I don't- wait, why do you thunder me? That's not effective. Not effective enough. Okay. Alright, Thunderbolt one more time. Get it up. Wow. Ooh. Oh, I thought it wouldn't- I thought it didn't kill it right there. I'm like, wow, really? Ponyard to 47. Very bad to 47. Aerodactyl. Okay, I can uh, I can surf on Aerodactyl over here. Also, a very random Pokemon to have. Fair enough. Here we go. Thank you. Mm. Very nice indeed. You're even stronger than I thought. Uh huh. You trying to put me to sleep? There's still so much I don't know. Do I not have what it... Okay, dude. It's the sudden pessimism. 
Wow, I don't think you ever heard you worry about being weak or strong before, Trevor. You seem a lot bolder than you used to be. Is it because you went on a journey, or maybe it's thanks to what you learned from being with your Pokemon and with us, your friends? Speaking of which, where's Serena? She's off training with the Mega Evolution Guru, who said friends are friends even if they can't be together. Indeed, there's something we must attend to. Be seeing you. I'm so glad I went on a journey. I made some great friends, and thanks to my little Fennekin that I met before we left, I was able to visit many places, meet a lot of nice people, and make many wonderful memories. Big D, this is from us. Yes, I can... I'm literally just actually going to go back to the town now. Even if you're battling without the badge from Snowbell City Gym, you can use Waterfall. Gotta get going. See you. Okay. Well, screw all of this noise. Let's go back to the town so I can do a little waterfall and just see what's up there, I guess, right? Alright. Do, do, Drapion. Do I have Drapion? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do I got you? I don't have one of these. Okay. Interesting. Then, we are here to catch it. Again, see, I don't know what I got. I don't got any more of it. I have over 300 entries in the Pokedex. So, I'm kind of... I'm going to lose it a little bit here of what I do and don't got. Okay, let's try another, another little ball here. But I'm... I know I got Sligu. I know I got Quagsire. I know I got Weeping Bell. Terror Blast is Shaman. I'm like 99. 100. I'm going should be good. Spooky face. Don't do that. I don't like spooky faces. It's gonna spook me. Stumpfist? Who's gonna stumpfist? No. Please just stay in the ball. You butt cheek, don't. Huh. Now it's gonna spike me. Hold on, I just wanna switch Pokemon. Make it easier that way. Don't be so difficult. I know I could probably just hurt you, but I don't want to do that. I don't like hurting you. Alright, I'm gonna hurt you. I am going to hurt you. Cut, you're being annoying. I'm gonna power jam you. Hopefully, this doesn't kill you. Hopefully this doesn't kill me. Look at that. Perfect. Alright. This yeah, should catch it. No problem. One. Two. Dude, you don't don't do this. I'm gonna sit here for like five minutes. Also, I'm like very hungry all of a sudden. I should probably get a snack after this episode. Maybe after the next next episode, we'll see. Alright, I'm pulling out my phone. Hold on, this is gonna take absolutely forever. I thought it'd be easier once I got him low, but. Alright. On, which I didn't know I didn't have, so wonderful. We love to see it. It takes pride and strength, even though it can tear foes apart, it finishes them off with powerful poison. There we go, Vibrava's evolving. I'm pretty hopefully I don't know. I know we've got a couple Pokemon just a couple levels away. I know that for a fact. I know um, a pawn yard is close, Noibat's close. Everyone really should be close. Alright, here we go, we got ourselves a Flygon. Pretty cool. Nothing I'd ever use, but pretty cool. Dragon Tail? Um, sure. No. Okay, that's fine. Actually, I don't need that. Okay. Real quick, I guess before we head over to the town, we can head down here and just kind of see what's up. 
Okay, so this is Surf. We could try to see what's... Okay. Alright, that's fine. Let's try maybe... I don't know if I have Politoed or the other one. So we can maybe see if we can catch those while we're here. Oh, Quagsire, I know I got you already. Do I? I do. Okay, I'm like... I'm like 99% sure I have Quagsire already. Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, trainers. What Pokemon is my second? Let's add... No, actually... No, who, who, has a, who would have the high? Actually, Sligoo would probably have the highest defense here. We are Pokemon Rangers. We bring the power of our Pokemon. Okay, just fight, please. Your Rangers, Ivy and Oric. Oros and Milk Tank. Ooh, two big tanky, big tanky HP Pokemon. Okay. Attack Bell, that's fine. Okay. Go ahead and do a do do a little bit of that, and then we could probably bide for now. Let's go ahead and just use a bide. Long. Wow! And it did not kill anyone. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna do the same thing. Keep fighting here. I'm hoping it doesn't kill Sligoo. Okay, we're good. Sligoo is an absolute homie and can survive even shots from Starmie, which is super cool to see. Sligoo to 47. Get rid of Flail, I don't I don't know why Sligo has such bad moves. Should probably get rid of that for something. Okay. We drew out all the power we could, but you're even more powerful. I know, bud. Sorry. Okay. What is up in this whole water, dude? Another Sligo! I don't need you. I have my own. What level are you though? 48. Wow, this Sligo is higher than my own Sligo, which. Probably should have just maybe waited then. Okay. I don't know what the mechanic of that is. But fair enough, I guess. I don't know what that's supposed to do. Carablast? Okay. I'm pretty sure I have you, but this will tell us, which is nice. Do I have you? I have you. Alright. Actually, what I'm gonna do, I don't really need any of you. Let's go ahead and, um... Where's the Max Repel? Dude, why do I- yeah, I was like, I always have such a hard time finding these Max Repels, and I don't know why. Oh, okay, battle. I feel kind of embarrassed in a swimsuit, so I like to swim in murky water like this to stay out of sight. You could just... Not wear a swimsuit. I mean, it's all right though. You do you, boo boo. I, as as a person, like being comfortable. Therefore, if I'm not comfortable. I usually just don't do it. It's just the easiest way to live life. Just, well, okay, that's false in a sense, but yeah, you know what I mean. Obviously, I'm gonna go work because I need to, but... Oh, the murky water couldn't hide my battling weakness. No, we could not. But... Oh, what's over here? Oh, it's just an item. Like, I don't go out to, like, ride roller coasters or skydive or... Why would I, right? It makes me feel uncomfortable. I'm just not gonna do it. Hello? It's a Pokemon Ranger's duty to ensure that Pokemon can live the same way tomorrow as they do today. Alright. Clementine. That's a sick name, actually. I like the name Clementine. A little long. Kind of a mouthful. Maybe because I like tangerines. Only, I would not name your kid Tangerine. Although, now I'm thinking about it, maybe we should. But I love Tangerine. 
they're freaking delicious. I knew there's always going to be tomorrow, so I don't let defeat something something that much. Okay, it's over here. Okay, this is where we gotta surf. And then we'll do a couple of fishing rod casts. Oh. Okay. Let's fight you very quickly. Have you heard of Perkhorn? Sure have, but then it is a kid. Ambre. 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 And there's a little flying squirrel here that I'm definitely going to be thundering out of the sky. Wait, is that a Thunderbird? Ah, I'm just going to surf on it then. Probably easier. There we go. On your 48. Rum pig? No. It really should just be like an option to like... Hold on, what do I do? I'm just gonna surf on you. Like, uh, I will never want to switch Pokemon, basically. I am a very annoying playthrough and I never switch Pokemon. Ouch, don't do that. That is very mean of you, Drum Pig. But, yeah. Yeah. That's the Pokemon. No, I bet it's 48, and I'm pretty sure that might be an evolution there. Um, let's go ahead and get rid of what is this? That's fine. We can go ahead and get rid of that. Um, because I don't think we need that. All right. Parkour doesn't really have anything to do with Pokemon battles. No, it doesn't. But I do like parkour. Noibat. Okay, I thought I'm like, yeah, Noibat evolves at 48, right? I thought I thought it did. Oh, I hit the button. Yeah, um, Noibat's definitely one of those Pokemon that I don't really want to take into the Pokemon League. Um, but I'm trying to be very wary of not just taking basically five pseudo legendaries into it. But oh my god, Noivern is such a cool Pokemon basically the dragon that Charizard should have been, in a sense. Like an actual skinny dragon that can fly, like dragons should be. Um, so who am I to say? What? No, wh where did I? I protect nature. Okay, I was supposed to end off the episode. I guess we're gonna keep it going here. We got two more Pokemon here. A Zangus. Juice. I'm gonna be surfing on you, bud. Okay. One more Pokemon. Well, I got to 46. Bear tick. I need to get myself. What? Do I have? Do I have a bear tick? I don't think I do. Either way. The term Pokemon Trainer is nothing. Is something what? I don't know what you just said. I'm terrible at reading, apparently. Yachberry. Yachi. Berry. Something, something. Where does this go? Oh, it takes us back to the beginning. Okay, well, very cool. Um, there's an item over there, though, so I need to go back still. Yeah, I need to come over here. There's also an item right there that I have to get, which I keep forgetting that I have a repel on, so I don't have to actually be wary about these things. I don't, I'm not going to get encounters here. Another one of those. Okay, so we need to have a Pokemon with strength. Oh, okay. I apparently I don't have a Pokemon with strength. Okay, here we go. Flygon is able to learn it. Very nice. Thank you, Flygon. For being the HM holder in this case, Crunch. 
Oh, all these are... Getting ready to crunch, that's fine. I'm not... Dark moves aren't, like, super useful all the time anyway. Okay, but how do I... Do I push it here? Hold on. Do I just push it down? Push it down, and then I do that. And then I do that. Yeah, and then I do that. That's what I thought. Toxic plate. Okay. So now, oh, we also gotta teach someone waterfall. That's something I can do right now. Okay, well then we'll get someone in our party that can. Alright, um... Let's fish in the next steps. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Hey everybody, we're playing Pokemon. We just got waterfall, so we're gonna go ahead and go back to the town do that whole waterfall thing. We just looked over this portion of the route, but very, very quickly. I don't know if I have Wish Cash or Politoed. So what we're gonna do is um, try to fish for a little while. And let me see if I got them, because I'ma just be 100. I don't particularly remember, and also apparently I suck at fishing, so that's wonderful. Right, let's see if we can get it. Wish Cash. Okay. Do I have a Wish Cash? I do not. Okay, wonderful. And that's what we are going to be throwing. Yeah, we can throw some dive balls. Hopefully, you don't have to throw too many of them. One. Okay. One more. Another dive ball. Here we go. Just scrolling through Twitter. All right. Come on. Come on, Wiz Cash. Don't don't be a butt cheek. Stay in the thingy. Alright. It's gonna be one of those Pokemon, huh? We'll get him eventually. We'll get him eventually. There we go. Alright. We got him, boys. Might have to use a little Hyper Potion on Starmie, because it's starting to take a couple hits, but it claims a large swamp to itself. It's If a foe comes near it, it sets off tremors by thrashing around. That's not very nice of you, Wizcash. That is not very nice of you at all. Alright, here we go! We got ourselves a Politoed! The 5%. We're gonna go with the same procedure here. We're gonna start chucking dive balls. If you like to be in the water, then you're gonna get trapped by a dive ball. Okay, the other thing is, I should probably surf around to see if I got the stun fist. I'm like 99% sure I have a stun fist, but I should probably triple check. So I will do that in just a moment here. I'm pretty sure I have a Swarupi. I'm pretty sure I have, oh, maybe the Gligar. Thank you. I should probably check on the Gligar be a good idea because I don't think I have that actually. Okay, and then I swear after, then we'll finally go to the thing. Wherever three or more of these get together, they sing in a loud voice that sounds bellowing. Okay. So, we can finally just kind of get out of here. Hey okay, everybody, so I quickly grabbed my combi just so I could do this boarding counter very, very quickly. Um, so we got this Gligar here sitting in front of us. Let's go ahead and catch it, and then we can basically move on our way here. Um, because we caught Whiskash and Politoed, now we got the Gligar. I think that's about it, so we're good to go. Um, Night Slash, yeah, let's go ahead and learn Night Slash. We can just get rid of Assurance, I don't need Assurance. Um... Yo, when does Ponyard evolve, bro? He's he, he's 49 now. Is he is he evolving now? It usually clings to close on a spot that's created. Spread the swings and glides to attack. It doesn't. Are those its feet? I can't really tell. Dude, okay, hold on, hold on. Ponyard evolution level. When the 
52. Okay. Why in the world does that evolve at 52? It seems like a really, really high level for that. Um, but fair enough, I guess. All right, let's go ahead and very quickly just put Combi back. I don't think we'll need Combi for a little while. We can't use it until the gym badge is obtained? What do you mean, dude? All right. All right, that's fine. Then let's head over to the next town and we gotta fight their gym. All right, all of that was time for Pokemon battles. What, okay, what in the world? I didn't even realize there was still a, a person to battle here. I thought I battled everyone. All right, fair enough. Pump the boo. Send you. Never mind. I was gonna make a bad joke about making them a ghost, but they're already a ghost. Skittle level 11. Hopefully, we can get Skittle up quickly, but it's only 32, so. Um, yeah. Another surf. Go. I can see myself being defeated by you. Alright, that's a little weird. Okay, so. Wait, we need a max repel again, so. Okay. Hmm. We gotta fight this child alone. Hee hee hee, fall before my fairies. No, I'm good. Leveling. Mr. Mime, that is not, that is a pretty cool Pokemon you got there, bud. I do like Mr. Mime. Let me surf. Bonk. There we go. Skittle to 12. Nope. Yes. Nope. Yes. Okay. Then serve a demon. We got him. So many Pokemon, man. So many Pokemon. Alright, let's hit it with a Thunderbolt here. Thunderbolt. A little, a little better here. Zap. Let's get on to 16. No, I don't need any of these moves for Skiddo. Chinchu to 26. Oh, I, I can see the fairies. Okay, bud. Alright, oh, we need to get this item. A bonk, a bonk, a bonk, a bonk. What is you? All that jumping around for a little max revive, huh? That is... Terrible. Okay, but I can go around here and grab an item, correct? Yes. HP up. Now that is actually a useful item. Very nice. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay, let's go across the bridge. End up somewhere. Alright, we go into Snowbell Town. Wait, what are you guys doing here? Uh, Bergmite. Ooh, Snowbell Town. Pretty, pretty. Alright. You know what I might actually do? We might... Um... We might just go straight to the gym. Beat it. Run back. Do the waterfall thing. Then come back to explore the town. I, I like to do things in chronological order. And it's making me mad that I have to come to this town. To do a mission in another town. So, where's your gym?
But ain't the future champ. Hate to disappoint, but the gym leader's out right now. He said he was off the... They won't let me just use Waterfall, dude. Okay, that's fine. We'll, we won't... We won't... We won't use Waterfall, I guess. Alright, let's explore the rest of the town, then. Bomb of Snow. Why do you sound like an electric guitar? That's probably not healthy. Can you give me something? Would you listen to the... Nope. Oh, okay, yeah. Gosh, we feel bad. Uh, sure, I'll give you a tip. About $100. I don't know why I do this. Does giving them tips actually do anything? Don't know, but it's alright. Ooh, I can teach a move to Kaleido or Maletta. Okay, I don't have either of those. Okay, she doesn't have it. You, try this! Woke up. Okay. Not going to use that, but fair enough. He was trying to help people in need, becoming convinced of people's stupidity and facing his own limitations led him to conclude that the world cannot be saved, which led to his suffering. It's ironic. Alright. Um, I'm pretty sure that took the same thing there. Did I talk to this person? Okay. There's nothing here. Okay, this is a clothing shop. Very quickly, let me run over to this end. Can your Pokemon use Matte Black? I don't know. Alright. Houses with no uses. I'd love to see them. Okay. I have a lot of houses in this town, huh? Hello? Alright. Let's trade my Bishop for a Jigglypuff. I don't have a Jigglypuff. But my Bisharp. Aren't I working for a Bisharp? Am I wasting my time? Okay, I'm I probably spent all this time leveling one up when I probably could have just traded for it later, but it's alright. Okay. Oh, this is just under the bridge, huh? Alright. Well I guess while we're here, let's go ahead and head into clothing shop. Is there anything cool? Maybe I can maybe I can switch my outfit up a little bit. Um, actually, those are extremely lame, so nope, I will not be doing that. It is cold, bruh. It's a cold town. Why would you try to sell me a t-shirt? Okay, where does this take us? This probably takes us to... Okay, nope. Okay. Where does this take? This town is confusing me. Okay. I don't have any starters with me. Okay, why are you telling me all of the starters? I don't have any. I'm not using starters, so kind of useless. But okay. Picture spot. This brings us back to the part. Okay. Is this okay? That's the t that's the forest that we need to get to. Okay, so I think that's the forest where we need to basically go next. But can I grab that item over there? And where does this take us? Does this take us like the just the next route? Hmm, route twenty one. Okay. Well, we're not gonna go to route twenty one yet. Anything? Well, it looks like that forest is kind of where we're meant to be going right now. That is where we're going to go really quickly. Let me see if I have to get here. 
Oh, this is just Route 20. Okay. Oh, yeah, because outside is Route 21. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's fairly annoying. We've been leveling up... Um... Ponyard all this time. When I could have... Just traded over Jigglypuff for it. That's okay. We... Look, Ponyard is so close. I'm just gonna not trade that Jigglypuff. Because... I'm training so hard to do it. But there's a lot of Pokemon. Noctowl, Amoongus, Jigglypuff, Gotharita, Trevenant, and Zoroark. That's a pretty cool Pokemon to catch here. In Hordes, we got Sudowoodoo, Full and Fungus. And there's no water Pokemon here. Okay. Well, wait. Do I bring an Eevee here? Let's take it to the same place. Okay. Um, well, let's catch a few things. Mm, yeah, let's catch a few things. Maybe I can get something evolved before we leave. Um, let's go ahead and start throwing balls here. Start throwing some Ultra Balls. Because I would like to get one thing evolved, and then I can switch it out with an Eevee. Preferably. Ooh. Alright, not Dowl. Nice and easy. I absolutely love it when that happens. Get her to 17. Its eyes are specially adapted to concentrate even faint light and enable it to see in the dark. Very cool. Let's try to get something else. Oh, no, no. oh Jigglypuff. Alright. And that's also. Um, we will need to probably grab Combi also. Um, Pokeball, Super Ultra Ball here. Because we'll need to grab Fungus and Pseudo Wudo. Hi, Jigglypuff. Don't make this hard, please. Just stay inside of the ball. There we go. Bum, bum, bum. Captivates foes with his huge round eyes and lulls them to sleep by singing a soothing melody. Alright, two out of the way. Four more to go. Minus four. It's... Already got you, Knocked Owl. You can go away. We ain't looking for you. We're looking for the now rarer Pokemon. Knocked Owl is the most common in this area at 30%. And we got a Jigglypuff with the 20%. We got a Moongus with 25 and everything else is 10 and under. Alright, we got the 10%. Trevenant. Trevenant. Very, very good PvP Pokemon in Pokemon Go. Ultra Ball time. Eat. Oh. Not nice. Spooky move. Very spooky indeed. Alright, Trevenant. Are you gonna cause me trouble, huh? Okay. There you go. Alright, Ultra Ball. Throwing them. That's how this works. One, two, psych. Powering up. And we keep going. Pokemon here just so we can get them back on the ground. Oh, Alright, 
Trevenant, stop being a butt cheek, dude. Just stay in the stupid ball. I don't know how many I've gone through. I'm looking at my phone, but there we go. Oh, why do you do these things? Why can't you just be normal like the rest of the kids? Just be normal. Well, gotta give it to him. It's a cool move, but I wish you'd stop using it and maybe try staying in the ball. That would also be pretty mega sick. For real. Hello? Maybe? Ah, there we go, Trevenant. After a couple minutes, you finally decide to stay. Very nice. Get on 18. If you control trees at will, they will trap people who are in the forest so they can never leave. Very spooky. Alright, we're looking for Among Us, Lothabita, Zoroark. Not you, Jigglypuff. You should go away. Even though you're pretty cool. And I don't know why they made the trade for Bisharp now, because I've been training it all this time. Slightly annoying. Owl. I don't really like Gen 2. I think uh, it was definitely like a downgrade from Gen 1. Um, not because I'm a Gen 1er, but because I generally think like the Pokemon aren't as cool. There's less of them. Um, yeah, I don't know. Alright, Among Us. Ultra Balls. Like, I just think like Pidgey was so much better than Octowl. I think a lot of the bug Pokemon are so much cooler. Um, Rattatel's cooler than uh, Zigzagoon. Um, the only thing Gen 2 had gone for is its legendaries. I think the legendaries in Gen 2 were much, much better. But that's like literally it. I, there we go, Among Us. I think the Pokemon themselves weren't that cool. Alright. Like, if, if I had to pick, like, all of the Pokemon from like the full like 1,000 at this point, not a single Pokemon on my team would be from Gen 2. A Chinchu is evolving. Boom, boom. All right. So I kind of wanted to evolve this while we were doing the waterfall mission, but it's I We evolved something to get it out of our box because we need to grab an Eevee anyway. So no biggie, no biggie. We got ourselves this thing. Don't know why they did this, why they made Chinchu a pretty cool Pokemon, Electric Water, into a Lantern Whale. No, um, uh, no, right, whatever, dude. Confuse Ray, sure, we'll get rid of Confuse Ray. I don't know why they just decided to make it fat and just call it a day. I think that was, you wait, they wasted a really, really cool opportunity with, um, Dude, just let me not learn it. They wasted a really good opportunity with Chin Chow. Okay, what are we close? Are we close? Skiddo, Sligu. When is Sligu evolving? Sligu. When are you evolving, bud? 50. Okay, we got a few more levels on everyone. What about Goodbye? 48. Okay, we got a few more levels, but we also got a few more Pokemon to catch here. Alright, but what I'll probably start doing is actually killing these things. So maybe I can get a few more levels on some other people going here. Okay, there is the Zoroark. Alright. Very cool. Time to start throwing balls, like we usually do. Bonk. Will Zoroark be really nice? First ball, alright. I knew I liked Zoroark. Yeah, cool, alright, here we go. Very nice. Skittle to 20. Synthesis, nah, I don't need synthesis. Skittle, why are you learning so many moves? 
I think we've just got it. We've evolved it like six times. It's learned like 17 moves. Each has the ability to fool a large group of people simultaneously. They protect their lair with illusionary scenery. I... Alright, here we go. Um, we got the Gotharina in front of us. We start chucking. And then... We got a few horde Pokemon that we gotta get, but um, I'll probably stay here and actually train for a little while. Thank you, Gotharina. I'll probably stay here and train for a little while to get some of the other people evolved. Uh, so while I do that, maybe I can just hit the horde Pokemon. Maybe we'll see. Starlight is the source of their power at night. They mark star positions by using psychic power to float stones. Very cool herself a horde just like we actually wanted to and we got the fungus so um i killed all the rest hopefully this fungus doesn't cause me that much trouble if it does i can't really attack it because i don't really have any pokemon that won't kill it at 25 actually wait i have skiddo i'm not gonna bring out skiddo just for this so it's fine fungus will stay in it no problem eh, there you go easy peasy So we just need actually the pseudo Udo now. And like I said, I'm gonna stay here and keep training, so that's fine. We could have very, very easily traded for one with a Jigglypuff, or we could take the super long route of getting it all the way to 52 on our own. I didn't know about the trade, so we did the hard way, which is fine though, because now I feel like this Bisharp like meant something. If we trained it from a wee lad up until now. There we go, a Bisharp. Pretty cool. Definitely, like, such a cool Pokemon. I love Bisharp. Okay. Cool. What else can we evolve? Sligu, the Bite, Skiddo. Okay. Maybe I'll stay here and keep training. Actually, let's go ahead and let's go heal. While we're healing, we might as well grab. Because I think Starmie's completely out of PP. So, we might as well just go back and just grab the other things that we need. Alright, Eevee evolved. So, Eevee should, theoretically, evolve in this spot over here. Right? Bob, yep, there we go. Eevee is evolving. And I guess we'll go ahead and run back again to the city and grab another Pokemon. Because I'm not going to... Again, the whole point is to like max, min max getting uh, XP. I'm not, I don't want to leave this EV in my party for a while and just absorb a bunch of XP that could go to a Pokemon that needs to evolve anyway. But we got ourselves a Leafeon. Very cool. I like Leafeon. Leafeon is pretty cool. Sure, let's go ahead and forget our Swift. We don't need Swift. That's not a very Swifty move. Very cool. All right, I totally forgot that we have Whalmer. Okay, Whalmer, I'd be very surprised if they couldn't learn Waterfall. So let's go ahead and just double check. Okay, well, there we go. All right, so we got another Pokemon that we can have Waterfall with. Yes, let's go ahead and... Does Mist actually do it? No, let's forget Mist then. We don't need Mist here. Okay. So last Pokemon, um, we can find Pseudo Udo. And then we could also, while we're at it, just actually explore the rest of um, this thing. So we could hopefully... We probably will end up fighting the Gym Leader just next episode because Sephiroth's taken a lot. Okay. Here we go. Um, Skiddo is evolving. Very cool. A little quicker than I thought it would, but I guess I underestimated quickly level 32 would kind of come about here. There we go. Got ourselves a Go Go. It's a pretty cool Pokemon. Actually, do like go go. Okay. Oh, that this took way too long. There's a random pseudo Udo in the middle of the tree chunk, so I don't know why that's the case, but I better not kill it. Okay, there we go. 
first ball, pseudo Udo. All right, there we go. Cool, and that is officially all of the Pokemon in this area. Officially. Although it always because of Yuchi, its composition appears more similar to a rock. Okay, so. Cool. Let's head back. We're gonna drop off Combi. We're gonna drop off. I don't think we actually have anything else to drop off. Alright, we'll draw back on for now. Okay, we should also probably go buy some more Pokeballs because we have thrown a lot of these. Let's go and buy 40 of them. Okay. Alright, guys, we'll go ahead and head into the woods next episode. I gotta go chill out and probably grab something to eat, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next episode. Hey, everybody, how's it going? We're playing some Pokemon. Last episode, we basically just caught all the Pokemon in Route 20. But now we actually have to go and, like, find the gym guy. I don't know what the gym guy is doing all the way out here, but apparently we have to go find him. So, we're going to try to keep the Pokemon away. Because I don't need the Pokemon. Okay, let's try to maybe get this item without an encounter, maybe? Now we're definitely going to have an encounter. That's alright. He thinks that we caught everything in here. Give me, like, a rare candy. Never mind. Just a paralyzed heal. Alright. Fair enough. What is this little... That little hair does... I think it's been there, like, this whole day today. Come on, bro. You really want to screw with me? Alright, here we go. Let's go downwards. <clears throat> I did not mean to walk into that grass. Alright, starting off the episode. Ha! We don't need any other Pokemon inside the grass. Unless there's an item in that corner. Okay. Oh, actually, maybe... Eh, oh, yeah, I, like, I could probably get away without an encounter there. <clears throat> a metal plate. Is that just, uh... Improve grass types? Is that what that does? Okay, you know what? I'm tired of playing these shenanigans. Um, let's use a magic pump. Huh? Let's play playing these games right now. <clears throat> Here. Okay, there's. Alright, well, let's take this fight. We're gonna be the toughest twins in the world. Sure. Hi. Show me what up. Nana Nina. <clears throat> With your. Oh, I don't like that sound. Oh, what level are they? These things are gonna be like. Level 50. Like, man, how do two little girls get two Pokemon up to level 50? That's nuts. <clears throat> Um, as far as food, uh, let's go for that. Little dragon thing. There we go. Didn't even die. Didn't even kill my partner. Look at that. Slagoo is an absolute homie. Alright, Honus 27. Whalemur 31. Brine, no. Whalemur does not need Brine. And I also grab bag on in between episodes. Um, so that's a thing. <clears throat> oh, we lost. It's okay. We're still gonna be the toughest twins in the world. Yeah, so bag on's one that I kinda like neglected there for a little while. So I went ahead and grabbed bag on back. Okay, I guess I'll fight this child. Hee <laughs> hee, you just ran into a girl who's head over heels for Pokemon battles. Alright. Winnie. Fairy tail girl Winnie. Um, I'm gonna give it a good old thunderbolt. I don't think it is it steel fairy. Is that what it is? I have no idea. I go bite to forty-eight. Extra twenty-eight. Bag on a seventeen. As a Marill. Okay. And a little Thunderbolt. Zap. Alright. Bacon, uh, 18. Girls in, girls in love don't mind if they lose. What are you in love with? 
Hey yo, we're getting our guard chomp. Look at that. All right. That's pretty exciting. I like guard chomp. Well, basically, like my favorite Pokemon in Pokemon Go. That's for sure, because I use it in like basically every raid battle. <laughs> Look at that. Get the guard chomp. That's so sick. I love guard chomp. Yeah. Um, let's go and get rid of takedown. I don't really need takedown here. Perfect. Very cool. Alright, let's continue. Hopefully we can get to the right place. Don't know what that big tree is, but... Okay, now I probably don't want to go that way. Um... Oh. Oh. You know what this place is? Welcome to the Pokemon Village. This place is secret, you know. Most of the Pokemon here are runaways, escaped from bad people who did awful things to them. It's a shame how many heartless trainers who can't bother to care for their Pokemon are out there. Some of these Pokemon, though, some of them are just too strong and found they didn't really have a place in the outside world. So they came here. Your Pokemon sure seem to think highly of you. You've had some good times together, haven't you? Hey, you can all come out now. This one's alright. Sometimes I get worried and come here to check on everyone. Oh, excuse my manners. We haven't even had a proper introduction yet. My name's Wolfric. I'm usually over at the gym in Snowbell, since I'm the gym leader and all. Let me guess, you want to challenge me? Yeah. I thought so. Sorry to convince you like this. I'll be waiting for you back at the gym, though. Before you come by, I think it would do you good to spend some time with the Pokemon here. Okay, but why? Okay, hold on. Let me check the Pokemon Village. Is there Pokemon to be caught here? Okay, there is Pokemon. The only one that I need, though, seem. Oh. Okay, there's three new Pokemon we can grab. Because there, there's the shaking areas, which are Bonnet and Garbodor. We need those. And then we can maybe get lucky and find a Ditto, too. Okay. Oh, it gave me something. Lit. Thank you. What about you? Are you going to give me something? Okay, so they're all gonna give me well, some of them are gonna give me something. What about you? What about you? Okay. Um, that's a Snorlax. Is there, like, anything I can, like, do here? Like, is there... Ooh, this thing probably has special... Yeah, see? Oh, that was a Pokemon. Give me a Pokemon, bud. Yes, let's go ahead and use another one. I'll grab that ditto later. What is... Okay, so this is a water area. I don't... I don't think I need... I don't need any of the, the water Pokemon here. Yeah, I don't. But let's see if there's anything... Oh, yeah, there's an item. Pixie plate. Nice. Pixie plate. Is there... Oh, there's a waterfall that... Oh, wait, I have Wilmer with me. So I can actually... Yeah. Do I need to teach Wilmer waterfall? Learn. Can I not go up this waterfall? I still don't have that badge. I keep forgetting that I do not have that badge. This is the unknown dungeon. Some terrifyingly strong Pokemon have made their homes in there. Only recognized champions of the Pokemon League are allowed to enter. Alright, that means I cannot. I mean. Hello? Okay. I already have a Snorlax, so I don't think I need it, but. Okay, is there anything else in here? I think that's it, right? So, what I need to do is run around to these trash cans. Is this the tire? I don't understand this place. This place is weird. 
Alright, one of you trash cans has to be moving. Come on. I need a Barbador. Barbador. Hey, there we go. That's the that's the Pokemon we're looking for here. Ditto. And I'm tempted to catch a couple. Well, maybe I just need two. Do I need two? Or just, or just need one? I'm guessing there's not more than one daycare center, right? I'm assuming. But I don't know if it might be a good idea to catch two. Maybe I'll just catch two for fun. If I find another one, I'll do it. Okay, but it's gonna probably... Oh, that's actually pretty strong. I forgot that I have a move that's technically good against me on my team. Or for I always say please and then I... They always get out. I don't, I don't know why I do that. I always screw myself over when I do that. Another off the ball. Here we go. Come on, bruh. Okay, Surf won't do that. Won't do that much. Don't tell me I'm gonna get killed by a ditto, dude. should get back in the habit of damaging Pokemon. Because this is ridiculous. The only reason I'm doing it is because in the beginning of the game, I was a little tight on money, so I had to be really careful. At this point, I've got, like, enough money to basically not care anymore. Alright. I'm, I'm willing to let Starmie die here. Please. Just stay in the ball, and then just make everyone happy, Ditto, please. No? Okay. Ah, well, there goes Starmie. Alright, that's a little, a little annoying. Well, I'll Slagoo, because I'm pretty sure I, Starmie doesn't have too many things that is, like, super good against it. If it gets caught now, dude, I swear. Didn't think so. Alright. Sir. That's not going to be effective in the slightest. Okay, so timer ball now. At this point, I think we've been here long enough. I think the timer ball would actually work. Please. Just do me a favor and be good. There we go. Yeah, alright, ditto. I have to use a timer ball on you. Never have got, never had to do that before. We're almost 32. As ability to reconstitute its entire cellular structure to transform into whatever it sees. I did it. You're going to box too, bud. If there's anything else to particularly do in here, um, again, I know I can get Garbodor, but not from the trash cans. I just don't know how to make those trash cans shake, and I'm not going to sit here and forever to try to figure it out. So we can kind of just make our way out of here. Um. Now, I don't know how I got here in the first place, but I'm pretty sure this is the route back. I could also just probably fly there, but... If I can, like, somehow maybe find... It's like, what is this? Oh, before we do that, I should also switch out a Pokemon, right? I think, didn't I? Oh, yeah, I had Garchomp evolved. Okay, and I guess we can also grab a Pokemon for now. So that'll be a decent set of Pokemon we can level up while we take on this gym. Alright, let's go ahead and do that. Not one another. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Okay. <laughs> well, I don't know why it didn't let me through the door. Snowbell City Gym. I'm guessing you're gonna have a bunch of... Wait, 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 wait. What is... Ice weaknesses in Pokemon? I always forget. Fire, rock, steel, fighting. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Starmie doesn't have any of that. Okay, cool. Very nice. What's the, what's the dice, Chunk of Ice? How's my favorite future champ? As you can see, the Snowball City Gym is the place to be if you love ice types. But you've already seen seven badges from gym leaders across Kalos, right? I'm sure you don't need any hints from me. Am I right? Am I right? One more to go, huh? Go show them what you're made of, champ. Well, this is it? Okay. I didn't I didn't know if there was a, another one after this. Hey, they call me the Queen of the Ice Rink. Wait, do they? No. Do they? Ace Trainer... 
Imelda. Alright, again, I don't have any fire, rock... Oh, wait! Wait, 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 I'm a hard tripping. I have... Um, power gem. Totally forgot. Oh, don't do that. Don't steal my stuff. Butt cheek, get away from me. Alright, there you go. Bacon and 19. Oyster. Nope. Very cool. Um, power gem. Oyster is another one. I think I need. I don't. I don't know. I don't think I've grabbed it yet. But that's alright. I'll mention 29. Slash. No, you don't need slash. You're fine. You're not gonna. I'm not gonna use it as a battler anyway. So. A lot of level ups. Colder than cold, faster than fast. You can eat my cheeks. Can I still fight you? I still want to fight you. Oh, do I what? Okay. Oh, okay. Now I can go and fight this guy if I want. Okay. He's right there. Don't tell me what to do. Victor. Gross. Okay, seems like this is gonna be the only gem where power gem is actually useful. Which is cool, I guess, because power gem has like not been good this entire like game, so. Alright, bag on a 20. Nope. You don't need to focus your energy. Pursuit. Nope. Alright, Mammal Swine. That's pretty cool. I think I have a Peel of Swine, but... I don't know how to get it to Mammal Swine. I could probably Google it in the next 30 seconds. I'll figure it out later. Ooh! Okay. Big Goku by lots of HP. Not want to die. Oh, I probably could use another move just to save some PP, but it's alright. Not a big deal. Alright. Start me to 88. Conench to 30. Elmer to 33. Bacon to 21. Tyrant to 22. Krogan to 16. Seven, everyone's getting a level up. All right, cool. You, you love to see it. You love to see it. You're f you frozen my heart solid. That's my name. Um. Oh, okay. Then I need I need to do this bonk. So that switches up. No, that can't be right. All right, one more. Nope. That is still not right. I'm confusion. Yes. Okay, here we go. Then I go bink bonk, bink bonk, bink bonk. Very cool. Okay, I can't go to that one, so I need to go to this one. I look cool down and clear my head with a refreshing chilled dessert. Here, let me give you a taste. I don't want a taste. H trainer Shannon. Alright, Fragnum. I got one of those. Time to power gem you. I'm gonna throw rocks at your head. Apparently that's what Sparky was doing. Chucking rocks. Ooh, okay, what do I got next? Who, who you got? Who you got? Man, I love I love these end game. Um and like they end part of the game when like I get a lot of levels very quickly because you get like level ups every single second you can evolve Pokemon at a much quicker rate than at the beginning of the game you know at the beginning of the game I was pretty much stuck with like evolving Weedles and um, stuff like that but now you know I can grab things that evolve at usually like 30 to 40 and they can still be pretty easy to get leveled up now because I'm, you know, I'm not near the end of the game, which is cool. Alright, Bacon to 22, Coke going to 19. 
Jinx. You know, one of those too. And I actually had a baby Jinx too. Yeah, throw some rocks at your head. Bonk, 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 bonk. Oh, I like, did it die? Oh, okay. I was like, Jinx doesn't have sturdy. What? What in the world? Tyrant to 24. Pogunk to 20. I could really go for an ice cold sherbet right now, bro. Get me a. Um, what is it called? Hold on. Being able to keep your cool no matter the situation is a trademark of the truly powerful. Um. So, dude. Sour? Not sour, man. Well, the thing that they're sweet and then they're gone, or they're sick. What? And sour Patch Kids? Holy jeez, man. Sour Patch Kids. I'm like, how do I not think of... S I'm losing it, bro. I need to drop out of school right now. I'm losing it. Um, yeah, a Sour Patch Kids... Like, Sherbet? Sorbet? It's pretty lit. No, Wilmer, you do not need to remove all the water spout. You'll be fine. I fake in a 23. Ooh, vanillix. Unpopular opinion. I actually really like vanillix and vanillish. And all of those moves. Moves. Those Pokemon. I'm a fan. I love ice cream. Honestly, a lot of people have always like had a problem with objects being Pokemon. Honestly, I've never minded objects being Pokemon. I've always minded just very generic Pokemon. You got my blood boiling now. I think this ice is gonna melt. Or really dumb looking Pokemon. Perfect example, which we talked about a couple episodes ago. Um, Lantern or uh, Lant uh, Chimchu's evolution. It looks so dumb. It's inc like why? Like why would you make that? Um, so it's stuff like that that I actually have a problem with more um, than like objects. Like I like Gardevoir, I like Bucky, I like all of those Pokemon. Wait, wait, wait! Oh. Oh, I should have left it there. Alright, well, let's, let's... Wait, I'm um, literal dummy. I could just go over the middle. Alright, okay, here we go. Up the big tall stairs to the Ice Man. You know what? Ice is both extremely hard and terrible fragile at the same time. You know what that means. Depending on which Pokemon you choose and what moves they use, I could be your most challenging opponent yet, or I could be a total pushover. That's alright. That's how it should be. Anyway, enough of my rambling. Let's get this show on the road. You'd love to see it, dude. Just a little party smack. Alright, Wolfric. Also, Wolfric, you are very bad at wearing clothing correctly. But it's alright. I still love you. Oh, only he only has three Pokemon. I was gonna say I might be running out of power gems here, but nah, looks like I'll be fine. Right, I'm gonna throw some rocks at your head. There you go. Bone Edge 32. No. Ooh, wait, does Honage evolve here? For some reason, I have an inkling that it's either 32 or 36, but I forgot. It might be 36. Ancient power, sure. You can get rid of charm. Krogunk to 22. Revenge, no. Krogunk, revenge is not good. Of course, I'm gonna get smacked in the face by hail every single time, but it's alright. Avalug, very cool. Actually, I like Avalug quite a bit. For some odd reason, it like almost reminds me of Bakugan, and I don't know why. But I just, I love Bakugan. I mean, not anymore. I mean, as like a kid, I love Bakugan, but um, yeah, I like Avalug. I don't. I guess I don't have a particularly reason why, but I do like Avalug quite a bit. And another Triagonal. Alright. Not, not a very hard fight. Oh. That can kill me? No. Okay, fair enough. But I was close. So I also got hit in the head with some hail. 
Okay. Please do not let the hail kill me. <laughs> that would not be very... Are you just gonna keep healing yourself? That's not very nice of you. Oh, nice, okay. Never mind, I'm like, dude, I'm gonna die from the stupid hail. All right. He ran out of hyper potion soon. Oh, and of course the last one was a crit. It couldn't, it couldn't have crit it earlier, huh? 35. Bacon at 25. Oh, yeah, you don't bacon, you don't need ember. Honestly, ember is like a good move right now, but like, you're not, you're, it's not gonna be later. Outstanding, I'm as typhon as an iceberg, but you smashed right through. Thanks for the 10k, buddy boy. Impressive, your Pokemon follows great courage. I can tell you you've trained your Pokemon very well. Alright, we got the ice badge, or what is it called? Iceberg badge. Iceberg, of course, the iceberg badge. What you have right there is called the iceberg badge. As long as you have that, any and all of your Pokemon will surely look up to you and do their absolute best in battle. Let me give you this too. Ice beam, hey yo. Ice beam is probably pretty good. You know what this is? It's ice beam. This move is more has an accuracy of 100%. Not only that, but every once in a while it will freeze the target too. Hope you learned a valuable lesson today. Being rigid can make you tough, but also render you fragile. You're better off being flexible. You know what I mean? These people are fluid like water and can act with the environment without changing what's important on the inside. Not me, though. I guess I'm too stubborn. Maybe that's why I love ice types. Alright, bud. You can stop talking now. Ooh, look at that. Squid game? Well, actually, I can't because there's only a single line, but... This is pretty cool. I like these gems. Ooh, what did I press? I... If I push my thing forward, I press a button on act, and I don't know what it is, but... Ooh. The future champ I know and love. Looks like you chumped our old gym leader. It's never a bad thing to test the limits of your strength. Am I right or am I right? And since you're such a star, I guess that means you're off to the Pokemon League. You know what? You have all the gym badges now, so there's really only one thing left to do. Time you headed off to the Pokemon League. Listen up now. Trust in your Pokemon, and there's no limit to what you can achieve. Alright. Cool. Well. Um, let me go. Let's actually run back inside of the forest, because there was a little area. You can have enter- uh... Sorry, what am I doing? I'm like reading the bottom, so I can't walk. There was a little waterfall area. We should now be able to go on it. Word. Time to show off her Pokemon. Okay. And he has one Pokefang Cory with the Dedenne. All right. What a classy individual we got here. And the Dedenne is all we need. Nothing else. Ooh, and I've also got no HP. I should probably fix that. to 33. Going up to 24. Swagger. Nah, you don't need swagger. You got us. Your Pokemon are just about as cute as ours. You've only got one, so I... yeah. Anyways. Okay, let's go ahead and upload a repel here. Yeah, it's going to use a repel, and I might actually need to buy more too, because it looks like we're running low. Alright, we found ourselves a protein. Anything else in here that I just, like, missed? Yes, please. Waterfall, por favor. Okay. Yes, let's so use another. All of that for... That's a good move, though. That is a very good move. Okay, I, now I know why they hit it all the way up here. Okay. Amazing. Let's go ahead and teach that to start me basically right away here. Psychic. Yes. Okay. Yes. Star me. That's like the move Star me's been missing. Okay, but now we have to get rid of something. That's the sad part. I honestly think. 
we should probably get rid of Rock Gem. Yeah. Because I need water. I need Psychic. And then there's just so many tough dragons that I need a fairy type move. So. Okay. An Ice Beam would be also be cool, but I don't really... But again, now that's the opposite. I don't... Ice is not super, super useful um, in battles. Like like the psychic or a fairy is but oh wait the real question oh actually because there's another route to our right but what we're gonna do is actually we're gonna make our way back to the other town um so i can waterfall there and i think get whatever item um professor was talking about which i'm pretty sure is a gerdesite i'm pretty sure i don't know so anyway um I'll head over to the town, but um, you guys don't need to watch me, so I'll end up the episode here, guys. Thanks for watching. Hey, everybody. How's it going? We're playing some more Pokemon. We just defeated the last gem, and now we're able to use Waterfall. So, very quickly, I ran over to this town, and I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to get a pretty cool item if we go up this Waterfall. And then after this, we'll head back to Snowville, or whatever, Snowbell. Um, go to Route 21. Okay, Rock Slide. Um, I don't know why they made me get Waterfall before finding Rock Slide. Doesn't seem like that cool of a reward. TBH? Um, but it's alright. Okay, so up the stairs in the southeast town. I'll try to look for it for like two seconds. If I can't find it, I'll get bored. All of that herb burn here. Yeah. All right, bud. Pink. Over to Route 21. Okay. I've been with my Pokemon partner since the very beginning of our journey. That's good. Mariel. Mariel. And I don't want to say these. Also. You know what I've wondered, why don't the developers ever make some of these trainers as Pokemon, um, shiny? I feel like in all of our trainer battles, I've never seen, like, a shiny Pokemon. I wonder, can they be randomly shiny? I feel like it'd be, like, something really cool to, like, you know, see a shiny Pokemon in a trainer battle. Like, I don't know, I feel like, for especially for, like, maybe new kids that have never played this game, you know, seeing one, they might, like, what is that? And then they could, you know, go down the rabbit hole of shiny hunting and stuff. I don't know. I know, um... Yeah, I know, like, starters can be shiny and stuff like that, too, but... I don't know if your, like, your opponent's teams can be shiny. I went to 28. Went to 25. My partners have been on my side for every defeat. Okay. Nothing there. Okay. Let's start getting some Pokemon. Altaria. Okay. Very cool. I love Altaria and Pokemon Go. Another one of those Pokemon that um, I have quite a few shinies of. Even though there's never been like a community or anything, I've just I've ran into a lot of shiny Swablus. One. Okay. So. Yeah, I like Artaria. Very, very, like, strong and fast attacker. Very brittle, but a very fast attacker. It very much outclassed in the current meta. Okay. Um, like, nowadays, you just... You can't really beat, um, just like a Registeel with, uh, Azumarill... Or Trevenant's pretty good. What else am I using? There's one. I'm forgetting one, and I don't know how I'm forgetting one, but it's okay. Um, Swampert's pretty good, too. Alright, it flies gracefully through the sky. It's melodic coming makes you feel like you're in a dream. Okay. 
Do I have a Pokemon with strength? I, I don't think I don't. Bonk. Bonk. Yeah, we can't. Okay, no, we can't surf there. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Bonk. And okay, now we just gotta move it all the way there. Gonna take a little, little hot minute. Sigh. I'm checking my emails while doing that. We're getting there. We're getting there, don't worry. Monk trainers, words are unnecessary, wouldn't you say? Hippoduan, Aurorus, battle time, show them your strength. Veteran Louise. Louis? I don't know. Louise is a girl's name. I think it's Louis. I don't know, man. English is hard. Okay. This is gross. That's gonna surf you up. Don't do that. That's a really gross move. Why would you do such a thing? Just let me get buffeted or beaten by the standstorm. Bonk. Oh, no, 34. Well, we're to 36. Krogon to 26. Rorus. I don't like their battle cry. It's a weird battle cry. What is it? What is this? I don't know. I'm just gonna use a dazzling beam. I, I forgot what typing this is. Oh, rock ice. Oh, so I can't use rock ice? What is good against rock? Okay, surf is good against rock. There we go. Bacon at 27. You really showed me the strength of your body and spirit. Impressive. What is this place? If you wish, I could teach your Pokemon the strongest Dragon type move. Yes. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Okay. That's the stupidest advice I've ever heard. You want to know where post your Pokemon? You just gonna spend time with him. Yeah, obviously genius. You think I couldn't figure that out on my own? Alright, we got a Fold Soul. Alright, we got a Fold Soul. Do not need you. Go away. We just need a Scyther, Spinda, and Ursaring. Ursar... Ursar... Ursaring. Ursaring. Dude. <laughs> Well, so leave me alone, dude. I've seen way too many pretzels already in this game. I need you. Okay. Hop on the water. I don't think I need actually. I don't need anything on the water. Okay. Repeat ball, and I'm pretty sure. There's. Is there a berry and an item, or just the berry? Oh, looks like it's just the berry. Okay. Well, I think we taught Hone Edge Cut, which is good. Got ourselves a Figgy Berry. Everybody loves some Figgy Berries. Let's jump back. Skirt. Ooh. I want to jump in the grass there. Okay. Very cool. Let's head back. Once you've memorized all the Pokemon moves and abilities, victory comes naturally. A strong Pokemon and a strong trainer come together to form a team. It's that simple. Alright, Ace, Duo, Alina, and Sean. Ooh. That's a little bit of a funky combo you got there, bud. Because my Surf will not be good against either of them. Mm, Alright, well then I might actually have to target them individually. Um, oh, now I'm using Pone Edge. Well, with Bone Edge, let's go ahead and... I don't have... Oh... Let's just keep Bone Edge out then. 
I don't know. Let's just, uh, what does Retaliate do? Uh, let's just Retaliate. That's fine. I need to hold to stay alive just for a little while here. Stun spore. Oh, why'd you have to stun stun me though? That's gross. Okay. No, 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 no. Alright, we can probably use psychic. That actually might not be very effective, but that's alright. Battle dance, that's not good. Not good at all, considering it was a crit too. Alright, Cone Edge, cut him. <laughs> Alright, now oh, that kinda sucks. Alright, Whalmer. Let's get let's get my own whale out here. A little less stronger of a whale. Actually, that was probably a terrible idea because um, that is a bio boom. So that was a little bit of a bad idea. Alright, let's just use a fury cutter. It doesn't particularly matter. Because Whalmer is definitely gonna die. Wonderful. Okay, now you've done confuse yourself, bud. Look what you've done. Okay. Starmie. Let's go ahead and try to finish this off here. And let's go ahead and give a... I still want Whalmer to get XP, so let's go ahead and hit a revive here. Please, Starmie can take care of it. Right, very good. Very good. Let me see. On edge to 35. Night Slash. Sure, we can teach you Night Slash. Go ahead and get, get rid of Retaliate. Cool. Amnesia? No, you don't need Amnesia. Bacon at 28. Sure. Okay, now let's get rid of Bide. Bide is better. You get rid of Ellie's. Abracadabra, Hocus Pocus. Hey, we, I just watched Hocus Pocus. Hey, yo, Kona is evolving. I gotta watch Hocus Pocus 2. Soon, hopefully. There we go. Now we got two swords instead of one. Congratulations, your phone has evolved into a dub blade. Dub blade. Did we miss anything down here? Oh, okay, no, I don't think we did. Okay. Well, okay. Is this the way to just the town? Okay, I don't need to go that way. I I have more Pokemon to catch. I still have Spinda. There's one of them that I still need. And I need Scyther and I need Earth Serene. Alright. Time to start chucking balls. Now what else do I need still? Oh, I need to get um, a Dratini and a Dragonair. Spinda, you... Why, why do all Pokemon do this to me? I feel like I've gotten like an absurd amount that have wiggled three times. Like an absurd amount. But then again, I haven't played a mainstream Pokemon game in a while, so maybe I'm just helping. It's likely the case. See, if it jumps out... I right, thank the lord. Ooh, I can get a Swablu out of Hordes. Should probably do that. Probably. No two spins have the same pattern of spots. It's tottering steps. Ooh, okay. You confuse your foes by stepping in weird directions. That's not like the best attribute to have, but hey, okay, fair enough. Alright, we're looking for Scyther or Ursaring. Dude, Ursaring is a 40%. How have we not encountered an Ursaring yet? It seems like actually weird, right? I feel like we've had at least like 10 to 15 encounters. So that's like what? That's. Or, I can't, I got, I don't, I don't, I don't know if do the math here, but it's probably pretty high. Very, okay, dude, this is actually getting nuts. 
I mean, I guess I don't mind not being on a string, but still. It just seems a bit fishy. Seems a bit weird. Alright? Or a string, baby, baby. Nope, it's another Altaria. Alright. Looks like we're gonna be here for. I'm gonna be here a hot second. It's a correct Pokemon. Do not seem to wanna pop up. Hey, you're serene. There you are, bud. Alright. Alright, we're gonna start checking balls. Ultra Ball. Scary face. really looking for that Scyther, and then once I get the Scyther, I'll pull out my fishing rod, and we'll start looking for the Dratini. Now, honestly, I might not even go for the Dragonair. I think I'll just catch the Dratini and go, and then level it. With its ability to distinguish any aroma, it unfailingly finds food and campgrounds. Okay. Alright, Scyther, last one. Okay, really quickly, in a horde, I just... Hot Swablu. For some reason, it likes to land on people's heads softly and act like it's a hat. What other horde? Oh, that's actually the only horde. Because Scyther and Spindor are the only two other horde Pokemon, and I don't particularly need either of them. Okay, here we go. There is a Scyther. Let's go ahead and throw the ball at its head. Stay in the ball, por favor. Thank you, Scyther. There we go. What a nice and easy Pokemon. Just stays in the ball. Wonderful. It's, it tears and sheds prey with its wickedly sharp scythe. It very rarely spreads its wings to fly. Interesting. Okay. Where is the ne nearest body of water? Was it? Oh, there was water up here. No? Yes. Okay. Let's go ahead and... We need the old rod. Yes. We need the old rod here. Um, that was much, much, much quicker than I thought. It uh, was only like my fourth good rod cast. Hey, I mean, yeah. We take those any day of the week. And for Spulk, all right, hey, all right, not gonna complain at all. You, you, you love to see it. All right. No problem. You do not need Mud Bomb. Dratini has been added to Pokédex. It is called the Mirage Pokémon because so few people have seen it. Its shed skins have been found. Interesting. Very rare Pokemon indeed. Oh, okay, we got an encounter. Even though I don't need it. Unless you were like a shiny Scyther. Take it. That is officially all of the Pokemon on this route that are new. So, we can make our way out. We are done here. Now, I don't know if we just go... Is this like the Victory Road or what? I mean, hey, I guess let's go start, shut up and start walking. Oh, okay. The gate to the... Uh, okay. Alright, you have eight. Oh, he's... He's gonna test my abilities? Robbie? Alright. Did not expect that. Alright. What do you got, Robbie? Carbink. Um, what is that? I don't know what that is. Is that ice 
Ice rock or something? I don't know. Is that a fairy? Alright, well, apparently water is effective, so look at that. Raichu, okay, another Pokemon that is susceptible to water. Very cool. Alright, what's next? Ooh, Starmie's level 90. Look at that. Wilmer 38. And Kingdra, a water Pokemon, which we have lightning for. Cool. Get zapped. Ooh, not gonna die. Alright. This might be pretty strong, actually. Ooh, not strong enough there, bud. I'm surprised Robbie didn't use like a hyper potion there. Seems like it's something that Robbie should have done, but it's alright. Oh, I need to get rid of Dublade. Forgot that that is he is now fully evolved, so I can get rid of it. You and your Pokemon have tremendous power. Keep on surging into the future. Okay, so oh, okay, okay, Bagon is evolving into. What will be shell gone, which is pretty cool. Very nice. Right, now we got ourselves a little little dragon and a burrito or airbag looking thing. Must be just growing its wings, huh? Ah, uh, no, you don't. You don't. Yeah, okay, whatever. Fine. We'll we'll. We'll teach it protect that. Don't really need it, but it's just the fastest way to get out of this thing of dialogue. Fantastic. Please let me say once more. Fantastic. May the road you and your Pokemon follow be filled with joys and success. All right. What is over? Here? Is this Lemoise or what? Where? Where? Cause I remember this. Where? What? Let's go ahead and put some stuff away. So we can deposit. Let's go ahead and deposit the blade. Got so many filled boxes, holy. Alright. Um Man, so many of these Pokemon evolve pretty soon. Things. Let's go ahead and uh, we don't need too many, but we need we need a couple. Um Probably need a couple more of these. Especially for the victory road. Revives. Probably need a couple more of those. Full restores. Get ten of those. Okay, we'll leave it at that. What about you? What do you sell, bud? Okay, I don't need any of those. What are you doing in here? Okay, well that's obvious. Alright, well, we can technically head to the Victory Road now. Cause yeah, we have nothing nothing really else to do here. Um We'll probably have to go into the Victory Road, we'll evolve Pokemon, we'll head back, and just because the Victory Road is a really good place to get some XP and stuff. But um hmm. Okay. Let's at least see kind of what's going on here. Zoom. Big old door, huh? Okay. A little much on the stairs there, bud, but okay. Now we enter the victory cave. Oh, right away we... Alright, let's do like one trainer fight, why not? I just want to spend time with my Pokemon, but everyone keeps challenging me to battles. I ran all the way here and yet I still can't find any peace and quiet. This is a very bad place to find some peace and quiet. Um, Alonza. Alright, what do you got? Ooh, a Weevil. It's a pretty good Pokemon. To be honest, I don't have uh, the gem stones anymore, but... Um, I think I could just use Psychic, maybe. 
Nope. That is the very wrong move. I do not want to use Psychic. How about a Dazzling Gleam, huh? Maybe this? There we go. That's super effective. I can see that you and your Pokemon trust each other very much. Okay. Really can't get out there. Uh, let's see what Pokemon they have up here. Can we meet some new? Geodude board. Alright. Um, I do not need Geodude. Um, but what, what, what I will do is Surf, because then I can just kill them all at once. Wait, they might have... Okay, guys. Um, I'm actually gonna call it here. We'll do the rest of the Victory uh, Road next episode.